Cheers. Sorry, I'm just chuckling away at Adam. Oh, it's Wednesday and look who we got. Hello. It's gorgeous, <laughs> Monica. How are you doing, lovely? I'm just going to turn everybody over to the gallery. Thank you. I'm, all, I'm really good. The sun is shining. Yes, which is always good. It's a beautiful day. Some might say, true British, so I'm going to be British. So British. It's too hot. It's far too hot. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not complaining. Well, it's quite nice to have the thunderstorms. Though. Oh, I love the thunderstorm. Yeah. It's much better than when it's kind of constantly raining. Isn't yeah, it? Just yeah. Have a big when, thunderstorm. When you have fat then. rain. Yeah. It is, <laughs> yeah. That's what I always call it, fat rain. When it like you can hear the big dense drops. That's yeah. lovely. That is lovely. Um, and my goodness me, have we got a lovely Wednesday for you? Firstly, we've got Monica with all oh. her oodles of inspiration and beautiful jewellery, amazing kits. Yes. Yes, I really had fun. I was just saying to Al uh, earlier that um, I can't stop making. <laughs> yeah, if you send Monica <laughs> duplicates of her kit, she will. You will make using both of your kits, won't yeah. you? Yes, I will. I usually only stop when I've used most of my beads up. <laughs> I mean, well, that's a good sign, isn't it? It's that good, tells yeah. us that you like the kits. Yeah, of which course. is a good thing. Of course, yeah, you know, yeah. if you only came in with maybe one piece, then yeah. It's like, mm, yeah. <laughs> We might be a little bit more concerned. Yeah. Um, but my goodness me, lovely jewellery. I can see also the 12 o'clock kits are amazing. Yeah. Um, so we have got some lovely shell pearl mm -hmm. coming up in the 12 o'clock. Yeah. Lots of beautiful gemstones um, and sterling silver components in the 9 o'clock, which is what you're looking at right now. Yeah. Just a vision of colour. Yes. Amazing. Well, that's, that's great for summer, isn't it? Oh, yeah, definitely. Definitely. I think you definitely need to brighten up your accessories during the summer oh, months. Absolutely, absolutely. It's a good excuse, isn't it? Um, and also, your deal of the day, and Ross and I were mentioning this earlier on, weren't we, Ross, that I genuinely think that we could count, on one hand, the amount of times that we've actually brought you this variety of gemstone. Now, you know turquoise, of course you do, and you know that there's turquoise deposits all around the world. However... Kingman Turquoise, firstly, is the oldest location of source. They estimate oh, right. this is the, you know, the, you know, when we talk about the history of it, it's more than likely from this location that they're talking about. Kingman Turquoise, it's still very much operational and still hailed as one of the finest producing mines in the world for turquoise. But genuinely, I think we've brought it to air maybe a handful of times in different strands, etc., or maybe even calibrated sizes. So um, it's rare for us to bring it to you. And let me explain why that probably is. Firstly, it's usually very expensive. Um, secondly, when you have that history, that legacy, um, everybody wants to get hold of it. So it m must make it quite challenging for our buying team. The strand is up, or strands, I should say, because there's two, are in one of the, again, more difficult shapes to actually uh, offer you, and that is in rounds. The reason for that, it's very wasteful. Rounds are very, very wasteful. They normally come at a premium. This is some of the most beautiful, intense sky blue turquoise. It's their long strands as well. I was just going to say, the colour on those is Amazing, epic. aren't they? <laughs> yeah. Um, and we're going to talk at length. That's at 10 o'clock today is your deal of the day. But let me just remind myself for a second... Oh, my goodness, there is quantity of these, though, Ross. Ooh. There's good quantity, um, which, again, is very rare for us to actually bring you big quantities of it. Um, now, there's also a first time ever, never done before, brought you type A black jadeite, haven't we? Never brought it to you in a bundle. Ooh. And this is going to... Oh, knock your socks off. It's stunningly beautiful. It's not just any old black jade. This is faceted, wow. a bundle of faceted black jade. So this is coming up um, in the 10 o'clock hour. So you can't, you can't get it just yet. Um, it's very, very, very limited. But the price that we are taking this entire bundle to, you're going to make a huge saving, hundreds of pounds on this. Um, because we always say whenever we put it in a bundle, you get you know pound, significant pound signs back into your pocket. So, yes, these are coming up in the 10 o'clock hour. Limited opportunity. If you're a fan of your black jadeite, which I don't know many people who aren't, um, then make sure you're watching for this one because hundreds of pounds are coming off that price point. That is already amazing. Even when we bring them to you individually, they're ama amazing prices, aren't they? But in a bundle, you get even further savings. Um, but it's a really lovely show full of real variety because I've got loads of beautiful gemstones to bring you of colour. We've got amazing pearls. We've got 
Yeah, we've got sterling silver. We've got master carvings. I need to show you this though. Let me just grab my tweezers for a second um, because this is something that Ross mentioned. I've not seen this before, Ross. It's absolute. Have. have you? I have, yes. Did you buy this? I did, yes. I don't blame you. It's absolutely amazing. amazing. So, you know, you know the bundle of black jadeite? Can you imagine this? Ah. Oh. Did you know? Ross is saying, I knew, I knew that Elle was going to love it. It's very, very limited. But can you imagine that jadeite bundle? In fact, stay there. Oh. Imagine that as a kit. See, now I'm going to have to get the jadeite bundle to go with my pendant. I think, I think well, <laughs> you know what, Monica? You're going to be saving more than you're spending because I'm just going to add to that bundle a oh, second. Look imagine that. that. Oh, my gosh. Imagine those components all put together. Wait a minute. I might just add to it once again. How about, how about oh, something like this? Yes. Yeah. Um, it's all coming your way today in an absolutely epic, epic show. But like I said, this is going to be quite limited. What time are we doing this pendant, the, the panther pendant? We'll do it. That's right. You did just say that. Um, during the 10 hour, we'll do it with the black jade. Because that makes sense, doesn't it? Makes total sense. Your early birds this morning, zzz, plural. We've got last few opportunities in your multicolored pearl bundle. Take advantage of this because there's three strands of natural multicolored pearls in this bag and you also get this. There's only 14 chances left though um, and once they're gone, remember it's also June. So Pearl 10 oh, yes. gets you a further 10% uh, off. Um, that's why we're bringing you as many pearls as we possibly can during your live TV shows. So you can make the most of these opportunities. So look at that. You've got three beautiful half drills um, and you've got the three natural strands in that lovely pochette. Plus another early bird, another gemstone we rarely see. And I also think would look lovely with your Kingman turquoise. Oh, um, nice. It's beautiful rhodonite. Oh. I love it. It's like strawberries and cream. I strawberries do. and peaches yeah i love it too it's such a it's such a sort of mm, ice warming cream. pink isn't yeah, it yeah it's like an ice creamy color yeah. isn't it and that's totally and utterly natural now we've got quantity of this it, some might even describe it as a mega auction quantity um a gemstone we seldom see we really really ever see it you can shop ahead and pre-order and secure yours right now. These are six millimeter rounds. There's just over 200 of these available. And believe me, we're going to take this to an early bid price point that you are not going to want to miss out on. Isn't that right? Isn't that right, Roscoe? Yes, he says. He says, well, if you have a little look at the website, all the wubbleoos at jewelrymaker.com, and you click watch live just in the top right hand side of the screen, and then you can scroll down. There it is. There it is. Item number one. It is not going to be closing at that's nine pounds. a really good price. It's a great price yeah. for a genuine gemstone, a gemstone we rarely see on our screens. Nine ninety nine, nowhere near your price point. So I would encourage shopping ahead, um, not only because you guarantee your success, but also it eases the pressure on our amazing call center team. So, um, but not just the road night. If you have a little look down the website, there's lots. All your eight o'clock hours locked and loaded. Some will be going even lower. Um, some will be set at that price point. You can drop us a message into the studio if there's something that you would like me to bring to air. Um, but yes, yeah, me drop us a message, come and say hello, um, and you can see all those beauties that are going to be included. But remember, they're only available until nine o'clock. Now, just before I bring your first item, your wall of fame is in the 12 o'clock hour. We're going to do that at midday. And remember, we've got the drawer as well. So um, we'll do the wall of fame, then we'll do the drawer, and then we'll get into your masterclass. So yes, um, for those of you that are waiting for that, we'll do it at 12 o'clock today. Shall we get cracking? Shall we? It's going to be an absolutely epic. And it's lovely and air-conditioned in here. Yes. <laughs> oh. um, we're going to start with one of the most crazy deals, says Ross. The four... Blue bus here. Uh. <laughs> I know... I mean, it, did, it did say four poles. <laughs> it didn't say four... <laughs> Oh, complete. I'm just vacantly <laughs> looking around on the blue bus cell. On the blue bus cell. On the blue bus. <laughs> oh, these. Right. Sorry. Yes. <laughs> I apologise. Um, now, these are complete necklaces. Now, um, Ross says he was ashamed of himself. Oh, Ross. He says, now, 
He goes, I didn't set the price. It was Liam Dickens. Look at you naming and shaming him once again. <laughs> um, he says, look, I just, I don't want to see him again because this is far too low in terms of the price point. You've got to consider these are sterling silver. They are genuine pearls. Um, the colored ones are completely natural. They are complete. And um, what Ross is saying, look, if it was me launching them, you wouldn't have seen the price point that, that, that he took them to, 100%. And he's all about deals, believe me. He says this is ridiculous, though. Yes, I, I don't. Was, I was here when he did that. I think it was last Wednesday. Do you remember? Yes, and he was like, "They let me loose on jewelry maker." Okay. <laughs> Look at yeah. See, he doesn't care. Liam just doesn't care. He doesn't care. He has. There's not going to be any repercussions. <laughs> we did do one very similar. Um, I remember. Yes, I do. Yes, they were fifty nine ninety nine, and that's for all four necklaces, which is amazing. That's 15 pounds £15 each. That's amazing. These are complete necklaces. Let me just show you. Look, it comes with the bolt ring clasp and you've got a sterling silver extender chain there. So that's, yes, rock bottom prices. Liam was all about, he was, all, he was making friends that day, wasn't he? Yeah. If they were individuals, you wouldn't be paying 15 pounds, even here at Jewelry Maker. And that's saying something. They are 925. They are genuine cultured pearls. You know, these beautiful, look at these, these pink pearls here. Natural, they're not dyed, you know, not bleached and dyed. They are totally and utterly natural. And we were saying as well, Monica, when I relaunched these, you know, to make them. You couldn't yeah. make them at the price that, you'd probably struggle at what's on your screens right now. Because you would need, uh, I was saying as well, that you would need two meters of stunning silver chain. And you would need the little, um, well, or you would need the chain with the little stations on because it's got the little uh, silver beads on there as yeah. well. You would need four sterling silver clasps, four sterling silver extension chains with a heart tag on them. And you would need, well, if you wanted to make four different colors like these are, um, or two different colors at least, you would need a couple of strands of Don't forget gold. the sterling silver wire as well. Uh, and of course the wire. You yeah, would. so you'd have to buy all those components, yeah. even without factoring your time. Liam, we love Liam really. He didn't close them here, didn't stop here. Good morning, Angela. Just received these. They're stunning, aren't they? Yeah. Amazing. Well done, you, for getting them. Um, hello, Penny. Uh, I ordered these about a week ago. Arrived yesterday. They are beautiful. Yeah. Well done, Penny. They're absolutely amazing, aren't they? If they were individually, they would never... Even on our screens, they would not be £15 each. But this is what Liam did. I love how we just keep repeating his name, you know. Is it? <laughs> it's his fault. <laughs> <laughs> Um, uh, Ross is saying, I don't even know how the computer allowed him to do this. Oh, that's it is ridiculous, though, isn't it? I mean, that's like ten pound each. If you what, if you he has been out of the game. He's 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 all about paper craft these days, isn't he? So he's lost he's lost touch with the fact that this is precious sterling silver yeah. and genuine cultured pearls. Um, there we go. Bless him. Make the most of this opportunity. As an employee, I think you're better off getting involved on the screens right now. 100% says Ross. Um, yeah, we get perks for staff discount um, and it's more than what's on your screen. You pay more, basically. Yeah. Yeah. Um, hello, Bernadette. I have these. They're beautiful. Thank you. Truth be told, if we ever get something like this again, it's not going to be 39.99. This was a complete Dickens blunder. <laughs> <laughs> well done everybody congratulations they are on the verge of selling out amazing amazing i bought them the first ones we bought um we launched and i've just put them away and they're going to be gifts as and when put them in a nice box there you go um let's do what sorry the eye light i was eyeing this up i was eye light in the eye light um yeah <laughs> Tried to, it didn't work, did it? <laughs> Epic fail. I was ironed up the iolite, that's what I meant to say. Um, yeah, we don't see iolite very often. Um, fabulously pleochroic gemstone, what that basically means, you see lots of different colours, not just the sort of main body colour, which is this beautiful blue. Um, it's like an indigo, like a pair of denim jeans, isn't it? See, I think this would be great with a rhodonite because they're nice. both kind of that soft version of pink and soft version of, of blue, I think. Should we kind of make a, an 8am kit? Oh. How about that? Oh, fabulous. How about those together? Mm. I like that combination. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Still not done. How about with a tassel as well? 
<laughs> How lovely would that be in a beautiful necklace? Amazing, amazing, amazing. You can shop ahead on these. Um, right now for your beautiful Iolite. Yes, a fabulous gemstone. Can you, see the, can you see those beautiful reds and pinks within this gemstone? Can you see the flashes of secondary colours? Again, that's because it has high pleochroism, one of the most pleochroic gemstones actually that exists on our planet. That is totally and utterly natural. Um, and it's a very, uh, it, it's, a, it's a unique blue. Um, you know, you think about your blue gemstones like your sapphires, your tanzanites, for example. Um, your aquamarines. This is very, very unique. It's got a, sort of a much more inky colour to it. Wow. £6.99 pence only for 135 carats of absolutely beautiful, natural Brazilian iolite. Again, we couldn't do a showcase. We don't have the quantity to put an hour together. Um, iolite is difficult to get hold of. Um, I've got 49 available for you this bright and sunny Wednesday morning. But who wants these under £5 today? Oh, I know. I like 135 carats. Goodness me. I have a little I like necklace that my husband bought me for Mother's Day a few years ago. Um, it's got one little briolette drop of I like. Mm. And I know it was three figures. Wow. I think it was 130 pounds, that necklace. Yeah. And I absolutely love it. But a single I like much smaller than each and every single one of these beautiful yeah. nuggets. I love I like. It is such a wonderful colour. Um, you couldn't really mistake it, I don't think, anyway, from your sapphires and your and your tans and like, because it has got that sort of more of a purpley colour. Yeah. And I really love the shapes as well. I mean, they're, they're described as nuggets, but they're... The bigger than what you normally get. Yeah. Like so if yeah, you're a wire big. worker, you could set those in some That's amazing settings. Could That's you? a good point. Use yeah. them as individual solitaires. In five seconds, it's happening, Monica. We're taking it under five pounds. We've got wow. just under 40 of these. Dorset, Nicola, Patricia, Carol, Charmaine, Highlands. Hello to you, West Midlands. Good morning, everybody. I hope you're all well. Hope you managed to get a good night's sleep. How many of you are suffering in this heat? Tell you what, just go and get yourself a paddling pool. Pick them up for about a fiver, I think. Mm. Just go and wallow in the paddling pool. It's too hot for me. It's too hot, far too hot. That's why I, another reason why I want to be with you this morning because it's beautifully air conditioned in here. Four ninety nine only. Well done. Good morning, Liz. Good morning to you, Sylvia. Hello to you, Kerry. Hello to you, Patricia and Colleen. Nice to see you all. Make sure you're checking out. Remember, we only had a forty of these available. There are people multi buying and. Also, they disappear come the top of the hour. You've got till, what, nine o'clock to make your confirmations or stocks last. Hello to you, Tina. I hope you're well. I can see threes and twos and fours in baskets. Well done. Patricia snapped up three. Cornwall's got two as well. Carol, we were just talking about Cornwall. Um, Adam's off to Cornwall, aren't you, next week? End of the month. End of the month, sorry. End of the month, he said. Yeah, got that a bit wrong, didn't I? Um, to sunny Cornwall. Uh, Colleen's multi-buying as well. Oh, you're going to have gorgeous weather, aren't you? Yeah. I always think Cornwall's like, it feels like you are abroad anyway. Yeah. Because it's so warm and beautiful and, I mean, the whole country's beautiful, but yeah. Love Cornwall, we're just raving about it. Um, well done, you're all there. Oh, why is there a clock on your screen, Ross? You haven't made a boo-boo? A the clock was intentional? Oh, so when you said under five pounds, you didn't just mean by a penny. Should we clear the vault? Those of you with it in your baskets, I'd be checking out sooner rather than later because there's a lot of people joining you. We're going even lower. Sorry, I just completely missed the egg timer on our screens just there. <laughs> I was like, oh, hang on a minute. We're, at, we're, at, we're as promised under five pounds, but going even lower. That's why so many of you have said, I might as well have two, thank you. I might as well have three, thank you very much. Um, I'd be doing exactly the same. Just for one stone, yeah, like Monica said, just wire wrapping it maybe. You'd see it in a lovely artisanal jewellers. Um, you'd see it significantly more than these price points, wouldn't you? And I like we really ever, ever, ever see. Three pounds and 99 pence only. Well done, everybody. Drop us a message. Come and say hello. Tell us what you're up to. What's your project right now? Are you are you doing anything? Are you, have you got not just jewellery making? Have you got a project outside of our hobbies? Are you doing the gardening? I know Liam's doing, speaking of Liam, he's doing his garden at the moment. Don't fancy building walls in this stifling heat, personally. <laughs> really. I'll be leaving that for, uh, for another time, I think. Yeah, tell us what you're up to. Come and say hello. 3 99 Sylvia's got two. Kim, Carol's got three. Dorset's got two. Patricia's got two. 
two, West Midlands got two, Colleen's got two, another Patricia's got three, Hilda, hello to you, Lynn, Liz, Kerry, Mariska, hello to you, Northumberland, Dorothy, Daniel, hello to you, Tina, Nicola, Charmaine, Highland, so many of you there. I am fairly sure, you know, I'm fairly sure that's more than 40 people, um, especially with the multi buyers. So make sure you're checking out. I do love Iolite with pearls. I actually think that's a really beautiful combination, Iolite and pearls. It's really great though, because you can, you can dress it up, like if you put it with pearls, but if you just restrand it as it is for yep. 3.99, you can wear it every time you put your jeans on. Definitely, yeah. 100%. Well done, everybody. Stay where you are. I'm going to move on because I'm on the verge of selling out. Amazing. Uh, moving on to, what do you say? Marquise, Marquise. Mm. Oh, these. I think these. Yes. Oh, nice. Okay, now they're base metal. Get a pack of 10. Oh, they're beautifully ornate. I love this. Already under five pounds. Lovely little decorative spacer beads. Yeah, gives a little silver sparkle to your jewellery. Yeah. It? We've got what? We've got 49 available, sorry. We're going to do it one price, Crash Monica, because uh, we're already under five pounds. They are um, silver colour, base metal. Lovely little decorative beads. One. Oh. <laughs> How can you not get that? You know, one pound. Put one in the middle of a stretchy and you're done. Yes. <laughs> yes. One pound fifty. Does that make it 15p each? 15p. What can you buy for 15p? <laughs> not a great deal these days, can you? You can get a nice little decorative bead here. I remember when, uh, when we first came to England in, in 2000, uh, a second class stamp was 15p. That's a good memory, that is. <laughs> That's a really good memory. There's no way I would have remembered that. A second class stamp was 15p in the yeah, year 2000. And I think it was 17p or 18p for a first class stamp. Wow. I remember them being 21p. Yeah. I mean, I don't know how much they are now. How much is a first class stamp now? I don't know. I don't Getting up there to a pound. Isn't it's it? crazy, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, I know. Inflation, eh? £1.50. Clearly, jewellery maker doesn't... How? How? This is not inflatable prices, is it? Seriously, um, and you're getting all 10 of them. We had just over 40, but there's a lot of you stocking up your stashes. Rachel says, thank you very much, Jewel Maker. I'll have six. Um, Dorothy, Carol, Patricia, Jackie, Rachel, Neil and Linda, Mariska, Catherine, hello to you, Kim, uh, uh, Carol, Jackie, I can't keep up with you, Michaela, Stella, Elizabeth, hello to you, new customer, Susan, Lib uh, Linda, Tina, Penny, I can't keep up with you. Well done, everyone. Stay where you are. Um, let's do, oh, I was eyeing this strand up. It's so beautiful. The colour on this next strand is textbook, absolute textbook. When you think about eye light, which can sometimes be heated, it should have the most energetic of colour, the more vibrant, the more um, deeply saturated. Um, whilst maintaining the glow, you still need it to have that beautiful brilliance within the finer the quality. This is exceptional, genuinely, you know. Yeah, the little faceted coins. I love, love, love this strand. I'd be using this with something like your Kingman. I think it'd be lovely with the Kingman turquoise, your deal of the day. Um, or alongside those pearls that I've brought to the back of my hand. Again, this is textbook. Okay. Ross is saying, look, you know, even our starting price is way lower than where we should be. Because look at the quality. Look at the quality. Um, yeah, we, we've spoken about appetite at length. Its colour rival um, is considered to be Paraba. So look, this is uh, Canadian-born designer Kat Florence, which some of our jewellery maker colleagues have, have met in person, worked with her, um, has had an eye for rare gems and hunts down unusual stones from all around the world. She discovered Neon Appetite two years ago whilst travelling through Bahia in Brazil, and she says, the colour rivals the finest quality and most valuable Paraba tourmalines at a fraction of the price. You can absolutely see that on this strand, can't you? The value of Appetite depends primarily on colour saturation so specimens with a high color intensity command the best prices size matters when it comes to appetite since finding large stones weighing over one carat is extremely rare this is ticking all of those boxes so even our start price i mean look at the pieces from cat florence particularly the one on the right and now look at one of ours there you go yeah. you can see that gem quality and by the way that one on the right is 8,000 euros. Look, look, we, we don't hesitate putting it alongside Cat Florence pieces. Yeah. 
That's the quality of the saturation that you are getting here. Amazing. And you know the ring above for us, which is a bit, not my taste. You know the one? Kind of looks a bit, a little bit Egyptian. Um, that one, this is better quality. This is better quality neon appetite than what's in this piece. It's unusual. And I don't know what that, how much that's costing. Probably considerable amounts. Very similar in the cuts, the rounds on that piece, aren't they? Yes. Now, mm. even where we are starting, and I'll tell you, we're starting at twenty-four ninety-nine. That's far too low. Far too low. You're looking at that's a pound per carat straight away for natural neon appetite wow. in this beautiful faceting. How many have we got, Ross? Sixty. If we had quantity, look, if we had something like 200 maybe, this would be a deal of the day. Yeah. Do you know what? Hold up. This is so good. The quality is so good. We're going to do something which we rarely ever do and say that this has to be a spontaneous star buy. Do you know, and I know sometimes some people might be thinking, well, why didn't you make that, this decision before? Some, you've got to remember, a lot of our prep is done on black and white. It's either done on a computer screen or in paper form. So, firstly, Ross thought these were rounds rather than faceted form. Um, so, and the photos sometimes that we see on our computer monitor don't do the strand justice. And every so often, not very often, but we will say wait a minute, this has to be a star buy. The quality is so good, we need to sort of highlight, if you like, the quality of this opportunity and also the deal that you are going to get. But again, that isn't something that we do very, uh, we do lightly, firstly, and we do very frequently. Neon Appetite, firstly, in terms of its size, its average carat weight, in terms of how it forms, is 0 0.15. So you're talking granular in its size. But Neon Appetite, as the name suggests, it is all about that colour saturation, which is what the jewellery editor were writing about. The more vibrant that saturation is, the better the quality it is. That ring, by the way, we've just researched it. To buy that ring, it's £880. Wow. Back in 2016. I mean, it's unique, isn't it? Yeah. I think that's the best way I would describe it. It's unique. Not my taste. But I can understand people liking it because it is very distinctive. Yeah, I like it. It's yeah. quite, yeah, it's, it's very distinct. It reminds, I know, a little bit Egyptian, Definitely, I think. Definitely, yeah, yeah. 860 pounds. It is cool. But if you're looking at the app, if I'm spending 860 pounds, I want my appetite to be better than that. Yes, yes. To be truthful. And that's why, you've got to remember, we are putting a photograph. And normally I'm say, I am you will say, oh, I'm not comparing the pieces or whatever. I am directly comparing the, the quality of the gemstones in this because we've put our strand of Neon Appetite alongside a piece that was featured in the jewellery editor and said, the quality of our appetite's better. Yeah. It is better. Plus, they're beautiful faceted coins, which means you're going to make the most beautiful pieces of jewellery. They tessellate, they lay beautifully. You can do things like your bubble style. You can be inspired by the likes of, I don't know, Astley Clark, create some lovely uh, some biography style bracelets. And look at that saturation. You expect there to be some internal characteristics with this gemstone. It should look like, you know, like Pareba Tourmaline. We yeah. expect there to be internal inclusions. And the fact that the only comparison really we can make is the finest grade Pareba Tourmaline, I mean, that speaks volumes of its beauty. And also, if you're a seed beater, this is a perfect shape for your seed beating because it kind of slots into your seed Ah, perfect. Beating. Monica, yeah. we are starting at 24.99, wow. which is already far too low for natural appetite. The phone lines have absolutely lit up. I've only got 60 available. Those of you that are successful and managed to get this home, you'll absolutely agree with everything um, that we're saying here. The quality is, is exceptional. They, 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 the Neon Appetite should live up to that title. It should be neon in its saturation. They should glow. You should be able to notice them from meters away. And my goodness me, you definitely are. 
24.99 is a steal. Yes, that's an absolute steal. That's a pound per carrot for natural, not even treated appetite. An absolute steal. But you know we're not stopping there. You also know, folks, you've got just over half an hour to make your confirmations because all of these items will absolutely disappear. I think this is going to disappear in terms of, the, uh, you know, um, we've only got 60 available. And I know that collectors, our viewers have got a wealth of gemstone knowledge. You recognise the quality. You can see it glowing. You can see that brilliance. You can see the quality of the faceting. You can see, you know, OK, there's no treatment to this. That, that in itself, you know, carries its weight in terms of value. You could make something like the biography bracelet, like this. Look at the prices that they are, £145, and that's what? Agate. An agate. Here we are bringing you a far rarer gemstone, and we're going to get it under £20 for you today. This with the black, uh, the black uh, jadeite that's coming up. Oh, goodness me, yes. Because you need a strong yeah. colour, I think, if you're going to contrast it. This alongside the black jadeite bundle that's coming up at 10 o'clock. We're under £20. Regine, hello. Cheryl, West Midlands. Christine, Margaret, Antoinette in Belfast. Antoinette in London. Lorna, Dorset, Maker in West Midlands. Sinead, Elizabeth, Hertfordshire. New customers getting involved. I wish I had more. People on the phone lines too. You're all there. That's not your price point. We are going lower. Well, Good luck, though. And I don't, think you're, I don't think you're just going to be getting the one. You can see the quality. You can see how it literally bounces. That wonderful saturation bounce, bounces off the skin. And it's got beautiful clarity as well. Yeah. You know? It's amazing quality. Absolutely amazing quality. Oh, I like it, Ross. So, in rondelles, not a bad price, I'm going to say, Ashley Clark. Not a bad price for that. £90, beautiful glowing appetite. You could buy this strand, be inspired by that bracelet, and probably make more than one. In fact, definitely. Do, yeah. I don't know if this is natural, not sure. It's in gold vermeil, it's not 9 carat or 18 carat gold. Doesn't say anything about the treatment of the gemstone. And I think if it was natural, they would probably shout about that. Um, £90 for that bracelet, absolutely amazing. Oh, yes, if you got hold of the turtle charms the other day, how amazing would this be? Oh, yeah. Good luck, everybody. We are actually over-allocated because there's a queue on the phone lines. We're going to go straight down to it. A spontaneous, a spontaneous star buy. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> That's always half of the starting price. <laughs> yeah, and we were saying that was too low. Yeah. £12.99 pence only. Again, I can show you another beautiful appetite bracelet. Here it is. You could so easily make that. It's a simple stretchy, isn't it? Yeah. Let's be honest. £229. And I'm going to say this, this appetite's better quality. Much, you know, they've got, that's the best that's going to ever look. You've yeah. got all the edits, yeah. you know, that's been uh, photoshopped for sure. Of course. Um, this is, you know, that's the best that bracelet's going to ever look, is actually on the website. Here I have, in a TV studio with floodlighting, not twinkly, pretty spotlights, just literally floodlights above, and we're right up close under magnification on your screens right now. You can see that quality. I do sound like I'm kind of ranting a little bit, and I don't mean to. It's only because I'm so enthusiastic and excited about the quality that you're getting for a crazy low price tag. We had 60. I tell you, we don't have that quantity anymore. Antoinette in Belfast got two. Linda, Cheryl's got two. Sylvia, Claire's got two. Patricia, West Midlands has got two. Christine, Diane, well done to you. Valerie in Bristol, amazing. I've got so many of you with it in your baskets and on the phone lines. Yeah. Pat, Tina, Susan, Maker, Diane, Anne, Deborah, Cambridgeshire, Maker, Margaret, Maker, Margaret, another Margaret, um, London, Linda in Yorkshire, new customers getting involved. Remember, you've only got 28 minutes. Um, but as it stands, I've got 14 left. 
So to be truthful, it's probably not going to last the left, uh, rest of the hour. And I can see way more than 14 names on the call screens and people still joining us. Don't let that put you off dialing. It will be allocated on the first come, first serve basis, like Maker, like Linda, like another Maker, like Susan, all on the phone lines. Alice, well done. You've just got yours on the phone lines. Kerry and Berkshire's there as well. I'm down to the final 14 opportunities and that quantity is dropping. Well done. And when you get this home, you will absolutely categorically agree with every word that we've said it is some of the best quality I've seen at some of the most amazing prices even if we were to hold this at 24.99 yeah well I was going to say if you thought that 24.99 was a good price which it was then you might as well get two because practically buy one get one free isn't definitely it? exactly well done everybody Kerry you've got yours amazing there is a little queue on the phone lines but bear with our call center they will get to you as soon as they possibly can so Susan I can see you there maker Linda maker um, we would struggle to do a showcase of, uh, of, of neon appetite we don't get um, this gemstone very often. And it is purely down to, and I always, you know, Adam always uh, answers the question when I say, what's the average carat weight? 0.15. It's granular. And here we are, um, here we are looking at 25 carats of gem quality. Um, there's five left. There is a queue on the phone lines. I apologize about that. Julie in Lanarkshire, I can see you there. Cumbria, I can see you there. Please stay where you are. And if you've got it in your basket, all I can say is good luck. It needs to be checked out. It's not guaranteed to you. Um, anybody that's asking these are four millimeter coins sorry i should have mentioned perfect that for your CB. yes absolutely perfect I'll leave, the, I'll leave the last few with you amazing 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 now i do have the lavender baroque pearls now there's only three oh, of these available I was looking at these. four of you have i know me too oh. four of you have these in your basket they are natural color so these have not been bleached and dyed um, it is all Mother Nature's amazing doing. And yes, the, you know, the graphics will say lavender. There's also papaya on here. So you get sashes of but those beautiful colors. Um, those colors are offered to a pearl from the um, oyster shell of which they've actually formed. Um, can you see those sashes of purples? Can you see that wonderful, almost like apricot color just here? All totally and utterly natural. We know that cultured pearl, uh, sorry, your Baroque cultured pearls are very much in the limelight at the moment. Um, I think, yes, House of Gucci has got um, a lot to do, <laughs> um, a lot to say for that. You know, these wonderful organic shapes really showcase that they are um, Mother Nature's doing totally and utterly natural and they're big now we've only got a hand a couple of these available look at that intensity of purple i mean it's so dramatic full of luster because you have those wonderful kind of waves of of, of uh, uh nacre um and you can't you you know that this is this is mother nature's doing because to actually create a, a simulant or a shell pearl um looking like this in that brock shape is going to be very costly um but the pearl harvest has been decimated really over um throughout after the pandemic because obviously we couldn't get out to tend to the oysters themselves and it, they estimate it's going to take about 10 years to sort of recuperate what does that mean to us as pearl lovers well it's dramatically pushed up the price point of what is accessible it is is very difficult Look, you can farm pearls and we are farming pearls um, at the moment but it takes time it's not something that's overnight pearl strands like this will probably take best part of I don't know um, three four five maybe five years um, if the harvests are sort of generating and operating normally so at 2,379 pounds natural in their color these are not dyed this is absolutely something that I always suggest to my friends and family look get hold of your pearls at the moment naturally colored pearls they are the ones that are fetching significant premiums you could knot this you could put an 18 karat gold clasp and i think command higher prices than what's on your screen straight away um, because they are in the spotlight right now did you say we had three four of you have it in your baskets they're big pearls remember you have oh yes you've got until the top of the hour but also remember i i just forgotten yeah pearl 10 you get a further 10 percent off your show price on your pearls now we are down to the final two and we are not stopping at 2379 pounds good luck there are, there were only three i i look at this like a legacy piece this is something that i oh my oh, goodness that's so, that's way lower than i was expecting Mars. 
I was expecting this to be 499 and that's an unbelievable jewelry maker price point I would have absolutely celebrated if it was stopping there these are huge baroque pearls look at the measurements right the way up to 23 millimeters and yeah there's that variation of size because they're baroque pearls you have these wonderful almost like uh tails and that solid pure nacre that's why you get such an amazing amazing intensity of uh, um, of luster they are fireball pearls so my eyes you know I would actually call them fireball rather than baroque pearls um which that in itself would command a higher price point 299 we're super over allocated use your pearl 10 code as well because that's working out at what so that means you're, you're getting this for it's what 29 pounds off that price tag um two of them are left i've got margaret Car karen sorry penny maker and i've got people on the phone lines for the final two look for i was in tucson um not the beginning of this year, the beginning of last year, and I saw these sold individually at not far off that price tag. Genuinely speaking, that's individual pearls and little white boxes, a little bit like this. Um, and they were sold at that price point individually. Remember, you've got that extra 10% off. The best time to get hold of your pearls is in June um, because you get that extra saving. And we have done repeatedly. Have I got one left? One of these left within the vault. I don't want you to regret this. You know, the, these are exceptional. And I know our graphics describe them as lavender. They're not, they're multicolored. You've actually got your papayas as well as the lavender. Um, and that is all mother nature. Amazing, amazing doing um, big pearls if you were to restrand it knot it onto uh, and put it onto a luxurious precious metal clasp uh, the, 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 the former price point I th don't think is unrealistic I think most of us um, is there sorry Ross is just saying there's 19 pearls on this one strand I mean how amazing is that if you sold them individually yeah yeah I mean, it's good profit sell, to be made there. one pendant for that price I did actually see a similar necklace the color wasn't as good uh, in Stratford uh, in, a, in a shop window a couple of years ago when we were there on holiday and it was just under two thousand pounds not surprised yeah and that was a couple of years ago yeah yeah i'm not surprised what would it be now who knows um amazing good luck i'll leave that with you there's only one there um are we doing it are we doing the bundle now this is last chance saloon and it's also got to be one of the best pearl deals we've ever brought to air um we've got 14 of these left when i first saw this bundle i was like okay so which is it is it this or is it this? Which am I doing? And Ross was like, actually, Al, um, it's both. Because wait a minute, in this bag, which you get, is not one. Is not two. It's three strands of natural pearls we said what we are taking this to today without the 10 percent discount should be the price of just one of these yes should be the price it's not though you get two natural pinks one natural multicolored, and you're also getting your half drilled everything that you see on your screens right now is included in this amazing bundle. These are half drilled, so all you need is your precious metal bales, or maybe use them in earrings, whichever way you see fit. You're the designer, that's the joy. But I was blown away by the fact that you are effectively, in my eyes, getting four separate opportunities at a price point that should be for just the one. Does that make sense? Yeah. If I was to bring these on their own, in the box, by the way, to the price that this deal is going to, that would be amazing. Yeah or any of these one individual strands. Do you, do you get where I'm, where I'm coming yeah, from? Yeah, absolutely. Do you know where these go to, Monica? I've seen them before, but I can't remember the price. I, and know, I know it was, I know it was- uh, Madness. Madness, yeah. <laughs> and you've got Pearl 10, oh. which means that these are at the lowest price. Oh. Good luck, there are 14 left. Once they are gone, they're gone. These were part of our birthday celebrations. You have your half drilled pearls, in that suite perfectly matched um first one's gone amazing we are currently at 200 pounds per suite i'm going to call them a suite yeah. effectively okay. um potential suite and that is so far away from what our closing deal is going to be you couldn't you won't possibly imagine now if you've never seen these before and you love them just pick up the phone line add it to your basket even if you don't check out as of yet Trust me, 
I know you're not going to be disappointed in the saving. Because myself, be with for a second, and I, I have bought oh, beautiful. this or similar for the price, more actually than the price we're taking these two. Stay there a minute. I have bought strands like this for the price that we're taking this to. They are natural pink pearls. Yeah, beautiful. Likewise with all the other, all the other components. We're at 200 pounds per component. Let's take it, this is ridiculous, isn't it? Let's be honest. Let's take it to 200 pounds for the lot. That's 50 pounds per natural pearl opportunity and that is still not the price not these put them on a precious metal class you will sell them i think in even if i'm being conservative at 199 yeah even if i'm being conservative okay. highlight the fact that these are natural they're not dyed pearls yeah. Yeah. you could all day long all day long and i am being conservative sell this on bales with shepherd hooks at, i think at 199 pounds in a luxury boutique i know it depends where you sell them i know it does but genuinely i don't think that's unrealistic i think that's a fantastic price um it's only my personal opinion i think that's a fantastic price for natural pearls we're nowhere near we are no way near. In 25 seconds, we're taking it even lower. This is the last chance saloon. I don't believe these will be on your screens again. Um, you get, effectively, four opportunities of luxury natural pearls and not even at £199. Plus, don't forget, use Pearl 10. Use that discount code because that's taking it to the lowest price. If you thought £200 for the whole, uh, the whole set was amazing, you won't believe this. What's there to say? Like, when have you ever, i ask you the question, when have you ever seen myself, Carol, uh, any of the teams bring you, when have you seen me, uh, any of us bring you natural pearls at 25 pounds? I think at your room, Echo, we get complacent. Totally. With the, with the price of pearls because, I mean, 25 pounds for one of those strands, I mean, how much work has to go into and time has to go into um, producing these oh, pearls, you know? You know, and a harvest years. of pearls, yeah, years. two, three years, if I'm being conservative, yeah. yeah? Two, three years, but it's like winning the lottery when you come across yeah. a natural colour pearl, because that is where the pearl has migrated to the uh, um, exterior of the mollusk shell, and that's where it gets that concentration of colour. It's like winning the lotter lottery, and you've got an entire, well, four beautiful luxury natural pearls, 25 quid each. And then, of course, you say, it's it's a, it's like winning the lottery finding a pearl in a, yes. in, in an oyster, but then then these are all matched to look yeah, the same exactly. or similar. You're, you're you so know, right. So you're so right. Um, loads of you have got them. Really. Well done. I've only got a, I've got three of them left out of the fourteen that we first brought to you. Seven of you have it in your baskets for those final three. So I keep everything crossed. Good luck. Just check out. Um, amazing. 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 Uh, I do, I do, I do. Natural, this is very limited. Um, natural, mixed colours. I've always said it, I've always said it that um, one of our greatest strengths here at Jewellery Maker is our pearl buying, and I still absolutely maintain that. If it wasn't for Jewellery Maker, I wouldn't have anywhere near the quality of pearls that I have within my family's collection. Um, hang on a minute, we're at 49.99. Ross has just said, I'm gonna do it in one price crash though, Al, because this is crazy. They aren't dyed. They're near rounds as well. I know it doesn't say that on the graphics, but it should do. Um, you've got your peach, you've got your pink and your purple and white. They're listed at potato pearls, which I think would be very, very unjust. Um, hi, Avi, saying I love these. I have them and they are beautiful. Absolute bargain. Thank you. I totally, totally confer, uh, confer with you as well there. At 49.99, if you see this in a luxury, you said you saw some pearls in Stratford. I did, yes. Yeah. I bet you were, they weren't 49.99. No. No. So if you saw this knotted, even on sterling silver, it wouldn't be a double figures in a jeweler's. Uh, no. Oh. It is going to be more like 200, 250, 300 maybe, maybe even more. Oh. <laughs> 
I genuinely don't know. I genuinely don't know how. How many have we got of these, Ross? 21 available. I'm going to be getting some of these because that's crazy. We've brought bleached pearls for that price tag before. That's ridiculous. We've brought, we've brought simulant pearls for that price before. These are genuine cultured pearls with natural color. Uh, near round, even though I know graphics don't say that. All right, some which are a little bit more organic shapes, but some of them could be classed as a perfect round. 20 quid, and you've got pearl 10. Yeah. Well, you can get, for, so that's, you're talking 18 pounds for this. Yeah. 18 pounds. Even if you used to swap those digits round to 81, that would be an amazing deal. The phone lines have gone nuts. There was only 21 though. Northamptonshire, Jane, Angela, Sharon, West Midlands, Patricia, Chandy, hello to you, Cheryl, Gloria, Sharon, Helen, Robert, Angela, Ruth, Jacqueline. You need to be checking them out. There was only 21 available. 19.99. You know what I'm gonna say, Roscoe? People in glass houses, you know, really shouldn't sh throw stones. Here's you, here's you throw a Liam under the bus. <laughs> and, <laughs> no, we love the deals, though, don't we? I, I, it is crazy, though. As long as we, as long as we know, if they were dyed pearls, then yeah, maybe yeah. At jewelry maker, not outside these four walls. Yeah, I could get that. I could, I, I, I could get behind nineteen ninety nine if they were dyed pearls, but they're not. But even then, I mean, just the, the shape of them. I mean, it's not like gemstones that you can cut them and make them look all the same. No. You know. Unbelievable. Have I got what, sorry? Oh, I do. Uh, do you mean a pendant? No. Uh, I think. You need to show me a photo. I've got like a pearl pendant. Is, yeah? With like, oh no, a pair of earrings. Oh, I was eyeing these up. These are beautiful. Now they do come with a little loop. But if you wanted to just wear them as stud earrings, you absolutely could. Um, but for me, you know that, that suite that we had a few moments ago? Can you imagine those purple pearls just literally wrap looped onto the bottom? How beautiful would they be? Um, £24.99. pence. Look how lovely these are. Ah, oh, they're beautiful. They, they lay perfectly against the... Um, against the earlobe, 24 99 They are 925 sterling silver, and you've got your beautiful little button pearls in the center. For me, you know the Brock pearls that we had? Just one big Brock pearl on the bottom there. Yes. How amazing would that be? That bundle that we just did. Yeah, yeah well, yeah, hang on. Hold that thought. Imagine, I know it's a fairly unconventional picture, but just putting maybe those pearls on the bottom. Oh, lovely. How nice would that be? Just literally wrap loop, me just holding a box next to the side of my face, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, just you get the idea. Just pop one of those, wrap loop it on a sterling silver head pin. We're at 14 99 Should we take these under £10 today? Oh, I wish I had my phone with me. I like these. Beautiful little, they're lovely, these. Um, beautiful, beautiful little daisy. Have we got quantity? We have quantity, and they're 925 sterling silver with the little button pearl in the centre. If you want to wear them just as studs, which I think they'd be nice like that too, just nip away with your flush cutters, your, um, that loop, um, and away you go. Yeah, it's beautiful, isn't it? You wouldn't see these in a jeweller's, would you, for £15? Yeah, no. <laughs> you go, you pop into Marks and Sparks, or, you know, here we go, Dotty P's, you go to all of those different uh, fashion retailers, you might buy costume jewellery, you might get, get plastic pearls and base metal earrings. Um, uh, I don't even think you get them at £15 there. I mean, these ones, if you saw them in a, in a shop window, I would say maybe £59, something yeah. like that. I'm with you on that one. I can say, oh, yeah, 60 quid. That seems about right to me. And that's a great price, by the way, if they were in a jeweler's. We're going to take them under 10. Oh. Is there quantity, do you say, Ross? 60. I want to get some of these. They're really pretty. I, I, I think my, my six-year-old would like these as well. Oh, yes. Really pretty. Look at that. Look at the amount of sterling silver that you're getting with your beautiful little button pearls. Oh, yeah, my willow would like these. And you like could also these. just cut the post off and use it as a little pendant. Yes. You could turn it into a ring. There's Absolutely. You can do with that. Oh, that would be nice. I mean, for just that price, you know, you get two or three sets, you can play around with it. 
a tenner, nine ninety nine, and they are genuine culture pearls. Lots of multi buyers. Um, are you gifting or are you selling? Rachel's got two. Janice has got two. Angela's got two. Liz has got two. Lisa, Maureen, Jacqueline. Hello to you. East Sussex, London, Sharon, Caroline, Susan, Anne in Isle of Man. New customers getting involved. We had sixty of them, but I do think these are probably going to be an on-screen sellout. Also, remember, goodness me, where has time gone? Um, it's ah, oh, my word. You've got about just about five minutes to make these confirmations, and every. Every single item will disappear from the website. Ten pounds for nine two five sterling silver pearl earrings, very designer with a cultured pearl, beautiful little button cultured pearl in the centre, which has got a lovely golden colour. Make sure you are checking out, not leaving these items in your baskets because they will disappear. They've got the little loop at the bottom, and that's something I actually incorporated in one of my uh, the dandelion earrings that I, I commissioned for the Willow and Tig um, to give you that option because you can always cut it away, can't you? Ten pounds only amazing 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 make sure you're checking out your basket um, to get hold of those um, I've also we've got flowers and now we're about to bring you your beautiful stars don't worry these are studio samples so don't worry about that um, right then anybody got anybody got some jewelry maker glue Oh, I like stars. it's so lovely and we've got lots of lots of children doing exams and things like that at the moment oh, how nice would this be Oh, I love that. Pretty, isn't it? Yes. The bale, it's got all your lovely 925 sterling silver stars. And then just at the bottom, you've also got a little star leading towards the actual peg itself. Half drill pearl comes with it. Just a dab of your hypo cement or your jewelry making glue of choice. Who wants this under £10? Ah. Oh. What a nice gift for a daughter or a sister. Just something to say that you're a star. Yes. Yeah. Oh, that's beautiful. You don't even need to write it in a card, do you? That's no. just the piece of jewelry says that. Oh, it's beautiful. Really lovely. I love this bale. Look at the amount of sterling silver. We're at ten pounds. Is it just me? It's not just me thinking that's a great price point for the bale. Um, and you're getting that. You're getting that pearl for free, which is an amazing quality pearl. Look how flawless that nacre surface is. Um, all you need is a little touch, tiny what millimeter or two of your yep. of your glue. Leave it overnight. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's it. Yeah. Is that professional jewelry? Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Is this what we would find in most jewellers? Absolutely. And would we find it at tenner? No. <laughs> oh, wait, 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 Ross. Do you know what you've forgotten? Oh. Pearl, oh, you haven't forgotten. Pearl 10. So that's now Please. made... 8 99 then. 8 99 yeah. yeah. For this £8.99 pence for a genuine cultured pearl and sterling silver pendant. How mad is that? Because there's a pearl in there, so you also get the 10% off the silver that's in there. <laughs> yeah, well, that's true. Yeah. That is true, just because it comes... That's a really good point. Make sure you check it out. The bale separate, you would only get the discount on the pearl. Exactly. Maureen, Linda, Elaine, Sharon, Hampshire, new customers getting involved. Time is ticking. I would definitely... If you've got anything sort of lingering in your basket, I would be checking them out. Your Neon Appetite, the Cultured Pearls, the Pearl Bundle. I've got one more auction until I bring you your road night early bird and I'm going to bring you something that's absolutely essential essential to us as jewelry makers and that is your um a 16 piece findings pack for 925 sterling silver so if you're thinking I like the idea of putting those brock pearls on the bottom of those earrings L but I haven't got any head pins no problem we've got you covered um, this is your penultimate auction within the eight o'clock hour so let's show you everything that you're getting so I'll try and tip these out um as and when so you have all of your essential Head pins. You have, let's just tip it all out, shall we? Two beautiful, you've got your hoop earrings just there, and you've got another pair just here. You have your shepherd hooks. There's three pairs of earrings straight away. You have your butterflies to go alongside these, and you have your 925 sterling silver jump rings. These are essential. To, for luxury jewellery making. Now, this is a mad deal, and, uh, and we're just going to say it. Um, a non-jewellery maker producer um, brought these to air, launched them. Perhaps didn't realise, you know, findings packs perhaps shouldn't go to this price point. Hey-ho, we're going to match it anyway. 16 pieces, but it's not just sort of your run-of-the-mill findings pack. Yeah. You know, you are getting um, three luxury sterling silver yes. earrings um the head pins the jump rings and the butterfly backs we are going to match that price point though that that uh, was brought to air we started with 
So started with a crazy Liam deal, and now we're going to close with a crazy cat deal. Love it. Do you know what we're making right now? Friends. Oh, my gosh. Because <laughs> it's not profit. You know, on something that's more readily available, absolutely. Sterling silver, sterling silver is expensive. It is expensive, and there's so much work that goes into our findings packs. We are not making any profit right now. It's all about friends. So add these to your baskets. That's an absolutely mad, crazy deal. Nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. Um, so you have the next auction to check out this item and any other item that we have brought to you within this hour thus far. Um, we started with a big quantity of these, but again, our savvy shoppers, our lovely audience, are saying that ah, right can't afford to miss out on that opportunity. I've got all the essentials that I need. You know, I've got. I've indulged in other gemstones. I, you know, I've got black. I know I've got black jadeite coming up, so I'm going to need the precious metals to go alongside it. Nine pounds ninety-nine. Look at you all there: Janice, Penny, Kathy, Sharon, Liz, Essex, Northamptonshire, Sharon, Mariska, Claire, new customer, Yorkshire, Jacqueline, Sandra. Hello to you, Susan, Cynthia, Angela, uh, Sarah. You're there. Make sure you're checking out those baskets. You've got what the end of this auction to make your confirmations. And up next is a gemstone that we seldom ever see. If you can imagine, as a child. Quite revolting, actually. I'm about to paint a scene, but I used to stir my ice cream. I used to like stir in it, so it became really beautiful and creamy. Yeah. Now imagine that delicious colour, like say strawberry ice cream, stirred, mixed with maybe a vanilla, and you might conjure up the image of this next beautiful gemstone, which is totally and utterly natural. We rarely ever see it. Natural rhodonite. <laughs> Um, here's me talking about, you know, the rarity of precious metal, etc. And I'm just throwing it all over the floor. <laughs> now, <laughs> we've made a price promise on this. Um, and much like we said with the appetite, I, we, could, we would struggle to put together a showcase of appetite because we don't have the... It's difficult to get. Um, I think the same could absolutely be said for Rhodonite. Within our vault at the moment, the fact that we rarely ever have it on our screens, which isn't through choice, um, is down to the ex accessibility of this gemstone. But if you can imagine like a beautiful, creamy strawberry colour, um, completely oh, opaque, oh, then man. yeah, you're going to be imagining this beautiful gemstone. Those of you that love your malas, your stretchy bracelets, your knotting, you know, um, your macrame, I think are absolutely going to love this. But we've made a price promise and said at the very beginning of the show, for those of you that weren't there, 9.99 is not it. We are going significantly lower. Now, we do have a big quantity of this one strand. The fact that, Monica, these are six millimetre rounds is another reason why this is going to be so popular. Absolutely. I mean, especially if you're starting out, six millimetres is, is the perfect size. I mean, you can just re-thread it as a stretchy. You can use it for um, necklaces, bracelets, rings, mm. earrings. You can use it for anything. It's, it's very... Um, non-restrictive I suppose you could say yeah it's a go-to size, size isn't it exactly it works for pretty much everything it works with your seed beading it works with um, metal work it works with with wire work you know it, because it's big enough to sort of hold its own yeah but small enough to also use as, as an accent around something else yeah I totally agree but yeah it's, it's really now, good size. there's no enhancement to this whatsoever and if you think about your pink gemstones um, maybe rhodochrosite has got similarities, uh, thulite possib possibly, but they would come at a different price point. They would, for sure. I adore rhodonite because it has got this really lovely strawberry, creamy colour saturation that is all Mother Nature's doing. Now, we have got big quantity, and I'm going to tell you that quantity... Um, equates to the fact that you're getting this early bird deal. It's super low. You know, I can make comparisons to Rhodonite pro prices that we used to bring you here at Jewelry Maker maybe best part of a decade ago, um, and they weren't anywhere near what you're about to see. Just put them on stretchy bracelets. I think they'd be absolutely amazing. Use them with bright pearls. Wow. £6.99 pence only. You know, there are certain gemstones which we can bring to you on a daily basis, and it does depend on, our, obviously, you know, where we've been buying how we've bought recently rhodonite is extremely scarce within our vault um i think probably ross it's, it's our producer ross who has access to all of this ross could we do a showcase of rhodonite 
No, definitely not, he says. You know, we are more likely to bring you showcases of your grand digerite, for example, than we are of this gemstone. Um, and yeah, you know, it's six ninety nine, affordable price tag. Still not our price, though, only because we have got quantity. Now, over 200 were available. You love it clearly as much as Monica and I do. We're going to take this under a fiver today. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> it's just delicious, isn't it? Do you know it? what it actually reminds me of? When you go to France and you go to some fancy museums and places like that, and then you see these uh, statues made of pink marble. Yes. That's what it reminds me of. Yeah, lovely. See, that, there's the difference between Monica and I. You, you talk about, you know, culture. I'm talking about ice cream. <laughs> Uh, basically, <laughs> this, this I can the relate to the ice cream. Though, I yeah, know. I'm like, oh, I just can imagine them eating delicious strawberry ice cream. You're talking about the culture. Six ninety nine and no way near where we are stopping. Um, I love the idea of putting it alongside some really beautiful pills. For me, that's the look. Um, we're going to bring these pills, by the way, on the other side of the break. How about alongside your Kingman turquoise? I mean, that that's a oh. lovely kit, isn't it? Yeah, it's beautiful. Coming up at ten o'clock, Kingman turquoise. One of the few times ever. Um, crazy though to get hold of it at four pounds and ninety nine pence. It's such a distinctive colour saturation of a gemstone. You know, very few pink gemstones share this kind of beautiful opacity. It's a mixture of your apricots and strawberries yeah. all in one. Um, there's no enhancement. It's not reconstituted. It's not dyed in any way, shape, or form. This is all Mother Nature's doing, and it's delicious. You know, I know Alison, for example. She says quite openly says, "I'm not a pink person, but she loves rhodonite." Yeah. But because it's, it's not a it's not a baby pink it's not no. a it's not a girly pink. It's not a, a Barbie it's a pink. Sophisticated. That's the word I was looking for. A sophisticated pink. Yes, absolutely. I totally get that. And I think equally, you know, this is something that um, will suit all ages, absolutely. suit all occasions. Absolutely. It'll be lovely with the black jadeite that we've got coming up in a few moments' time. Four pounds and ninety nine pence only. Oh, I love it. It just makes me want to have a nice ice cream. <laughs> you know, like my uh, uh, <laughs> my husband. Um, this is pre kids. We went to um, went to Rome. And I just remember it so vividly. Just before you get to the, Trev uh, the Trevi Fountain, if ever you get a chance to go, there's a little ice cream shop. <laughs> there is. Uh, there's a little ice cream shop just on the right-hand side as you're walking up to the Trevi Fountain. Go there. It's the best ice cream I've ever tasted. I thought the story was going towards the culture, but... <laughs> With the Rome and the Trevi no, Fountain. No, I'm still stuck on the ice cream. The ice cream, man. The Trevi Fountain was nice as well, but you've got... <laughs> if, you go, if you ever go to Rome, it's all about the ice cream. And the coffee. Amazing coffee, too. Oh, Delicious. Oh, yeah. Um, oh, yeah, coffee. And pizza. Just Rome. Coffee on ice cream. Because you can get... Uh, my mum always gets it when she goes to Italy. It's, it's called... Cafe. What is it? Is that also, but they also call it cafe con gelato. Sort of like a like scoop that. of ice cream on top. Well, it's ice cream and then they pour the coffee on it, yeah. Oh, I don't know, Ooh. yeah. That sounds pretty delicious too. Oh my goodness me. Trevi Fountain's nice as well. <laughs> It's very nice. £4.99 only. Um, make sure you stay where you are. Time is flying. There's loads of you getting these. At the end of this auction, at the closure of this auction, we have given you a few minutes extra. Each and every single one of your early bird hour items will disappear. So make sure you are checking out those pearls that I've reached for um, so many times throughout the course of this hour are coming up immediately after the break. Plus Monica's beautiful kits. Don't forget also, you've got Kingman Turquoise as your dealer today today. And it's a mind-blowing strand. Um, yes, and your bundle of type A jadeite for the very first time. Uh, but yes, Monica with a wonderful creations coming up after this. Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay where you can spread the cost over two, three, or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Want to know what's going on in the next show? 
then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Often when we um, are sat behind this desk and I'm bringing lots of beautiful gemstones, do I reach for fills? It's got to be, I don't know, five, six times an hour, maybe? Like, for example, when I bring you the Kingman turquoise, I'll reach for pearls. <laughs> if I bring you Laramar, I reach for pearls. If I bring you black, uh, black jade, I reach for pearls. Because they truly are the perfect accompaniment, aren't they? To any gemstone. Absolutely. Absolutely. Especially for us as jewellery makers, I know that if you're making, I don't know, um, a, a, a ring, an engagement ring, whichever it might be, or you're, you're a designer for boodles, then you're going to be working with the precious metal and then it's going to be diamonds, isn't it? But in terms of beading, which is everywhere at the moment, or knotting, it's always pearls. I think it, that's, that's the one I was just just dawned on me how many times do I actually reach for this gemstone throughout the course of any given show but pearls are absolutely everywhere remember the article that I read some um, some weeks ago saying that question is being raised um, are pearls the new diamonds I think it's a valid question I don't think necessarily they're the new diamonds because they have always had that popularity yeah and I don't think they'll ever ever go out of fashion even as youngsters, I think we appreciate that pearls are rare commodities. I think even as youngsters, you know, my, my two-year-old Tiggy, when she 
naughtily goes, I've got a drawer in my dressing table with my jewellery. And when she sneaks in there, she'd be like that. Ooh, pretty. That's what she just says. She just looks all pretty and she's looking at the pearls, etc. Uh, we appreciate it, don't we? Even from a very, very young age. And we're so fortunate here to be able to indulge in something that is, genuinely speaking, really expensive in most places. But... In terms of pearls, who would you say put them on the, mar uh, on the market, put them in the limelight, I suppose? I mean, we could go right the way back, couldn't we? Cleopatra loved her pearls, of course. But certainly more in a modern generation, I think we would all describe Coco Chanel. And she says, layering pearl necklaces are really in right now, and that's because the only thing more stylish than a strand of pearls is more and more pearls. <laughs> if you're into fashion trends, this one makes the ultimate statement of dazzling sophistication. And there's her famous quote, a woman needs ropes and ropes of pearls. Absolutely. Coco Chanel <laughs> and me. Coco Chanel, though, when they bring ropes and ropes of pearls, they aren't working with cultured pearls. They're working with... Simulant pearls, glass pearls, effectively, and yet, you know, I think that's one of the uh, one of their designs that they are uh, most celebrated for. Here is Coco Chanel wearing a very uh, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, famous, sorry, very famous Chanel suit yep. with her pearls, layers of pearls as well, in one of the old sort of the first ever Chanel shops. Here we are, creeping upon a century later, and her declaration still rings true. Pearl layers are quite appropriate for black tie events, benefits, galas, and other upscale social affairs. But these days, they are also appropriate for more toned-down events. That can be laid-back gear, casual attire, or even office outfit outfits. Anywhere you simply want to look dazzling. And don't you, again, that's true. I remember my mum... My mum, if she was going out, if she was going, I don't know, for dinner or to um, a ball, for example, mum was part of uh, Lady Circle, dad was part of Round Table, so they used to do these balls. Mum would always wear her pearls, but you wouldn't see her wearing them any other time. It was always a special occasion, but these days, you can. Yeah. You can wear them more frequently. And again, particularly here, we get that opportunity because they are more inexpensive. Perhaps the most famous multi-strand necklace uh, of recent times is the Holly Go Lightly famous five-strand pearl necklace in Breakfast at Tiffany's. Although the pearls used for this statement necklace were imitation, the flattering effect of layering pearl stands, uh, uh, strands captured the public imagination and continues to be in vogue today. The pearls aren't just at the front, are they? They're draped down the back of her yes. neckline. Stunning. Beautiful. So to recreate something like this, most of us, most of us would think, oh gosh, no, that's going to, I'm not going to be able to afford. Well, how about if I tell you this star by is going to make necklaces like this with Jackie O. Oh. Necklaces like Holly Go Lightly's. Necklaces like this. Angelina Jolie, necklaces like this, Catherine Heigl, yeah. necklaces like this, Sarah Jessica Parker, or like this, which are, sim which are actually simulant pearls, um, but make that possible. And for the gents, oh, not yet, multi-strands. 1,350 knotted pearls here. I don't know if they're genuine or they might be similar. You could so easily make that. Um, or pieces like this, where you have Pharrell, you have Harry Styles, and you have ASAP Rocky. Thank you, Ross. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not great with my wrapping. But, um, but again, how lovely to see gents wearing pearls I, I as well. I love that men are starting to wear pearls. Me too. Yeah. Me too. How about this? Oh, beautiful. I mean, she looks so beautiful, doesn't she? Yeah. So elegant. But a piece is like this, absolutely possible. I'm about to tell you, these are genuine cultured pearls. They're not small either. They're quite big cultured pills. And you're about to get one of the best possible deals. I've got 86 of these available. I've reached for them countless times um, throughout the course of the morning thus far. Um, and absolutely, 
absolutely these are going to be an on-screen sellout. So if you're a pearl lover like myself, I buy more, more pearls than any other gemstone from Jewelry Maker because, again, I think it's one of their greatest strengths. This is going to be one of those unmissable deals. Even if, like myself, you're thinking, I've got so many pearls. Even my husband's like, really, more pearls, Al? Yes, no, yes. because never have too many pearls. <laughs> precisely. My words exactly. They are so on trend and it's the it's the the one gemstone that i reach for time and time and time again to go alongside the eye the kingman turquoise the black jadeite that we've got coming up yeah gents you know I, and i know who's going to poke their head around the corner the likes of jack Grealish, recently on the news that's this week wearing his cultured pearls celebrating yeah Look at that. It's wonderful. By the way, if you look, if you click that link, by the way, the Grealish bundle, <laughs> okay. If you, there's a bundle called Grealish, apparently. Ah, uh, okay. It's this. He's wearing all of those at once. They are quite affordable, to be fair, but you could make them a fraction of that. You know, a Jack Grealish, let's be honest, he's got a pretty significant bank balance. So that's quite affordable jewellery that he's wearing, I'm going to say. You can make it for a fraction of that. Uh, £165 for the Jack Grealish bundle. Yeah. <laughs> it's very good. That's not bad for a three-pound necklace, is no, it? No, really it's not good. bad at all. Well, we're going to demolish that price tag, you know this. Um, the amount of times that we all, not just myself, that we all use pearls as that uh, that... I don't know, accenting gemstone, and also the star of the show. For me, pearls absolutely are always, always appropriate. Yes, the gents are really getting behind pearls, which I love. You've got, I don't, I, they're all footballers. I'm glad you said that because I haven't got a clue. Um, amazing. So all wearing their cultured pearls. It's, I like that. It's great because it started with the, with the men wearing just one strand, didn't it? And now they're wearing more and more. More and more. Yeah. Isn't that great? Uh, um, Ross has just said he'd wear pearls. Yeah, you should. He says, he's, no, you could wear pearls. I would put them at, with, uh, Ross, I would put them maybe alongside like a dark gemstone. Yeah. I think they'd look really lovely against a white t-shirt. Would you go long line or would you go short? Would you go long or short? Short, you go for a shorter. Um, whereas Adam, I know, goes for the long line change. Yeah, my husband would wear pearls. Now, should we get into this? Because it is going to be one of those auction opportunities that is going to fly out the door. And it's 20 past nine. Good luck to each and every single one of you. This is one of those, well, I might as well thank you very much. They're genuine cultured pearls. This is an added to your order price point. They are big pearls. I mean, they are what, a millimeter off that double digit number that we all strive for in this beautiful gemstone. Classic, pure, ivory white, as Coco Chanel. Every woman deserves ropes and ropes and pearls. But actually, let's rephrase it. Everybody deserves ropes and ropes of pills Absolutely. not just the women because gents are wearing them too and looking amazing in them as well a full 38 centimeter strand we've got the black think what we've got coming up or maybe what you've got already in your stash that these are going to complement have you got larimar amazing have you got jadeite amazing have you got your jaspers your agates the phone lines i'm going to say as it is are completely clear I don't think people realise just how good this deal is going to be. And even if, hands up if you're well stocked on pearls. I've got loads. Yeah. <laughs> I guarantee that this star by opportunity is so good, none of you are going to even want, uh, you're not going to go, I've already got pearls. You are going to be adding them because these are still rare, precious commodities, valuable commodities, yeah. and they're going to be an added to your order price. And I mean, to be honest with you, I can't think of a single gemstone that wouldn't go with pearls. No. Or colour. No. That's so true. That's not your price. Mm. It's not your price. So Wilfred there looks like he's wearing ringed pearls. He's got about four or five strands, I think. He looks like he's wearing ringed pearls. I genuinely don't know who any of these gentlemen are, apart from Jack Grealish. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Apparently football. That's why I don't know. We are going so much lower than £19.99. I was approached by Sky once upon a time. Um, yeah. 
the, the crew know this. And they were like, oh, we'd like you to uh, come for an interview to work on Sky, the football channel. Oh. And I was like, what? Uh, they'd actually <laughs> found me on Jewelry Maker. They were like, we'd like to have a chat with you because we want you to come and present on Sky um, with the football. And I was like, I don't like football. <laughs> I know nothing about football. And they actually were like, it doesn't matter. We do, everything is filtered into your ear. And I was like, no, thanks. No. I wouldn't know who anybody was. I don't know what the offside rule is. And I've got no interest in football <laughs> whatsoever. So there you go. That's well, why you I would have learned if you won't. I did go. I did, I did, I did go. And then I was like, I don't like football. So who am I kidding? Yeah. 1999. Forget about that. Eleven pounds ninety nine oh, for God. nine millimeters. <laughs> Hello, Anne. I have a men's pearl collection with class at the front. Absolutely, and I bet they're really popular. I bet they're so so popular because I know. Um, the gents are loving them at the moment. Yeah. Absolutely, you've got the crew here. You know, you're all cool, aren't you? You're cool guys, would you say, Ethan? Cool, yeah. Particularly, yeah. You in particular, absolutely. Dan, would you say you're cool? Oh, a sub zero. Sub zero, cool. cool. <laughs> love it, love it, love it. Lewis Hamilton, <laughs> Formula One racing driver, also wears pearls. Absolutely, before, Smuffy. Before you read that message, I suddenly thought Lewis Hamilton had texted in. <laughs> yeah. Hi, Lewis. <laughs> Making yourself another pearl necklace, are you? Amazing, it's only setting you back £11.99. You're right, bargain. You could get a Make few. it right. <laughs> um, yeah, didn't you do well this weekend? Wasn't, didn't you do all right this weekend? I have no idea. I don't know My husband watches it, but again, zoning out there. Um, I'd be paying attention to the pearls. Was it this weekend? What was Tom watching there? My, my Tom was watching. Huh? I don't know. No, he was watching Lewis Hamilton. There he is. Oh, yeah. He's got the most beautiful eyes, hasn't he? Amazing eyes. At least that's a sports person that I actually recognise. Yeah, I do recognise <laughs> him as well. But there he is wearing his cultural pearls. Looking lovely, Lewis. You're looking lovely with your crisp white shirt. Um, what do you reckon? He might have made it himself. You never know. Eleven ninety nine. Loads of you getting involved. These are big statement pearls. He probably got them from Anne. Yeah, absolutely. Um, well done, Susan, Christine. Hello to you, Tanita, Patricia, Alison. Hello to you, Susan, Carol. You know what? You know what? We've got eighty six. We did say this was going to be one of those. Oh, I might as well add it to my order, even though I'm well stocked on pearls. Can we have too many pearls? I don't think so. We're going to take this under ten pounds. They're nine millimetres. They're absolutely huge. Yeah, I mean, as I say, any gemstone that you're working with, if you think, oh, what should I put this with? Pearls will work every time. Every single time. Yeah, as we opened into this auction, that's the first thing I said, you know, I reach for pearls probably, I don't know, five, six times in any given hour, maybe even more. And even when, we, when we're showing other gemstones, we say, oh, this would go with this, this would go with that, this pearls. would go with pearls, pearls every time. Pearls, 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 yeah. not pearls. We, yeah, absolutely. Um, and, and we're lucky, aren't we? Because we can work with beautiful culture pills. These aren't simulant. These aren't, these aren't reconstituted. They're not shell pills, which we absolutely love shell pills too. These are genuine cultured pills. And furthermore, in 10 seconds, we're taking it to a single figure price tag. Wait, Ross, have you forgotten something? He says, no, I haven't forgotten. That's why I'm bringing all these amazing pills. Pill 10. Oh. I'd forgotten. <laughs> Use your discount code. Pearl 10. On your checkout, use Pearl 10, you'll get a further discount. Look at... How many places can you get fake pearls, plastic pearls, at 9 99 Yeah. You know, the eight, likes of Rihanna... 8 ultimately. Your, yeah, 8 99 Likes of Rihanna, they were fake pearls. They weren't genuine culture pearls, that, sh that Chanel necklace that she was wearing. Yeah. She looks amazing, just in her cardigan. Looks absolutely amazing. But they're not faux pearls, whereas... Sorry, they are faux pearls, where these aren't. These are genuine cultured pearls. Um, with your Pearl 10 code means you're getting them for $8.99 today. How amazing is that? Margaret, Marion, Sharon, Elaine, Elizabeth, Sue, Lincolnshire, Hilda, Linda, hello to you, Meath, Judith, Elvina, hello to you, Northamptonshire, Geraldine, Carol, Anne, Worcestershire. Um, hiya, Jan. Oh, hello, Jan. Pearl earrings for my strand will be a minimum of 20 to 25 pounds a pair, so plenty of gravy to be made. Can we just give um, Jan a big kiss and say, well done for, for the other day. Well done, lovely. I'm so sorry I missed you, but it's so nice to hear from you. Mwah! Sending you lots of love. She launched her Easy Knot. I saw that, yeah. Easy Knotting tool on Jewelry Maker. Um, yeah, who was rave, raving about that to me? 
Alison, yeah, Alison was raving about that tool. Um, behind the scenes, that was. Well done, lovely. 9.99, everybody. Denise, Maya, hello to Christina, Kim, Christine, Donna. We had 86. This is how many we got left. 11. Well, I'm not surprised, really. Not me. Yeah. I mean, they're 8.99 with that Pearl 10 code. <laughs> yeah. I love it. Absolutely love it. I do think Harry Styles was probably one of the first gents, wasn't he? Yeah. Do you reckon? I think so. Was it Harry Styles? In, in modern times, obviously. I think it was Harry Styles that really put them on the map for gents, you know, of this, this era. Yeah. Um, and I love that. I do love that. Um, down to the final four. Well done. At the end of this hour, we have also got a stretchy cord bundle. So if you want to make your stretchy bracelets, we've got a bundle of those. Um, and yeah, we've got clears. There you go. Is it all three? So you've got different sizes too. We'll put that on pre-order. There is only 70 available. So if you love making your stretchies, um, then shop ahead on that one too, um, because they're going to really work with Monica's kits coming up this hour yep. and also in your masterclass. Um, amazing. Well done, everybody. I think that's pretty much sold out. Okay, let's do the kits. Now, show off your jewellery firstly, Monica, because these are absolutely stunning. They're brand new sterling silver components. They are. I mean, those bales are amazing. They're so detailed. Um, I just love all of them, to be honest with you. <laughs> They've got this really, uh, um, like, They'll work perfectly with a deal of the day, I think, as well, because they've got this quite Native American vibe about them. Absolutely, yes. These are gorgeous. Let me just show you. And they are all slightly different. Now, ironically, that's the one I've picked up, oh. Ross. <laughs> now, look, you've got your beautiful, described as gold, pearls. I might look at them as, I, th I personally think they're like a lovely lemon colour. Yeah. And then you have... Um, 925 sterling silver sunflower bale. If I turn it sideways, you can see as well. Um, you've got a nice aperture in the center there, so you can even feed this onto things like your cord. Cord, absolutely. So, so would you well use it this way or the other way? No, you use it the other way. So, so flip it so over. If you have a look at my necklace, should I bring it over? Yes. Let's do it. Oh, okay. Oh, that's so beautiful. So that's how, that's, that's how it works. Yes, I, I did add some seed beads to some of my kids because I'm obsessed. <laughs> you know, and, and they work. They and absolutely they can't help work. It. <laughs> Look how lovely that necklace is. It is. It is. It? And, and the bale, yes, a bale is really functional, but it can also be the it's star of the Very decorative. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yes. Yes. Good luck, everybody, because... These are brand new, and the only way of getting hold of the bale and the pearls is actually within this kit. Um, let's open it up. Each of these kits you can mix and match with the other kits that's coming absolutely, up also. Absolutely. If you've got any questions for Monica regarding your kits, then do text in, because we are live. That's a significant amount of sterling silver that you're getting within the bale. Oxidised to really make that wonderful patterning pop, so you can see that. If you wanted to polish it away, you could. You could, yes. But I mean, it, and it's, uh, this necklace is such a simple make. I mean, it's just stranded um, with a pendant in the middle, you know. So, uh, and it makes it so um, elegant, I think. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Absolutely. I think this. I'm thinking these yellow pearls would look amazing with the black jade that's oh, coming up. Me, yes. Putting this kit alongside, um, alongside those components. Now, 19.99 is not even your price point. So you're effectively getting this beautiful brand new premier bale with the sunflower detail and those lovely glowing like buttercup yellow pearls. Yes. Genuine culture pearls, not faux. Um, um, a very summertime vibe behind this and we're not even stopping at 19.99. Have we got quantity? There's a hundred in terms of quantity. It's the first time for, in a long time actually since we've seen the, the yellow pearls. Yes, and actually I could have used uh, this sort of a pendant in the front as well, that would have looked really nice too. Yes. Lovely. Hang on. For that bale alone, Ross, at twelve ninety nine. Oh my goodness. Or for the pearls alone at twelve ninety nine. Is it's not just me thinking this. If I was to look at those components individually, that was a strand of culture pearls in a beautiful sort of summery yellow colour that we rarely ever see. And when we do, they always fly out the door. If that was 12 99 that would be a star buy, wouldn't it? 
They would be, yeah, those yellow pearls on their own would be a star buy. $12.99, amazing, absolutely amazing. But you are also getting that significant amount of sterling silver. So even if we cut that price in half at £6.50 each, yeah. how awesome is that? That's brilliant. And I mean, these kind of bales, um, you, oh. see them, you see them in, in base metal and, and things like that, but I don't think I've ever seen them in sterling silver. No, I agree. It's brilliant. Um, okay, wait a minute. As soon as I say this out loud, I've got a hundred available. You have a sterling silver, solid sterling silver bale. You have genuine cultured pearls. You know what's going to happen, don't you? But as soon as I say it out loud, it's kind of confirmation. We are going to take this kit under ten pounds. Oh my goodness! <laughs> that's a pro that's a better than what I was expecting price for the pearls yeah. or the bale. But you get both. You do get both. How often do we say, look, get involved during the kits because you get an even better saving on your bundles? Absolutely, yeah. Five pound per component. Oh, man. <laughs> Hang on. Hang on, Ross. Oh no, have you done it? Ross, have you forgotten about something? No, he said. I said from the start, I'm taking advantage of that Pearl 10 code. Oh. I, I should. You can use Pearl 10 with this kit. That's nine pounds for a kit. That's got to be the nine lowest price kit we've ever done. Nine pounds with that sterling silver bale. <laughs> wow. And the strand of pearls. Goodness me. Crazy. I'd be multi-buying on this kit and create something, you know, like you know, like all those football stars, literally create something even more glowing. Uh, Hiya, Sue. I often look at designer jewellery online. I'm astonished how much they charge for faux pearls and base metal. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Chanel Absolutely. being prime example of that. Mm. Absolutely. Dior's another one. All work with base metals, don't they? And yeah, it's like three figures and then some. But even if you go to sort of smaller jewellers, you know, not the, all the big big names, they still they still charge crazy prices for, for non-genuine. Absolutely. Yeah. But Sue, do you think that's us being? Uh, it, it, do you think that's us just being spoiled? Do you know what I mean? Do you think we're just spoiled by the jewellery maker prices? I think so. Yeah. I think we are <laughs> in the best possible way. You We're know, not complaining about that or anything. No, you know, absolutely <laughs> not. But as you know, how lucky are we to be able to get hold of genuine culture pearls and sterling silver for nine quid yeah. with your pearl ten code? Um, I agree. And that's you know what? Look, yes, you are paying for the name. A lot of people are very much label people. I don't really go with that. Um, mm. And I can't justify. I think, like you, Sue, I can't justify the three-figure price on something that's basically plastic. Um, I'd far rather make it myself and save the money. Goodness me, though, that's an amazing deal. Shop ahead on Monica's other kits as well. Um, we had a hundred of these, and they're absolutely flying out the door. So many of you multi-bought. Can you imagine, like a big statement sunflower yellow pearl oh, necklace? Yes, yes, yeah, beautiful, beautiful. I'd get three, create like a twist. You know, like we showed earlier on with Angelina Jolie and, and uh, Jackie O, create something like that in buttercup yellows, and I'd keep two of the bales for another project. Yes. Amazing. Well done. Well done, well done. Let's do the next. That's quartz. I, I thought it was, was fluorite. fluorite. Yeah. <laughs> wow. We all thought it was fluorite. Oh, when you feel it, you can see, you can tell it's quartz. It feels like quartz. Yeah. But fi visually, it looks like fluorite. Yeah. Um, certain gemstones feel dif different. The weight, the density, etc. And actually, now I've now I've it's seen probably it. Probably a bit clearer, I think, than than you've fluorite, got, isn't it? It might be. It might be the cut. But also, look, you've got rose quartz in there. Oh. You've got lemon quartz in there. Ah, see, now this recording, you can see it's quartz. But physically, I thought it was fluorite. How lovely is this? Now, again, so you have here 110 carats of your beautiful star cut quartz. When we first launched your star cut, weren't they around, don't quote me on it, but weren't they around 14 99 
when we first cut, when we first launched I think the star so, cut. Yeah. Um, eight millimeters in their size, plus then you've got your 925 sterling silver bale. Um, and if you look at the detail on this one, look how lovely that is. You've got little hearts. hearts yeah. Again, ox oxidized to make that sterling silver filigree work really pop. Look how beautiful this is. How many do we have of this kit? We've got a hundred of these available. Oh, do you know it? We're going to do it one price crash, then put a minute clock. And we made a decision. Guess what? Should we do under £10 again? Yay! Oh. <laughs> Love it! Under £10 kit! That's a sterling <laughs> silver component in a beautiful quartz strand. Lemon quartz. I love lemon quartz. Do you know what would also look really lovely from those bales? If you turn them into cufflinks, you could put it yes. like a crystal, uh, I mean, um, a quartz on either end of the bale. Yeah. Uh, and then maybe the the, toggle, the the bar section of a toggle clasp attached to the other side for the back nice. of the toggle clasp of, of the back of the cufflink. Lovely. Look, there it is. Oh, you could yes. Or Look could, what I've reached for again. You could put pearls with it for cufflinks for that men. Nice. Other men are wearing pearls. That would be lovely. In 22 seconds, we're going to crash that price, but we've said it out loud. This kit is going under um, under 10 pounds. It's beautiful, multicolored quartz. You've got your amethyst, you've got your uh, rose quartz, you've got um, greens in there as well. How beautiful is that? So your praise light, you've got praise light in the strand and also your lemon. Yes. How amazing. Look at that, look at the bo gemstone boxes we've ticked. Amethyst, rose quartz, lemon quartz, praise light. All in one strand. Yeah. And you get your sterling silver, beautiful bale. Nine pounds and 99 pence only. Cast wow. your mind back to when we first launched your your star cuts because they are quite a, um, I don't know, more of a tricky cut to actually achieve than uh, say just a, a plain round. They were about 14.99, weren't they? Your star cuts and your satellites, they're about the same. Mm -hmm. They might have gone up and down ever so slightly, but I think when we first launched them, they were about that price point. Um, ticking four bo gemstone boxes and your sterling silver. There it is, under a tenner. I've been mixing these kits together, I think. I think oh, they would look lovely with the pearls that I we had do, earlier yeah. on. Yeah. Oh, yes. And we've got the white pearls. And I'm going to get the white pearls that are also coming up in mm. one of your kits. Look at that! That is summertime right there, isn't Beautiful, it? Beautiful, yes. That's a barbecue at a friend's house with, uh, you know. That's what I, know I mean, I don't know what price the third, the, the, the white pearl kit is going to be, but just taking those two is less than 20 pounds. Less than 20 pounds, yeah, you're right. You know, I mean, if you use all of that in one necklace, and you get that. it's still, you know. Less than 20 pounds yeah. for all of this. I know, it's amazing, isn't it? Make sure you are checking out though. It's busy, busy, busy this morning. I'm going to leave that with you because I have still got two kits to do. Um, let's do the Jasper, Ocean Jasper. You know that's deplete, don't you? Ocean Jasper has run out. Hmm. It was actually a, um, a location of, of Jasper that was lost. So it was discovered on the coast, as the name suggests. Mm -hmm. um, and then it was lost for quite considerable years. And then they rediscovered it once again, but all but oh. gone. Um, these are going to sell out, says Ross. Well, I'm not surprised. He says, our first price crash with that beautiful bale. If I turn it that way, is that better? There you go. You can see it a bit more then, can't you? First price crash. Oh, £9.99. pence. Ocean Jasper. There's lots wow. of different varieties of Jasper, but Ocean Jasper is one of those locations that's no longer being mined. So again, straight away, I can see that £9.99 price tag and then some to be truthful. Have I got quantity of this kit? Just over 100 available. Beautiful jewellery from our lovely Monica. And it goes a long way. I mean, I, I knotted it because there's no reason you can only knot pearls, you know. Yeah. So I knotted it. I made a bracelet and a, and a necklace as well. So it can go Oh, that's a long beautiful. Way. It is a lovely stone because you get... It's, it's a little bit Mukai-esque. Yeah, great minds is, there, yeah. Ross. Because um, you have these really beautiful forest greens. You've got some lovely taupe colours. You've got your... Um, okras, your crimson reds. It's a really lovely fusion, a lovely palette that I think is very summertime and winter. It sort of tr it kind of glides across multiple seasons. We're at 9.99, but you know we must remember that Ocean Jasper is gone. It's gone. What's in the market is what's in the market. No more is coming out of the ground. And yet here we are bringing it to you on a single figure price tag with the sterling silver. Let's not forget, you get one of those yeah. sterling silver bales. Oh, 
Oh my gosh. <laughs> Did you, did you forget about the bale in there? Because that's a good price for the strand. <laughs> I would normally say, oh, that's the price of the bale, or oh, that's the price of the strand, but it's neither of those. Yeah. It's not the price of either of those. It's both. Ocean Jasper is gone, so I would say at least £10 for that, at the very, very least. For the sterling silver bale, again, probably 10 or again. Wow. How on earth? Again, that's one of those, might as well add it to my basket. Thank you very much. I've just got myself some uh, some beautiful palettes um, of colour from this natural gemstone and a sterling silver bale for six ninety nine. Crazy. There was a hundred, did you say? Just over. People getting threes, twos, amazing. Marie Claire, Elaine, Caroline, Kathleen, Susan, Magali, hello to you, Chantal, Michaela, Elvina, Donna, Sarah, Marishka, Angela, Durham, hello to you, Sylvia, Jay Marie, new customer, Lincolnshire, Vanessa, Cody, new customer, Christine and Ray. Welcome to the wonderful, yet ever so slightly crazy world of jewelry making. Um, if you have any questions for Monica about any of her pieces, and she will be demoing, um, which are you going to demo? Well, last week when I was on, I did some cord bracelets, and then now I've done the cord bracelets in this one and, and the necklace as well. So I'm going to show you how to make the, the sliding clasp at the back, which if I turn it around. Oh, the Solomon's bar? Yeah. Amazing. So if you've always wanted to know how you make that, then stay with us. Make sure you check out your baskets on your kit, though. Six six ninety nine for a kit with sterling silver. You know, that's that's. if it was base metal, even then I couldn't make sense of it, Ross. Even then I couldn't. Sorry, sorry. Um, you know, if they were base metal components, then I'd be like, okay, you know, it's going to be more affordable. The six ninety nine, it's not not base metal. They're sterling silver. No, I mean, if there were no component in there, just the strand, that would be a good price. Yes, <laughs> you know? exactly. That would be a fantastic price for a gemstone that is of of this variety yeah. gone. It's not coming from the mine anymore. What's available is what's in the market already. So we should expect to uh, pay a higher premium for it. And visually, it's stunning. You've got bluey colours, which Absolutely. you don't often see in varieties Absolutely. of jaspers. Linda's got two, Jackie, Northamptonshire, Kate and Gwent, Kathy and Dorset, Angela, Paula, hello to you, Devon, Christine in Channel Isles, hello to you, Marie, Karen, Janet in London, Elaine, Hilda, Wiltshire, Susan in Warwickshire, Barbara on the phone lines, hello to you, Claire, Sally, Sandra, Irene in Swansea, Sue in South Yorkshire, keep on dialing through, I had just over 100, mad, crazy, crazy, crazy deal. If you see your name on the bottom of the screens, believe me, you're, you're amongst many. Remember your deal of the day. Gosh, where's this morning gone? I've got Kingman Turquoise, which I could count in one hand the amount of times I've brought Kingman Turquoise to air. Um, and it is still to this day known as one of the best locations in the world. Now. Ooh. This kit shouldn't, we shouldn't do this. But there's a difference between shouldn't and won't. Because we will. We will take this kit under £10 too. Look at that lovely bale. And you're getting some cultured pearls. Again, for me, a single figure price tag for either one of those components. But it's not either one. You haven't got to choose. You get both. You do get both. Just gonna scooch that back a bit. There you go. Oh, how amazing are these price points? With the bail, you know, if you, you might be looking at this thinking, I don't need any more pearls. This is going to be a bit great price for the bail, and then yeah. you've just got a Brucey bonus of pearls, or vice versa. And you know, these bales have got quite a large um, hole through them, so you can put them on a snake chain as a charm carrier as well. Oh, that's a nice idea. So if I hold that up. There you go. Yeah. So feed those directly onto onto a snake chain, leather, or any or any kind of chain really, leather, memory wire, is perfect. Thicker gauges of wire. You could put it on a cuff bangle if you wanted yes. to. Fourteen pounds and ninety nine pence. Now you know we're not stopping there. I've said it out loud. We've verbalised and confirmed that this will be going to a single figure price tag. I mean, look how beautiful that is, Monica. Oh. That's so pretty. I know I'm biased, but I do like that. <laughs> no, no, well, deservedly so. It's absolutely gorgeous. What, you've got just a couple of seed beads in there? Yeah. In, bet in between, you've got the bale. That's so commercial, though, isn't it? Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. That's the kind of jewellery that you could, you would imagine on the high street. You would imagine yeah. in a, in a high-end jewellers. You would imagine, you know, in... I don't know, one of the big chains that do, um, it becomes quite an iconic design. 
What you wouldn't imagine, though, is that that would come with a £10 price tag. Yeah, no. <laughs> Definitely not. These are cultured pills and 925 sterling silver. Susan Pauline, Alison Wiltshire, West Midlands, Essex, Caroline Jennifer, Margaret Hilda, Meyer and Powis, Mariska, Sue, Paula, Lynn, Kathleen, Anne, new customer Elaine. Well done to those of you that have shopped ahead. You've got to remember Pearl 10 as well. Oh. Oh, uh, <laughs> what did you do, Ross? What did you do? I know you get you. Yeah, but it's seven pounds twenty for yeah. pearls and sterling silver. Well, okay, that bale as well. If you just put it on a shepherd hook, it would look nice as an earring, wouldn't it? Yes, that's not base metal. These aren't faux pearls. <laughs> seven ninety nine. Madness. Can we just do a bit of a tally a second? So hang on. Seven ninety-nine plus what was the what was the first two were twenty. So we're talking thirty five pounds. Minus almost two pounds for your pearl ten. Yeah, minus your pearl ten. All of this thirty five pounds. With the sterling silver bales, how amazing is that? Actually, it's more like 33. Yeah. Unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. So make sure you're checking out your baskets, everybody. Congratulations to each and every single one of you. If you have any questions for Monica, do message us live in the studio. Make sure you're checking out. And remember, your Kingman turquoise is just around the corner. Monica, so you said you're going to be demonstrating the Solomon's bar, the sliding knot. Do we have a, a macrame board by any chance? There's usually one here on the desk. There is usually. Today. I don't know. Go to Stan. He's on it. He and is then on it. This necklace. Oh, macrame. Yeah. Oh, perfect. The macrame board. So this necklace isn't finished yet because I was going to show you the clasp on it. So no. <laughs> I'm going to show you how to uh, do it. Okay. On that one. That's a lovely necklace. I really like that one. I do it too. Yeah. It's very wearable, isn't it? Yeah. Right. Okay. Super. Thank you for that. The trusty macrame board. Trusty macrame board. Yes. I didn't. I have one at home, obviously, but I didn't bring it because it's usually here on the desk. Yeah. <laughs> Typical, isn't right, it? I'm going to get this board out of the way. Oh, I might as well leave it. These out. boards are well loved, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> but everybody uses them. <laughs> it just yeah. shows how useful they are. Yeah. Right, so if I show you how far I've done the necklace, so I've, I've knotted it. Okay, I've just used some um, some Ceylon, uh, no, some Eslon thread, sorry. So this kind of thread, that thread there. Okay, and I've knotted them and I've knotted after the last beads as well. Obviously, this would work with any of your kits, this technique. Um, you just need to, depending on it, you can use silk cord for your, um, for your pearls or whatever cord will go through your beads. Okay. And then what I've done is le I've left quite a long section. Now, this is a necklace. There's no reason you can't do a slider clasp on a necklace. Um, it doesn't have to be a bracelet. So for a necklace, obviously, you want to leave long enough so that when you, when you bring your cords around, obviously, they're going to overlap. You need to make sure that it's long enough to go over your head. Okay, and then you're just going to pull it tight to tighten it to whatever length you want it, which is great because you can vary the length of your necklace and you don't have to fiddle around with it too much for people who um, have problems uh, doing up the clasps. So I've threaded on an extra, pearl, uh, an extra bead onto the cord, which slides around at the moment. There's nothing holding it in place. And I've just tied a knot on the ends of my cord uh, to stop that from falling off. Okay. Now, the way I'm going to put it around my macrame board, if I had a small one, it would go all the way around, but I'll show you how I normally do it because obviously with a bracelet, you wouldn't be able to get it around your board. So I go to the corner. Let me just do the other corner because that's what I usually use. So I want to do it the way it's going to be comfortable. There we go. So you put your necklace or your bracelet or whatever it is under your board. And then I'm going to take the lo one loose end and I'm going to put it corner to corner like that. Okay, and then I'm going to take the other end of my cord and I'm going to put it the other way. So th that one has got the, the bead on this end, this one has got the bead on the other end. So obviously you want them to overlap and you can slot them into the same hole there. And then what I also usually do is I take a pen or a pencil and I put it under my cord to hold it up, which makes it easier for you to thread your, your extra piece of cord underneath. That's a top tip. It is, I find it very handy to do that actually. I always do that with my macrame as well. Yeah. 
And then for a knot, you only really need, you don't need very much thread, depending on how long you want your, your uh, clasp to be. So I've got here probably about half a meter of thread, maybe 60 centimeters. And then I'm just gonna thread it under and I'm going to tie it into a normal overhand knot. Okay, just like that. That's how I usually start. I mean, I suppose different people do it different ways. This is how I do it. And then again, you're gonna start with your macrame knot. So you take your left thread you put it over your double cords. Then you're gonna take your right thread, you put it over this cord that you've, you've brought over to that side. And then you're gonna go under everything and you're gonna come up through this loop that you've made on the left. Okay, if you do any macrame, it's your standard macrame knot and then you pull it tight. Okay, then you're gonna do the same thing again but the other way. So you're gonna take your right thread, put it over your double cords, take your left thread over the loose end and under everything and up through that loop there, okay? And you're just gonna alternate your knots like that. Uh, so start from the left thread. And then the way I remember which thread to start with, there are different ways that you can remember. So if you look at your, your work so far, can we zoom in a little bit more on that? I don't know if this camera can zoom in. Oh, there we go. So can you see with each knot that you do, there's a little bridge over the top of your thread. So at the moment, this thread is coming above the, um, the cords underneath. Whereas this thread, there's a little bridge at the top and then this cord comes out under that bridge. So the, the, the one that's got the little bridge on, that's your thread that you're gonna start with. Can you see? So there's a little bridge. So I'm gonna start with this thread, put it over my other threads, then I'm gonna take my other th thread and go underneath everything and up through the hole, like that. So now you can see the little bridges on the other side. So this cord is the one that comes out underneath your little bridge. So that's the cord that you start with. So left over right, then you go under ev everything, which is great because if you, start, if you have to stop because the phone rings or something, then you can just look at your work and see all the, the little bridges on the right hand side. So I'm gonna start with my right thread and carry on with the left. Because for a long time when I did macrame, I always had an issue with which way, which is the next knot to do. Okay, so you're just going to carry on like that until your knot is however long you want it to be. I would say in a necklace, um, I usually do probably about an inch length. I suppose the same on a bracelet, really. Uh, to be honest, it doesn't really matter because whatever length you make it, it's going to hold the necklace, so it doesn't really matter. So it just depends on um, aesthetics, really. I mean, maybe if it was a really heavy necklace, I might do a longer one, just so that it fits in with the, with the design, really. So it's not so much about functionality. So any length you want. So let's say that's the length that, I've, that I wanted to do there. And then I would take my little trusty hypo cement. And then I would put a little dab of glue just here on both sides where your thread if your glue has got a little dried up bead at the end, take that out so your glue will come out. And you just put, I just put it all over the thread. Now when it dries, um, this thread will, will go a bit darker when you put the glue on, but once it's dry, uh, it'll come back again. The color will, it will lighten again, so don't worry too much if it changes color. So I just put it all over, be quite generous. The only thing you want to be careful of when you're putting your glue on is don't get any glue on these two threads here. Sorry, Monica. Sorry, yes. Liam's mischievous deal. Yes. Two hypo cement glues. Yes, that's where I got this glue from. <laughs> Is it, are you got involved in what? <laughs> now we launched the hypo cement in the birthday. Yeah. Yeah. Six hundred yeah. old. At six pound ninety nine. It is yes. Which is more affordable than we can find elsewhere. Yes. Liam yes. rocks up. That was last Wednesday as well when I was here. <laughs> is this why you've got... He's what? What do you mean white collar? Oh, he's up in the offices, oh, yeah. right. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's not in the trenches like us. Okay, yeah, fair enough. You mean he's a pen pusher? <laughs> he took them to what? They're 6 99 each. So you get two. If you bought two separately during the birthday, this is what you pay. Okay. And by the way, 
There's only 50 left at this bun in this bundle. Yeah, well, that's amazing. Yes, but... <laughs> amazing. A, a little cheeky discount, say, just to give you a perks of a bundle. Let's say... So that's five pound per tube. Yeah. What did Liam do? Liam. <laughs> he was very naughty last Wednesday. <laughs> Liam. Okay, just if you, uh, even if you've got hypo cement, this is not, this is a mad deal. I can't believe he did this. <laughs> oh my goodness me! Is this where you bought it? Well, so again, as employees, we do get perks. Well, I would have bought it, except um, Carol opened the packaging, so obviously. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. So obviously, yeah, yeah, you gain, you gain some uh, hypo cement. That's how I tend to get mine as well. Because um, it does sell out, and it's going to sell out again. But I was saying last Wednesday that I've probably got three or four tubes of it on the go at a time at home, because you can use it for your arts and crafts, you can use it for your kids' broken toys, you can use it for your... Everything! You know, kitchen fridge magnets that break, yeah. I use them for that. Do you know what, yeah. I've got a radiator cover mm. that um, we, one of the slats broke. Yeah. High press cement. Absolutely. Nice and secure. Absolutely. Done. Yeah. yeah. What did Liam do? So for one yeah. pound and a penny extra, you get another tube of hypo cement glue. Yeah. Liam Dickin. <laughs> and I know you're watching, Liam. He's in the office, isn't he? Is Liam in? What's that, Liam? <laughs> Liam. Yeah, you. He's watching the screens. What is that? What is that? Unbelievable. <laughs> So then I would leave. I would leave the glue to dry. Obviously, Sorry, first. yeah. Go That's back okay. to you now. Yeah. And then I would just cut the thread off really close. So yeah. leave probably about a millimeter or two millimeters. Okay. And then you can use your lighter. I did bring a lighter. Here we go. There we go. So actually, well, you can take it off the board first. Because it makes it easier to hold. So I can put the board away now. Okay, and then make sure you don't burn yourself. So you just melt that little end bit, make sure it doesn't catch on fire. And squish it flat. It did catch on fire that time, but <laughs> so you just want to be careful with it. And then what you can do is you can put it out with the with the metal part of your lighter if you don't want yes. to touch it. Do you know because it does hurt if you get it burnt on your fingers? It, it does, yeah. So it's plastic just use isn't this it? bit of your lighter and um, obviously that's cold and of course then you won't feel it as well. So it squishes the end of your cord up against your knot That's a top tip too. and then also before it dries you can just make sure that you can slide it can you see I've got a little bit of glue on there so if you just slide it around before the glue dries then you'll see that um, it's, it's kind of running loose and then I would leave it to dry and then of course it's essentially that's done I would do the same thing on the end here so put a little bit of glue there yeah. and burn that off as well with the knot and that's your that's your sliding knot. and you can open it really nice and wide depending on how length how long the cord is that you left yeah. So that should be long enough to go over your head. And then all you have to do behind your back is just pull those tight. And there's no messing around Amazing. with clasps or anything like that. And do you know how great is that? If you, you know, people have allergies to precious metals, Absolutely. don't they sometimes? And I mean, so. how long did that take? That took me about three minutes, <laughs> probably. Yeah. Yeah, I do like the sliding knot, and yeah. it gives you that adjustability. Wow, uh, amazing. Absolutely amazing, Monica. And again, it just goes to show you don't have to have the, 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 the actual metal class. You can, use, you can use a Solomon's bar. Absolutely. Sliding knot, whichever way you refer to it. Um, fabulous. Thank you. Loved all your makes so far. And Monica's got more inspiration and talent coming up. Um, in the uh, 12 o'clock. So we've got your beautiful masterclass coming up. But I think we can squeeze a few more deals in before we bring you your king, uh, Kingman. Now, um, I do have that pearl yes, pendant. I was sent these pendants as well to use. So the hyper cement crazy deal, not mischievous, just wrong that was, Lily. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> Monica, that necklace is absolutely beautiful, isn't it? And I mean, it's so simple. I mean, anybody, if you're making your first piece of jewellery, you could make that. 
just a few seed beads in between, or anything, you can use some sterling silver beads in between if yeah. you don't want to use sterling silver. You don't even have to know how to knot no. to make that necklace. It's, it's beaded, just threaded on. But look how beautiful it is. So commercial, so wearable. That pendant is what we're bringing to you now. It's yep. got the, like the sterling silver, almost Mobius design. Yeah. And it does sit on sort of uh, almost like a plate of 925 sterling silver. And then in the center, you've got this elevated peg. Now it's this peg that I personally would use the hypo cement glue. Absolutely, yeah. Um, put a little touch um, of the glue on the top of there and then here's your half drill pearl just size it up before you maybe glue it up yeah yeah for example okay, fits perfect fits beautifully doesn't it so leave that overnight to bond and adhere you just made yourself luxury jewelry how amazing is that wait a minute pill 10 Oh. Pill 10, so you'll get your further 10% discount off this as well. It is 925 sterling silver that makes this pearl pendant £9. So can we work out then how much was that kit with the with the white pearls? That was um, under was tenner, wasn't seven, it? What do we take seven, it to? Seven, seven ninety nine. So let's have 8 plus this is 10, so that's 18 minus almost £2 for your 10% off. So £16. So sixteen pounds, and I mean to that, that necklace, necklace. You can sell that for well over a hundred pounds. I think so as well. Yeah. Absolutely, nine ninety nine. But use your pearl ten. How many do I have of this pendant? Just shy of a hundred, but there's loads of you there. Hello, Tracy, Heather, Julie. Hello to Caroline, Donna, Morag, Jan. Hello to Staffordshire. You know, I, I, I just. Glue it, leave it overnight, stick it on a sterling silver chain. You've just made yeah. luxury jewellery. It's that simple. But I mean, I, I can't get over for £16. I mean, even if you don't sell your jewellery, where are you going to find yourself? A sterling silver, genuine freshwater cultured pearl necklace like that for £16. <laughs> um, Adam says that he knows the answer to that question. Hmm. You're not. You're not. Yeah. You are, if you buy it from jewellery, but go and yeah. put it together yourself. Pre yeah, precisely. And that would be lovely on a charm bracelet too, wouldn't it? Absolutely. Don't forget, you've got that elastic bundle coming up if you wanted to make like, like a pearl stretchy bracelet with one of those on the bottom. Yes. So beautiful. So commercial as well, aren't they? So, what so a beautiful commercial. gift as well. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. perfect. I love pearls. I love pearls because they're like, you know, we've always said, as Coco Chanel said as well, they're just always appropriate. You know, you can wear them to absolutely every occasion. Um, we had about 100 of those, but they're flying out the door. Gary, hello to you. Anne, Jan, hello to you. Donna, new customers getting involved. Heath, make sure you check out your baskets. Fabulous. Um, moving on to... Yes, the one in the front. The very front. This? Yes. Oh, that you had in on the yellow, the yellow. So the locket, the ge but not just any locket. It's yeah. a gemstone locket, an interchangeable gemstone locket. Yes, yeah, so you get a completely different look every time you swap it around. So within this piece, um, you get the sterling silver locket piece, which is seven and a half by eleven and a half millimeters on the bail. Plus, um, you can see I've got Burmese jadeite, turquoise, and also black onyx. And you just basically, if I lift up the pendant, because it is one of those rotating ones too. Can you see this? Um, here you go. One second. There you are. So, yeah, you basically choose the, the, the actual gemstone, pop it into place, close it like a book, and you've just got one lock. And you can yes. st you've still got space to put memorabilia, if you like, yes, in there as well. Yes, of course. And, oh. and also... Last week I was wearing a seed beaded ring that a lot of people commented on. Yes. And it had one of these stones as the as the center point. So you could, if you, if you decide to only use one of them for your locket, the other two you can bezel, you can you can do whatever you like. Gallery wire, yep. seed bead frame. Um, 14 pounds and 99 pence only to get hold of this beautiful interchangeable locket. Um, yeah, I mean, lockets are, are, have had somewhat of a revival haven't they recently but they're not generally speaking around that price point amazing stay where you are you've got your kingman turquoise coming up very rarely do i get the opportunity to talk about kingman turquoise um internationally it is actually one of the oldest locations of source um and we'll talk about that uh, at greater length during the deal of the day now this is a long strand for turquoise normally tur turquoise is about 25 centimeters yeah. here at jewelry maker one more auction and then we're going to dive into the break and then uh, um, into your kingman turquoise now an essential and we've brought you essentials haven't we throughout the course of the morning thus far now there's 78 of these available your trusty elastic um, everybody, 
everybody needs elastic within their stash because there's nothing wrong even if you are one of the most skilled jewelry makers like our lovely monica there's nothing wrong with resorting back to a stretchy is there absolutely um it's the quickest thing to make and i mean and it's just so easy to put on i've taken some of my, my watches i've taken the strap off and made elastic yeah. straps for my watches even because it's so much easier to put on Yes, uh, that's a genius idea. Mm. You can loom with elastic too, can't you? You can, yes. You can do lots of things with elastic. So you are getting all three spools, is that right? All three. Um, we're going to do it in one price crash. So, sorry, all three together in one item. You get 100 metres. I'm confused. 100 metres on each, wow. Is that each? So I'm looking at 300, 300 wow. metres here. Wow. So you get two of your clear and one of your black, and this is a 0 0.6 millimetre elastic. 0 0.6 is like one of my go-tos because it will go through most gemstones, yeah. even, your, yeah. even your micros. Yes, yes. It does depend, not all, but I'm not saying all of them. Most, but most of them it will go through, yeah. Yeah, because it's slightly finer. I don't know if you can see that. It will go through some of your pearls as well. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, here we go. Can actually strip this and elastic. Can you see? If you want to double it up, you always can. Absolutely. You've got a hundred meters on each of the spools. I need this. I mean, how many bracelets can you make with that? That's enough for a lifetime, really. <laughs> yeah, that, that's true. Hang on a minute. Ten pound per one hundred meters. How does that sound? That's a lot of bracelets that you're going to get there. Not just bracelets, necklaces and rings. Yeah. Twenty nine pounds and ninety nine pence only. That's 10p per metre. When we say condition your elastic, we're talking about do this, basically. So give it yeah. a good stretch before you actually start working with it. That takes any sort of uh, stretch that might happen after you've made it. Now, in a minute's time, £10 each is not your price. Ooh. Under £20 for 300 metres of elastic. I desperately need this. You know when we launched the, the coloured elastics? Yes. And I was with you? Yes. And I bought them? Yes. I forgot there was no clear elastic in there. Oh, no. And I need clear elastic. Wasn't there? Oh, no. Wasn't, wasn't There's there. lots of lovely colours which I've used. Yeah. But I, want, I wanted the clear too. Oh. So I need to get hold of this. I've got loads there of colourful elastic. There wasn't any elastic. black in there either. No. No. It had the colours. Yeah. But if you're looking for the, sort of the clear or the black, then this is the bundle to get involved with. I shall be doing exactly the same because we're dipping into a break in a few moments' time and I'm desperate for elastic. Absolutely desperate. 0. 0.6, amazing. Happy days. I don't have to buy. I can get the 0. 0.4, the 0. 0.5. I can get the one millimeter and I absolutely do but for me it's just as easy to double it up yeah absolutely. so easy 29.99 but we are going under 20 pounds 300 meters six pounds 66 each can we just how much is that working out at okay so 300 meters let's say you use I don't know 10 inches to make one stretchy bracelet. Can we do this math a moment? Am I well, that's what I'm trying to it? work out. So it's 40 inches per metre. Yeah. So that's four per metre. So 1,200 stretchy bracelets. How much does that work out in pence per bracelet then? So hang on, 19.99 divided by 1,200. 2p. <laughs> <laughs> 2p per stretchy bracelet. I mean, that's pretty. That's that's a good deal, isn't it? That's that's, that's an amazing deal. Isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> how, many, how much is it in Freddos? If we're going to do it, I love it. Everybody, that's true. That's how the British actually uh, um, discuss inflation, isn't it? You know, as as Brits, we always yeah. talk about. Oh my goodness, me! Have you seen? Have you seen the cost of? I don't know your petrol, or have you seen the oh, cost yeah. of the, the the cost of electricity or gas at the moment? Have you seen the price of a Freddo? <laughs> That's how we gauge inflation, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> how many Freddos could we get for this price tag? How much? About sixty p, I think now. I think they're about sixty p. Freddos are about the same price as a second class stamp. <laughs> Google, how much is a Freddo? I'm sure somebody's asked Google that question. Because like, it's a very, very, a very British question, isn't it? In Tesco's what? They're 25B, I beg your pardon. Oh. Sorry, Freddo. 
Higher or lower in Sainsbury's? Higher. Oh, Sainsbury's. Oh, Waitrose, double it. <laughs> Sorry. 25p ah. across the board. Okay, amazing. So now, uh, 19 pounds and 99 pence divided by 25p. 19.99 divided by 25p. How many Freddos can we get for that? Is it 80? 80 Freddos. Bargain. They are good. It's good chocolate. <laughs> but I'd rather 2p for a stretchy bracelet. How many? 79. Get 79 frogs. Chocolate, chocolate frogs. Um, well done, everybody. There's loads of you getting involved. Sorry, we went off the complete beat track, didn't we, then? <laughs> and we didn't um, even mention the ice cream yet. <laughs> yeah, that's it. If it's not ice cream, it's chocolate, <laughs> isn't it? How fabulous. But again, very usable size, your 0 0.6. I'm trying to get this one here. There we go. Um, so if I hold that out, it'll go through all your uh, most of your pills. It will go through possibly your micro gemstones. Oh, that would be nice. Use black elastic for white pearls. Yeah. Oh. A bit, a bit more Chanel-esque, isn't yes. it? A little attention to detail. Meters, 300 meters you're getting. 100 on each of these spools. I like that word, spool. Uh, Susan, Angela, <laughs> Ali. Hello to you, Susan, Irina, Liz, Lucy, Lynn, Sally, Susan, Anne, Anne, Ken, Karen, Maureen, Beverly, Lucy, new customer, Angela, Susan and Brian, Mary. Keep on dialing through and do not go anywhere because we are about to take a trip to one of the most celebrated internationally locations to source for beautiful turquoise and also the oldest known mine in the world. Kingman Turquoise is up as your deal of the day. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewellery Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewellery Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewellery Maker. Jewellery Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewellery Maker. Do 
jewellery makers. Did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewellery Maker. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewellery Maker. Jewellery Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewellery Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Welcome back, everybody. I'm so excited about this opportunity. I mean, we all know what turquoise is, don't we? All know it's a beautiful gemstone that comes in lots of different locate from lots of different locations in the world. But um, and maybe really, uh, I'll be honest, m myself probably never really considered the location prior to actually learning more about it here at Jewelry Maker and ultimately yeah. Gemporia. Um, but country of origin, probably with turquoise more than any other gemstone, and emeralds possibly, does have an impact. Um, and it has an impact not just visually, but on its price point. Internationally, USA turquoise is considered to be the best in the world. Um, it's also a location in the USA, if you think where the majority of the turquoise mines are, turquoise forms in very arid areas, so desert-like areas. I always th imagine it, sorry, I've got uh, <coughs> some tea and probably drunk it too quickly. Um, so if I start hiccuping. But if you can imagine where, where the land craves water, it's quite ironic to me that then it gets the most intense blue. Yeah. You know, where it's quite desert-like, quite red or, or, or orangey, the landscape, dusty, if you like. When, if you've ever been to Arizona, it's very dusty. That's where the finest quality turquoise forms. And if you were to see a map of Arizona, which is where Kingman, where Sleeping Beauty, where Cochise, um, to name just a few, it's scattered with turquoise mines. Mm. But Kingman, out of all of those mentioned, is the most historic and is also still operational. So if you hear Kingman turquoise, know that it is probably the most famous turquoise in the world. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and this is a write-up and it tells you about this gemstone, the history of this gemstone and the desirability of the gemstone as well. And they say, the Kingman Turquoise Mine is one of the oldest and highest producing turquoise mines in America. It was originally discovered by prehistoric Indians well over a thousand years ago. Kingman Turquoise is known for its beautiful sky blue colour and produces many variations of blue turquoise. The Kingman Turquoise Mine also produces green turquoise from the turquoise mountain side of the mine. Kingman Turquoise has been the biggest supplier of turquoise in southwestern turquoise jewellery industry for nearly as long as the American turquoise jewellery industry has existed. In fact, the Kingman Turquoise Mine is, was once part um, of a turquoise boom around 1000 AD when the Mayan cultures were using sorry, was using a lot of turquoise for self-adornments um, and ceremonial items. Today, as in the old times, blue turquoise from Kingman, Arizona is king. Even though the mine produces all colours of turquoise and green turquoise is almost becoming blue, turquoise equals in, pop turquoise equals in popularity these days. So yes, it's interesting because... Um, I'm going to show you a beautiful picture now of the Kingman mine. But that mountain range that you're about to see, it's really interesting how Kingman turquoise forms because on the one side of the mountain, it's the blue. Yeah. On the other side of the mountain, it's the green. Oh, interesting. So really, really exciting. So to the left is the photo of the mineral park just outside Kingman, Arizona, and to the right is the main pit at the Kingman turquoise mine, the most prolific American turquoise mine. Um, and I think that's actually globally as well. It might, don't quote me on it, but I'm fairly sure Kingman Turquoise is the most prolific turquoise mine in the world. Wow. 
Um, in terms of colour valuation, and this is not just solely about Kingman turquoise, this is about all varieties of turquoise. In terms of value, colour evenness and saturation are the primary considerations. A turquoise capacity for taking a good polish without stabilisation is also important. However, you could also argue that stabilisation adds longevity to your turquoise because it is quite a, uh, a soft stone if it doesn't have that treatment, so it's about preservation. Generally, darker shades and less green tints in blue colours add more value to the turquoise. Of course, consumers who appreciate matrix patterns would consider their beauty crucial to determining their value. Spiderweb turquoise veined with black matrix in a pattern that look like crocheted lace is popular as well. Well, the deal of the day that I'm about to show you is that last sentence, basically. It is that beautiful quality of blue that it says that it's discussed in the first paragraph, the most valuable, and it has some very fine, detailed, delicate matrix, I would say, that gives you that, uh, that crocheted lace. But again, just to highlight the value and how, how, how steeped in consideration Kingman Turquoise actually is. This is a Kingman Turquoise cabochon. Um, in gold, and all right, that's a, that's a fairly significant amount of gold. Yeah. You have a dusting of, of diamonds there. £5,316 for that, and it's a pre-owned piece of jewellery. Wow. You know, you know, it's not the gold or the diamonds that carrying that price point. It is the turquoise. Well, the turquoise is taking centre stage, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. I can show you a few more. Oh, nice. Look at this. 29-inch genuine Kingman mine large nugget turquoise necklace. Again, that looks really photoshopped to me. Um, it, does, it doesn't actually look like she's it wearing does. it. Um, it's not quite sitting properly for me, but... It's not quite you, hanging in the right direction. Yeah, and if you want me to buy, <laughs> spend £7,000 of my hard-earned money, I want to see the actual pendant. But it's got five-star reviews, I guess, but it's Kingman Turquoise, and again, 29 inches, they are looking for seven grand for it. It's the price of a car, goodness me. Um, I have another, again, Kingman Turquoise bead necklace in gold. Is that price right? Am I reading that right? Eleven thousand six hundred and thirty-one pounds, but it's rosary linking, isn't it? Or chain, or a variety of, and it might. It, I don't. It is in gold, okay, but eleven grand. Gosh. <laughs> and I have to say, the turquoise, whilst beautiful, is not as good as the Tur Kingman turquoise that I'm about to show you as your deal of the day. Genuinely, genuinely. I can show you one more. This is lovely, lovely colour. Simple, you could make that. It's got what French wire at the top, you've got a simple bolt ring clasp, Kingman turquoise necklace, three and a half thousand pounds. It is, and, and yes, you will have the history, you will have the people know Kingman turquoise. Kingman is probably more famous than Sleeping Beauty turquoise, to be truthful, and that's because it dates back right the way to 1000 AD. Now, so you are getting the history, you are getting the quality. You are getting the most desired shape, and that is the round. But you are also getting the length, because this is quite possibly one of the longest turquoise strands I've ever brought to air. Normally, I expect it to be half that. Yeah. Beautiful. Look at the colour. I don't think that's 20. I think that's more than 20 centimetres. I would simply not that in a necklace yes i probably i wouldn't sell it i'd be keeping it because of the history and legacy of kingman but you could and you could sell it for a significant premium i've got 30 available personally i think it's more beautiful than sleeping beauty because i like those uh, like the matrices in there. Yeah, well, they said it's like crochet, didn't yeah. they? They said specifically of your Kingman turquoise, they're talking about that fine crochet. Beautiful. Going back to that necklace that I made the comparison with, and I did. I'm not even going to say, I'm not even going to, I don't hesitate saying this. Your Kingman turquoise is better quality than this necklace because that, whilst I like the matrix, it shouldn't take over the colour. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, and some of those, it is taking over the colour. Yeah. 11 and a half. Gram, uh, grand, 11 and a half grand for that necklace. And yes, there's a gold weight to it. Right, yeah, okay. It's not costing me 11,000 pounds though. 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> in gold weight. If you could make that, are you happy at 129? Uh, well, absolutely, compared to 11. <laughs> it's a big difference, isn't it? And, and they use how many do you reckon? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33. 33 approximately individual rounds. Well, you've got that more than that in this strand. Yeah. Shall I give it a count? I think so. Sixty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. The history, the legacy, the quality that comes from the Kingman mine, still very much operational, still to this day, right the way back from one thousand AD, hailed as the best location of source in the world. There are only thirty available opportunities, and I could genuinely count on one hand the amount of times that I've ever spoke, had the opportunity to talk about Kingman turquoise. Over a third of the stock has gone already. It's a long strand. Twen I think it's longer than 20 centimetres, I mean, personally. You could, uh, you could so, sorry to interrupt. No, carry on. You could so easily make that rosary link necklace for yourself. You can use your jewellery maker wire. You can use your sterling silver wire. Even if you use your sterling silver wire, you know, it, you still wouldn't be anywhere near the 11,000 pounds that they're no. selling it for. Two, you know. six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 31. Beg your pardon, 31. But certainly 31 rosary linked would be long enough to go over your head. Absolutely. Yeah. £69.99 pence for, ki for certified Kingman turquoise. Just over half the stock has already gone. A one minute clock on your screen because we're going to take it to your deal of the day price tag. These are the biggest turquoise. I've got to be honest, probably of all locations. We don't bring you Cochise. We very rarely bring you Sleeping Beauty. We rarely bring you Mexican, Tibetan or, um, or Peruvian. Rarely ever. These are huge in their size and we are going even lower. It's that popper colour. Remember that robin egg blue, which is most sought after. But what's so exciting about Kingman, A, you've got the history behind it, but you have that really delicate matrix. It shouldn't overtake the blue. You should always see that one intensity that evenness of saturation and color um, but I like the fact that you have that sort of crocheted lace look I know lots of you got it in your baskets you're waiting to see that price point don't wait too long though there was only a limited quantity there was only 30 at the beginning of this deal of the day down to the last 12 in 10 seconds we are taking look they're huge they're absolutely yeah. huge everybody pays that final low congratulations You've just got hold of Kingman Turquoise, eight millimetres in their size. They're giants. And you ha wow, £49.99 only, steeped in history. Again, this location celebrated right the way back to 1000 AD. Single figure quantities, Judith, Jackie, Kay, well done, Elaine, Pat, Catherine, Durham, Nora, Cumbria, Caroline, London, Sophie, Tina, hello to you, Barbara, Belinda, lots of multi-buyers, Scottish borders getting involved, I've only got a handful of them left, if you don't check out your basket sooner rather than later, you might well miss out on this opportunity. A few of us, myself absolutely included, could say that we own King, uh, Kingman Turquoise, um, and can I just correct our graphics, it's not Kingsman, it's Kingman. Um, that's our graphic, so yeah, um, our typo, easily done though, I guess. Uh, Kingman Turquoise, few of us can actually say that we own that, um, especially at £49.99. pence. Down to the final three opportunities, congratulations um, everybody. I'll leave those final two there because we're super over allocated. Now, you know what I'm thinking, don't you? You have to sort of get both. <laughs> So that it graduates. <laughs> I'm going to keep this strand on the back of my hand. Can you imagine that piece of jewellery? Yes, yeah, I'll take both those strands, follow on the sides because it kind of follows on from the other one, and then uh, knot it with like a coral I red. I thinking coral. Thread, yeah. From that same parcel. Because that's kind of the classic uh, combination, isn't it? Yeah. Turquoise with coral. Look at how beautiful that is. Ah. Oh. What are we taking this to, Ross, just for my ears for a second? How about if I told you 
that you could get both for less than £100. Do you remember, you know, apart from the history of Kingman Turquoise, the legacy of Kingman Turquoise, the fact that it is documented widely, when we talk about turquoise, we tend to talk about Kingman alongside the locations like Cochise and Sleeping Beauty, but um, do you remember, comparing with ourselves, whatever the country of origin, when we did turquoise strands, which in my, in my mind were smaller than this, shorter than this, they were triple figures, not that long ago. Yeah. Not that long ago. And yet I've just made a price promise that you can get both deal of the day opportunities for under £100. Now I'm going to say this, which is really exciting. This is probably the biggest quantity turquoise auction I've ever brought to air. Wow. Do we all agree? Yeah. Because turquoise normally, if we're lucky, we'll have 50. Yeah. If we're lucky. Why is that? Turquoise is a very shallow forming gemstone. What that basically means is it's pointless digging to great depths because you just get less and less and less of it. The history of turquoise tends to change quite frequently because mines run out, um, because it is so shallow forming. So they'll move on to the next area. Kingman turquoise, very unusually for this gemstone, has got a long standing history. Very, very unusual. I don't believe, and I, I'm going to check this with Ross. Ross, I don't think we've ever done a quantity auction like this of turquoise before. We have 150, which is huge for this gemstone. I can, I'm more likely to bring you 150 Jedi red spinels. I'm more like jadeites, grandidurites. Yeah, I'm kind of uh, a bit jealous of the, um, the people in the vault who pack the, pack the, the uh -huh. packages. Cause can you imagine 150 of these? Wow. Of Kingman <laughs> that would be amazing. Okay. <laughs> okay, well, how about Monica then? I'm just going to remove this strand. That was the previous one, and say, in a in, in a dream world, yes. How many would if budget wasn't even something that you had to worry about? Mm. In a dream world, how many of these would you buy to make that ultimate piece of jewelry? Probably six or eight. Okay. Because you know those pictures that you see of the sort of the tribal South, yes. South American women wearing masses of turquoise. Oh, I love that. It's beautiful. With the coral, you know? So I would um, have to make something like that. <laughs> so if I said then that this Kingman Turquoise Deal of the Day, because we've got that big quantity, and I know we do all have to work to a budget, don't we? That's the reality, or most of us do anyway. I don't think there's been a better opportunity than right here, right now, for you to get the quantities that you were just talking about. Yeah. It's the biggest quantity deal of the, uh, sorry, turquoise that we've ever done historically and it just so happens to be the most the, uh, the the oldest location of source in the world does it have here we go look evenness of color and that strong saturation does it have that intense robin egg blue absolutely oh, yeah. that's one of the traits that kingman turquoise is celebrated for does it have you know matrix but not too much matrix that it overtakes the color does it have those beautiful crocheted lace detailing Absolutely. This is a long strand. You've got 20 centimetres in rounds, which are still one of the most wasteful cuts. And we're not anywhere near your price point. Now, what we're going to do is match the price of the previous Kingman turquoise. And know that's your starting point. We've said, and I hope this was right, Ross, you can get both for less than £100. Done. Wow. Job done. Delivered. Happy days. You know, we've had turquoise a few times, including Kingman turquoise, and I think this is probably the most saturated. Do you know what it reminds me of? If, you ever, if you've ever done any jewellery photography and then you're sort of editing your photos to make them look a bit better, and then you play around with the saturation and you ac accidentally bump it up too much. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's what it looks it like. It does, yeah. It's so vibrant in its yeah. colour. 
you know we're not stopping there. These are slightly smaller in their millimeters. You've got that same beautiful graduation. In 50 seconds, we are taking it even lower. We have got the biggest quantity that I've ever seen um, for turquoise. Normally, it's a gemstone that if we're lucky, we'll see 50. If we are lucky, you've got that beautiful history, which I'm just going to recap whilst that clock is ticking away. Can we go back to that the, 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 the first slide, talking about the history of this beautiful gemstone? and what you're achieving. Um, so Kingman Turquoise is one of the oldest and highest producing turquoise mines in America. It was originally discovered by prehistoric Indians well over a thousand years ago. Kingman Turquoise, you gotta remember that now, like Burmese jadeite is younger than this. That's the reality, is younger than this. Wow. Um, so uh, Kingman Turquoise is known for its beautiful sky blue and produces many variations of blue turquoise. This is all about that robin egg blue color though, don't you think? Here it is, don't hesitate. We've got the biggest quantity. If you wanted to get hold of the previous strand, I don't know if that's still available, but it did absolutely fly. There's two, okay, there's two of those left in the vault if you wanted to create that gorgeous graduation. Now, if we had the same quantity of this or even if we had 50 60 maybe yeah that's all day long that's your prize because yeah. you know what when we were in ivy house that would have had a one in front of it it would have done it would have been 139 pounds but because we managed to source 150 you buy if we buy in bulk it means that we can normally negotiate the biggest and best deal do we reap the benefits of that deal then we pass those on to you. You get a better saving. It is going lower today. Good luck. There was 150. How about we said this? Norm normally a gemstone, we're able to say this statement. Multi-buyable. Yeah. Multi-buyable, because normally turquoise has, uh, you know, costs a pretty penny. Imagine this alongside that amazing pearl strand that we had earlier on this morning, about an hour ago. Imagine this alongside, here we go. How about oh, something like this? Some oh, lovely yeah. pearls in a beautiful sterling silver tassel. They, they, they just work, don't they, pearls, um, alongside uh, turquoise. What about How beautiful. Black like jadeite. About, but, oh, ooh. yes, Monica. Are we making the dreamiest kit in the world ever here? Yes, can I have that as a kit, please? Yeah, <laughs> if, yeah. hang on. Ooh. Hang on. How about that? Oh, look at that. Oh, I could make some jewelry with that. <laughs> How amazing is that? I'll put these three components which are coming your way on today's show together. There you go. Imagine that. How amazing. Right now, that has to be one of the most affordable turquoise strands ever not to be confused by the way with your how light your doubt how light uh, dyed how light and your dyed marcasite that has to be one of the most affordable strands of turquoise ever and it's steeped in history yes if your budget allows that would be the most beautiful kit ah oh, yes the most beautiful kit here we go I think it is turquoise. You're right there, Roscoe. Well oh, remembered. Yeah, he says, see. in the West, they call it piano black and we, can, we call it imperial. So look, that, look at the jewellery, the write-up. The luxurious and rare black jadeite jade necklace is composed of 37 certified untreated black jade beads that graduate in size from 8mm to 11 The strand is uh, complemented by 14 3mm robin egg blue turquoise beads stationed alongside the strand. You could wow. recreate that. And I have to say, your black jadeite's better and your turquoise is better. Yeah. I, and... It's also not going to cost you £34.99 <laughs> for this Kingman turquoise strand. Definitely worthwhile getting hold of your certificate of authenticity. We are going lower. We have a big quantity, arguably the biggest that we've ever had in turquoise from any location, wherever it might be all around the world. We don't often, my point is, we don't often see triple figure quantities of turquoise. Start dialing because you have. 60 seconds to get yourself ahead of the bombardment. You're going to do what? Oh. The inevitable bombardment on the phone lines and on the web. It is inevitable because what, what we've all just heard here, Monica, have you ever seen sleeping? Right, not just Kingman. 
Kingman, Sleeping Beauty, Cochise, any, any premium location of turquoise in the world. Have you ever heard that price point attached to any of them? Not for a strand, maybe for one bead. <laughs> Use this time wisely. Not enough people, though, I don't think, Ross. If we're going to go that low, we need to make sure we sell them out, don't we? Shoot, what do you reckon? Okay, Ross says, I reckon at the end of this clock, I will tell you. Yeah. There's 30 left of the previous strand. Sorry, two left out of 30. Beg your pardon, say it the right way around. And that closed at 49.99. This strand... In another 60 seconds, we're going to half the previous strand's price. Yes. We're going to take this to £24.99. That could well be one of the best price Kingman turquoise strands. Turquoise. Purely because of the quantity we've taken it that low. This is why I always say, if we had 50, 60... It would be probably more like 39.99, 49.99, which would be absolutely amazing. Still, we managed to negotiate an even better deal for you all. But again, go back to when we were in Ivy House um, a few years ago. This would have been 100 and something. It would have been a triple figure price tag. And that was still a great deal. That's not me sort of uh, um, being derogatory. That was still a great deal. Well, that's what I was going to say at, at that price when the price drops if I were to get the six strands I was talking about that yeah. would be about the price we originally would have had for one strand exactly hmm. in seven seconds it's happening Monica it's Valerie's multi-bought Cumbria's multi-bought Renee Pauline Sandy hello to you Margaret Judith Pam Jalanta Karina Sal Sandy sorry Alan Heather Antoinette well done to you Karen new customers Warwickshire getting involved 24 pounds <laughs> And 99 pence only for the history, the legacy that is Kingman Turquoise. It goes beautifully with your type A jade. It goes beautifully with every gem. That's the reality Turquoise does. Nora, Philip and Maureen, Pauline, Catherine, West Midlands, Carol, Sophie. Hello to you, C Stephen and Susan, Maker in Gloucestershire. I can't keep up with you. The phone lines have gone nuts. Again, we fully expected that to be the case. If you love the combination of, of uh, turquoise alongside your type A black jadeite, then just bear with me because that's coming up for the first time ever in a bundle. Um, lots of firsts today. First time we've ever had 150 quantity in turquoise? Possibly. Possibly. You know, it pop along to our sister channel. How often do they do turquoise pieces? If they do, it's in a showcase. Um, but they're never full strands, they're never full turquoise necklaces like this. $24.99. Yeah, as we said earlier on at the beginning of this deal of the day, you know, today, if you've always wanted one of those heavily beaded turquoise necklaces, that you know, like the uh, um, Kate Blanchette necklace. Yes. I don't know if it's Kingman that she's wearing, but um, she wears a big, heavily uh, turquoise round beaded necklace. That would have been thousands. In fact, definitely would have been because it was Tiffany's and Co. This is the best opportunity for you to sort of recreate that design at the most affordable price tag. Worthwhile getting your certificate of authenticity. And maybe, Roscoe, we perhaps need to, because of the certificate, address the spe a typo. I know that wasn't you, by the way. Um, but yeah, we'll get that address so it does say Kingman rather than Kingsman. Um, Peter, well done to you, Rosita, Cumbria, Christine, Stu uh, Susan, Catherine, Rosemary, Pauline. Belinda, well done to you, Gillian Kay, hello to you, Caroline, Nikki, Elaine, Hilary and Durham, um, so many of you getting involved. It, uh, one thing, I ha we haven't really mentioned the fact that these are rounds, which is incredibly wasteful, usually be very expensive. Again, I can only talk on my own personal experiences. When I was going to, uh, um, when I went to Tucson, which obviously there's a heavy influence of turquoise over there, being yeah. in Arizona, um, and I spoke... <clears throat> excuse me, I spoke to Jake about commissioning a turquoise piece to launch with you guys. And he was like, not rounds, too expensive. Rounds, too expensive. And yet here we are doing it for £24.99. <laughs> Amazing. Now, we are one auction away from your black jade. Uh, we're going to do this first, though. After the next auction. Oh, my goodness me. There are only six available, though. Seriously, that is so Cartier-esque, isn't it? Absolutely. I want one of these, Ross. You knew I l I'd love this, didn't you? I love it, love it, love it. 
does look like an emerald is his eye that's coming up one auction's time that's a green onyx amazing how beautiful is he coming up in one auction's time and then for the first time ever we are bringing you a bundle of type a black jadeite three strands of faceted rondelles that's coming up as well so after your panther jadeite pendant now who would like another closeout deal oh i was wondering what was in there <laughs> very nice little pouch uh, oh, oh look how beautiful this is coming up Oh, look, it's a, please say our graphics say metallic. Yeah, I was going to say, this is so metallic, it's untrue. Now, before I even show you, remember, because I forgot oh, again. Yeah. Pearl 10, Ross is saying you oh, are going to get one of a, a mega, mega, mega deal on this. It's a half drill, natural purple metallic pearl, and it's huge. There are 40 available at this price point. Use Pearl 10 on your checkout. A major deal, says Ross. Oh, look at it. It's absolutely Aww. stunning. Close out deal. Half drill. Just get yourself a nice little bale or maybe you want to use your wire. I've been multi-buying on this. And you get the I'm little posh. I'm just thinking it looks a lot, a lot, lot nicer even in person than it does on screen. Yes. I agree. It's, yeah. I think the cameras don't do it justice, to be no. honest. It's amazing. It's, it's so metallic, as you were saying. Yeah. Which, from a harvest of 10,000 pearls, less than 10 will be naturally metallic. Wow. Now, the last 40 chances, use Pearl 10. Remember, lowest price, buy a country mile. 60 seconds on your screens. In one minute from now, would... What did he just say? <laughs> Oh, massive closeout deal. Plus you get pill 10, use pill 10. This is huge. And again, you don't, it's 12 by 11 millimeters in its size. Um, from the harvest of pearls, less, 10,000 by the way, less than 10 will be naturally metallic. He is one of your 10. Wow. Pretty amazing, isn't it? Because you can see that really beautiful gold. You can see the silver, sometimes even flashes of kind of oil and water. There it is. Can you see that? The oil and water mixture of colours. That's what equates and qualifies a pearl to be metallic. Um, it comes in the pouch. Did you say what I think you just said? In 10 seconds, we're taking this under £20. OK, if you don't get these, I'll buy them all. Am I better off shopping? Of course I am. Of course I am. Especially with Pearl Town. So that's 18 pounds for this pearl. Wow. 18 pounds. Oh, you know those lovely earrings that we had earlier on? Oh, with yes, the, with, the, with the daisy. With the little flowers. Yeah. How nice would they be? Or just one, for, literally wow. on a really beautiful, simple bale, really plain bale, wearing it like so. Or like a, the like a floating the necklace on a, on a piece of monofilament, oh. so all you see is the pearl. Absolutely gorgeous. £19.99, but if you use your Pearl 10 code, which hopefully you will do, then you're talking £18. And it comes in that lovely little pochette. So you, if you're gifting, I buy a lot of, you know, what I buy and make, I gift. I do gift to lots of my friends and family. You know, that, you've got the little bag as well to present it in. Yeah. How pretty is that? Chantal, Neil and Linda, West Midlands, Karen, Linda, Stephen and Susan, maker in Holland, another maker in Rosita, Alan, maker, Sophie, Dorset. We only had 40 available though. Use Pearl 10, lowest price. Amazing. Congratulations to you all. Multi-buyers, I'd be doing exactly the same. Because during the birthday celebrations, you know we had those bail bundles. You know, you got oh, so yes. many, like tens. Oh, yeah. Um, oh, I multi-bought on those because I make them all the time. We've had just had mm -hmm. that amazing yeah. deal on the hypo cement glue as well. This is the kind of pills that I need. Put them on some sterling silver chains. So you were saying that uh, 10 out of 10,000 will be naturally metallic. Yeah. So we've got 40. So that means I had to harvest 40,000 pearls yeah. to get these 40. To get this opportunity. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Get, yeah, Imagine ex that. Exactly. 
And then we just go, oh, just give us 18 quid. It's fine. Yeah, it's fine. It's one of the rare varieties of your pills. There was only 40 available. Well done. Linda's got two. Rosita, hello to you. Uh, Margaret, congratulations. Stay where you are now. It is time. I'm so in love with this piece. I've it's the first time I've ever seen it. First time I've ever, ever seen it. It's stunningly beautiful and so Cartier. Cartier do, they've got a panther collection. They do um, handbags as well. I know this because it, it was certainly one of the collections that when I worked in the jewelers they had there. Um, and it's, it's so similar. If you can, can I ask you to Google something for me, Ross? Um, put vintage Cartier Panther handbag. Only because my mum had one. My, my dad bought my mum one years ago from the jewellers that I worked at. It was a special birthday, so he did really treat her. And, and you know, I have at home, and it's it's this. It's the buckle itself is that circle, oh, and it yeah. has the panther kind of wrapping yeah. over. You know what I'm talking about, yeah, yeah. don't you? Um, if this were Cartier, which obviously it's not, if this were Cartier, you would be talking about thousands of pounds. I don't know if Cartier have ever done anything with black jadeite, though. That's it. It's just a handbag, by the way. I wouldn't personally spend this money. That's it. Oh, yeah. That's, that's, that's the same bag. Yeah. It's not jadeite, though. <laughs> it's not jadeite. It's leather. It's leather. And it's lovely. It is very nice. And they've never changed that design, by the way. Yeah. So very Cartier inspired, instead of it being just a leather handbag, which let's be honest, it is just a handbag. Um, this is type A black Burmese jadeite. It has your beautiful 925 sterling silver panther, which has genuine zircon, not cubic zirconia, and also an amazing green onyx as his eye. Ah, oh, the craftsmanship that has gone into this panther. Look at the little, look, look, look at the black on his nose. He's stunningly beautiful, isn't he? The prowess, how you capture that prowess. A huge amount of precious metal invested into, in it as well. Now, there were only 40 ever commissioned. Sorry, 43. We have the final five. When was this launched? It's lovely. In the middle of the birthday, it's amazing. That is natural type A jade. That is solid sterling silver. That is zircon, genuine zircon, not cubic zirconia. Uh, and black jadeite giving you the panther spots. So designer. It, it just it immediately, immediately made me think of, 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 of Cartier, the panther yep. collection, which they do watches as well. Um, what was that, sorry? Oh, those earrings that we had on the weekend. Yes, they'd be perfect alongside that. Straight away, collectors getting involved. Well done, Melanie. I'd be all over these two. Lisa in Durham, Maker in Cumbria. I've got four left. So we're going to go straight down to that price point. It is type A, black jadeite. And the reality is, I don't know. I don't know this. I'm no expert on handbags. But a Cartier handbag, I don't think is going to appreciate, is it? Does it? I don't know. I know what definitely does do, though is a gemstone that is no longer. Does it? I don't know. Are they? Is that true? Handbags are. I, d I don't know. But here, one thing I do know is that this gemstone's no longer coming from the ground. £149 only. Pauline, Karen, Melanie, Maker, Melanie, Karen, Lisa, Cumbria. You saying that actually, Adam? Yes, um, Linda Brumwell, she does, she, she collects handbags, doesn't she? Oh. So, a smart investment. I did not know that. The final two opportunities, but we're super over allocated. You've got your split, split payments there as well. Um, 49 pounds and 66 pence. Make sure you check it out your basket. It's a big statement piece. Very, very inspired, I think, by Cartier. I love that Panther design. Well done, everybody, but do not go anywhere. I've got one left with 16 of you in your basket. It's, you know what, it won't, we won't be left with one, Ross, because I'll get it if there's one left, so don't worry. I'm all over that. It's amazing. Now, first time 
time ever in jewelry maker history since we've been sort of overcome with this amazing jadeite fever you know where we're so fortunate enough to be able to uh sort of well purchase gemstones that i never imagined now these are faceted into one of our newest cuts there are only 20 available by the way we've never bundled black jade out before and that is why there's only 20. it is a special mega deal price and i'm just going to take it off the bus so you can see just the volume of black jade out that you're getting remember what Sotheby's said look look at that sparkle even from here even from a distance look at that beautiful luster on the exterior obviously with black gemstones it is all down to the cutting and the carving and the polishing of them that's integral because if you have if it's not polished to a fine degree then you won't get this this light performance I mean look how amazing they are that's all completely and utterly natural Remember what one how you were saying, and that's not just about master carving. He was talking about jadeite as a whole, and it was specifically jadeite too. He said it's that wow factor, didn't he? He said about the quality. Remember also I've shown you that, that Cartier ring, the cabochon in the past, that was quite pretty, don't get me wrong, but didn't have that mirror-like luster, that wet look that we strive for. One how you of Sotheby's said... Approach jadeite jewellery not as a commodity, but rather as a work of art created by nature and shaped by human hands. Now, I think specifically there he's talking about the, the carvings. Yes. Specifically. Or is he? Because this is a work of art. Each and every single one of these produces this unprecedented luster. And I've seen black jadeite jewellery in many different um, high-end jewellers, Sotheby's, Bonhams, all of those places as well. And they don't have that surface luster that I have draped across the back of my hand. Yeah. This is natural. It's not coated. It's not dyed. It's type A certified. And for the first time, it's bundled. Now, how many did you say, Ross? There are 20 available today. Hmm. To say that we're lucky enough to own black jadeite is one thing. You know, we referred to it earlier on in the show, didn't we? They said, oh, piano black or imperial yes. black. Um, I like the descriptions of both of those, but it should look, it should have the, the, the deepest intensity and should physically feel like silk. Within one PowerPoint, or one, this PowerPoint, it talks about the wow factor of, of there we go. Oh. There, yeah. Yeah. Um, and I want to read this because it doesn't, I want to kind of, don't want you to just think this is about carving. It, for me, this is exceptional carving, effectively. What experts look for in an ideal stone is a certain wow factor, which may seem frustratingly imprecise for would-be collectors seeking a more concrete guidance. However, all of this makes sense when we approach jadeite jewellery not as commodities, but rather as a work of art, created by nature and shaped by human hands. Just as it's impossible to measure the splendour of impressionist landscape by canvas height um, and width or ratio of its colours, the beauty of jadeite in all its variety and complexity cannot be classified by a system of prescribed standards. Has this got that wow factor? Because for me, absolutely. Yeah. The luster is mirror-like. First time ever bringing you a bundle of 100 carats, 85 carats, 90 carats across all three strands. Each and every single one of those are 38 centimetres. We've never bundled it before, ever, because of the rarity. We can't replace black jade eye. No, and, and not sort of quite frivolously, oh, I tell you what, we'll take one of the rarest gemstones that is massively in the limelight now, here in the West more so than ever, but has been really around the world for, forever and a day. I tell you what, we're just going to bundle it, bundle it. You know, you bundle, I don't know, stationery. <laughs> you, that's what you bundle. Yeah. You don't bundle one of the world's rarest gemstones. We're at, th we're at what, sorry? That's £300 per strand. Wow. And you know that picture we had earlier of the of the black jadeite necklace with the turquoise in between? Yeah. That's normally what we would see on jadeite, that sort of finish, that sort of... Muted. Muted, yeah. But this is... This More is opaque. In a different uh, different level, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. And also, also, sorry, you were saying earlier about the saturation as well. When we first had 
black jadeite on the show, you could see that it was because black jadeite is a really, really dark green. Yes, it's not actually black. Yeah. So the first ones that we had, you could see that it was still green, but yeah. very, very dark. But this is like this is like jet black, isn't it? Jet, yes, absolutely. I think that's because this is Guatemalan. Mm -hmm. Guatemalan black jadeite. First time ever bundling it. Are you ready? There are only 20 though. I love the cuts of these. I can't keep my hand still because I just want to show off the luster. How about 300 pounds a strand for certified type A black jadeite, imperial black jadeite, or the whole bundle any type A black jade I bun oh my goodness me, that's a hundred pound strand. It's like you just buy one strand and get the other two for free. <laughs> basically. Basically, yeah. Uh, I, I, again, this is quite frankly, in the best possible way, a little bit irresponsible of us right now. We shouldn't bundle a gemstone as rare as this. You know, the reality is when you were looking, we were talking about that necklace earlier on with the turquoise dotted in between. You're so right, Monica. And I don't know if you've still got that, Roscoe, but you're so right to mention that. You can see it's an inferior quality. Yeah. Um, and you almost think, hang on a minute, they look so different. Uh, which is more desirable? Is it the other one? Is it the other one? No, no, I don't think so, because you've got more surface luster, more of that wow factor. Um, and again, it's talking about, what does it say? This luxurious and rare black jadeite jade necklace. Okay, right, luxurious and rare. That's what I'm looking at too. Um, but what I'm not looking at on that photograph is a black jadeite, which is like silk, which yeah. is what, again, Sotheby's refer to. It's quite muted. It's quite matte. And also that wet look you were, you're talking about as yeah. well. You know, is it just? Yes, yeah, it's, it's just a, just worlds apart. Two hundred and ninety nine pounds for all three strands. That's a hundred pound each. What? Oh. Can I just for a sec? This was not the closeout deal. Mm. I know it's a bundle. Already seven have confirmed, but they're so different as well because I need to show these individually. Use this time wisely to get yourself where you need to be to secure yours because we will not bundle black jadeite again. We can't. We can't replace it. You've got to remember that's three separate strands in one opportunity that could potentially be three separate auctions effectively. Um, and we can still command prices like this. Because that necklace, I don't know what it's sold for. I don't know, but it's not gonna be 299, is it? Look at the differences of what you're getting here. You've got the rondelles. How much? Five oh, and yeah. a half thousand pounds. But they're throwing the shipping for free. <laughs> Cheers, thanks for that. Thank you very much. There's the rondelles. Let me show you the next one. Here's the faceted rounds, which I absolutely love. I'd pay 299 for this. Absolutely love. And you get another one. Satellite. You get all three. Not £299. £249 only for certified natural type A imperial black do they have that wow factor absolutely I've just I've just made a comparison on live tele television saying yeah that's the same certified type A black jadeite necklace it's got turquoise accents which we you know we, we mentioned because of your deal of the day actually not because of this bundle look how let's uh, let's be honest there's no way near the quality in that necklace as what I have draped over the back of my hand right yeah. now. No way near that quality. Antoinette, West Midlands, Anne in Cardiff, Karen, all that glitter, Susan, Elizabeth, Anne, Carol, and Melanie, you're all there as well. In the West, they call it piano black. Here, we call it imperial black. I've sold four imperial black strands. They're far rarer than imperial strands, but a little bit more affordable. I mean, for these, even if you add in the, uh, the, the smaller turquoise strand, which mm. was 24.99, I think. Yeah. You're still under 300 pounds and you can make three of those necklaces from that. Yeah. There are nine left, Monica. 
Hmm. 25 people have got these in your baskets. Well, I don't think we'll ever be allowed to bundle the black jade out again. He said, is this your decision, Ross? Ross says, look, that was our closeout deal. He said, but I'm not quite happy. We want to sell a few more than this. He says, I want to sell them out. This is... But we can visually see you there. So maybe if we can, and we can't always, if we can take it lower, we will. So can you? He says, I shouldn't, but I will. There's nine left, though. There's 30 of you adding this to your basket. This is a shouldn't, but will, because we've bundled this on the for the first time ever. I don't think we'll be allowed to do it again. Why bundles? Why, why, why are bundles a big no-no when we're talking about jadeite? A, this is one of the most valuable. It's also one of our top-selling gemstones. We don't physically need to bundle it, is the point. We don't actually need to. But we are all about bringing you the best possible deals. Um, we can see you there, though. And let's just call this an experiment, shall we? It was an experiment. It's an experiment we knew we shouldn't have done, really. And also, I think the nice thing about the bundles is when we put three strands like this together in a bundle, you know that they're going to be the same sort of quality, the same, same look, the same. Uh, so they all go together. You know, if we were selling them th separately, then there might be variations in between. So if you want to make one piece of jewelry with all the same gemstones, but different cuts, different shapes, then a bundle is, is really helpful for that. As yeah, well. definitely. But you know what, Monica, we should have been 249 per strand. Oh, yeah. Uh, you know, a one-time opportunity, a one-time deal, a moment in history. Oh. Oh, that's the price of one. A really yeah. good price for one type A, imperial black jadeite strand. I think you've, you've got a saving on one and you've got the other two for free. I can't believe we just said that out loud. I can't believe we just said that out loud especially as we're showing you and i don't know what the clasp is i don't really care about the clasp with that one there um it's got a few of your turquoise little tiny beads dotted in between five thousand six hundred and twelve pound you know uh, it's, it's if you put this on that same first dibs website i know which one i'd go towards and the the writing next to it said that you sold four of them already or was is that, that right i think that was about something else oh, was it? yeah i think that was about something else but unbelievable. For me, I think you've got a saving on one strand, whichever one you want to pick, whichever one you want to single out, and you've got the other ones for free. Completely and utterly natural. Karen, Anne, West Midlands, Antoinette, Susan, Soraya, Carola, Jamati, hello to you, Chris, Pat, Patricia, Melanie, Catherine, Davinia. Absolutely unbelievable. Um, what's that there? Can I just read that there? It's so hard to make imperial black necklaces because the rough is so small, no large boulders. One strand could take ye 10 years, and that's obviously to uh, acquire the quantity. The last one I sold was $18,000 US dollars, but today that would sell for, um, wouldn't sell for less than 30. There we go. Yeah. And here we are, you know, very blase, myself I'm talking about right now, blase in bringing you um, bringing you a strand, which is a necklace, let's be honest. There's one left, and we just go, oh, it's like £199. There's one of the panther left as well. If you wanted to get hold of the panther, maybe suspend that from one of these beautiful chains. Absolutely unbelievable. Well done to those of you that managed to secure yours. It will be an on screen sellout for sure. Amazing. And I think that was a moment in history. Mm. We've got one more strand, though. Oh. A different cut again. A totally different cut. Very nice. One of the more expensive cuts. A beautiful cut. I'm talking about your amazing bicones, of course. Which we so rarely see in any gemstone, actually. True. Um... Oh, yes, I'd forgotten about that piece of jewellery, Ross. Mm -hmm. What makes dark jade highly valuable? I've read this to you before, and I want to read it to you again if I can. Um, we've spoken about it earlier on, haven't we? We've spoken about the fact that with jade, it isn't, technically speaking, black. Yeah. It is a variety of jade that takes three times longer 
than any other color saturation of this gemstone. And there is no way of recreating that. You know, certain gemstones you can heat treat, you can do different processes to actually achieve a, an overall color or saturation. With black jadeite, it is millions of years. That's the only way yeah. of actually uh, um, acquiring black jadeite. And it doesn't form in the big vast boulders that you see in most other colors. It forms in splint-like uh, sizes, almost less than the palm of your hand. Mm. So again, you heard in that, or, you know, that statement earlier on from one of our suppliers, to make a black jadeite necklace can take years because it's how it's mined, how it's actually produced by mother nature. And you have, let's not lose sight of that. That could be, that's your necklace, isn't it? That's what they're referring to. A strand is no different really, other than that it, it's actually been complete. But previously, Ross, we had that, what makes jadeite so highly valuable on the, on the slide that you were on earlier. With the Dolce & Gabbana one. There. And it says the reason dark jade is, is very rare is because it requires a long time and special conditions to form due to its natural chemical structure. We need to know the color here is not black, nor is it charcoal or gray. Dark ink color is not the natural base color in the universe. It takes a long time to grow from emerald green to deep black under the influence of cosmic rays. I like oh, the wording of that. Yeah. But it still carries the nature of a dark green under strong light. So technically speaking, um, a piece of truly authentic dark jade requires billions of years to form. It takes three times longer than all other colors of jade in the world, and it cannot be replicated. So take something that takes, they say billions. I'm going to err on the side of caution and say millions of years. And then say, okay, you've just bundled that. I expect to have to pay a premium for it, but here at Jewelry Maker, we've just bundled it, and now we're about to do another closeout deal. And also, we're going to bring you that potential for a full 360 necklace in a cut that is very, very, very wasteful. Do I have quantity? 60 available. All the pearls that we've brought you today, how amazing would this be alongside your pearls? I mean, 60 is not that many. No. No. That's you being complacent there a second. It's black jadeite. Yeah. I do it all the time as well. <laughs> it's black jadeite. We're lucky to have one. First dibs had one. Sorry, Ross, what did you just say? Oh. In a minute, we're going to bring this to air, but not before I show you this beautiful Dolce & Gabbana necklace that is very similar in its cut. There's a Dolce & Gabbana necklace on 18 karat gold made up of 46 individual black jade beads and around 13 black sapphires made in Italy. Three grand for that necklace. Yeah. Could you do the rosary link in to make that necklace? Absolutely. I know it's gold, but you could be inspired by and save yourself the thousands of pounds. Again, it's not the gold, it's not the sapphires, it's the black jade that the commands is, is the rarity here. In 29 seconds, we're going to make that 60 available and take it to an unbelievable savings price. One of the more wasteful of all cuts out there because they're quite Marquise-esque. You've got that dramatic angle. These are six millimeters in their size for those of you that are asking. Again, certified completely and utterly natural. Black jadeite. The, it takes the longest time, Mother Nature, to create black jadeite above all other colors of jadeite. Above your, uh, your imperial greens, above your lavenders, above your reds, above your honey yellows. We're bringing you certified totally and utterly natural. Just look at this luster. Wow. 90 carats of natural type A black jade bicones. They look stunning in that heavily beaded necklace earlier on, but you could also use them quite frivolously, maybe in a more Elsa Peretti inspired long line necklace. They tessellate, Monica. They do, yes. And can you see how the flashes they kind of draw your eye in sort of one direction? So if you... If you have a pendant, like the panther pendant, for example, then uh, this cut will also draw your eye down to the, to the pendant a bit more. They'd be beautiful with that panther. Absolutely, yes. At 499? Yeah. This is a pinch me moment, isn't it, really? Because 
Again, Dolce & Gabbana bringing it to you, far less a carat weight than what I have here, three grand. Um, we showed you first dibs showing that necklace, far inferior quality in black jadeite with turquoise, 5,000 pounds. And, and you know what? Every so often, people will say, well, why, why did you want to make a do it then? Why did you want to make a do it? If you can go and sell them at to, uh, you know, any of those establishments, those kind of price tags, why don't you do it? Because that would be going against the entire ethos of, ethos of this business. Um, I forget my words out. Steve Bennett started Gemporia thinking, look, I could source those gemstones and whack a 300, 400% markup on. That's what every jeweler does. But he didn't want to be every jeweler. He said, I'll, I'm going to sell them at small margins so that you reap the benefits. That's why, simple. Next price drop is not where we are closing. And it is ridiculous, says Ross. Do you know, we, I'm so grateful for that ethos because I wouldn't own the gemstones I do if it wasn't for the fact that Gemporia, Stroke Jewelry Maker, all under one umbrella, will bring you the rarest of the rare, type A, certified, natural, black jade, and bring it to you at double figure. I couldn't afford the, te I couldn't afford five and a half thousand pounds. But not even if, <laughs> that bundle, yes, was one hundred ninety-nine pounds. Yeah. Divide that by three. That's working out at sixty-six pounds and thirty-three pence for, per strand of type A. Seriously, though, that's like a pair of shoes. You know, you can buy shoes. Not running out of shoes. These are type A jadeites. And the only reason we could justify that price is because we were in a bundle. How about we better that price on this individual strand? Seriously, though. Only doing it on the back of the bundle, though. We should close above what's on your screens, to be all, all honest. But because we went to £66.33, we are going to better that on this single opportunity in a more wasteful cut as well. Again, you know... Let's never, ever, ever lose sight of the fact. And so we've got, we've got collectors who say, I've bought this gemstone, I've bought that gemstone, I've had it valued, I've sold it on, I've made this amount of profit. We hear it on a daily basis. That's what, you know, that's what's the beating heart of Jewelry Maker, to be truthful. You know, we do make these strands, uh, these gemstones, as physically affordable as we possibly can. So that you can, if you want to, go sell it, make profit, approach first dibs. How many times have you heard me say that? Make a piece of jewellery. And yes, I probably would go for the golds if I'm working with type A jadeite, speaking personally. And sell it on there. They'll sell it on your behalf. And when it does sell, I'm not saying it will happen overnight, you'll make significant profit. And please just share that with us. Let us know. If I had the talents of jewellery making that you do, that's precisely what I'd be doing. In four seconds, we are going lower than that £66.33 pence price tag that was working out in that bundle, each individual strand. This has got to be one of the lowest prices of Taipei Jadeite. And it's bicones as well. Oh, goodness me. £32 and 50 pence for bicones. Wow. And what you were saying earlier about if it wasn't for jewelry maker, you wouldn't have the gemstones at the prices that we have here. But even if you ignore the price, if it wasn't for Jewelry Maker, I wouldn't have any idea where to even find True. a strand of black jadeite. True. You know, I mean, unless you went to a store like Dolce & Gabbana or, or one of the um, more expensive designers where mm -hmm. you would find a finished piece of jewelry, but to, to buy some of the components that we have here at Jewelry Maker, I wouldn't even know where to begin to try and find I them. I wouldn't have the knowledge either. Exactly. If it wasn't for Gemporia and Jewelry Maker, I wouldn't have the knowledge of Black Jade. I wouldn't know that Type A, I need to get Type A. I wouldn't know about certain cuts. I wouldn't know, genuinely, and I've worked in jewelry stores for over half my life. I wouldn't have known the difference yeah. between one and the other. Um, yeah, that's or even, if you, or even if you bought a strand of Type A Jadeite somewhere else, how could you be sure that it that's what it was. Well, that's one of the things that Susie always says, why she won't buy jadeite from anywhere else, because you've got to be so careful with jadeite that's because it is so valuable and desired the world over. And that goes for a lot of the gemstones. Exactly, yeah. You do need to be mindful. You know that these are laboratory uh, certified. Make sure you check out 65 pounds 
outside of a bundle it's a big no-no and mind you bundling black jadeite that's a no-no in itself and carol sharon devon cardiff kathy yorkshire london amazing well done everybody do not go anywhere though because we've got still more amazing deals we've got a selection of sterling silver deals we're going to be quite fast and pacey leaning towards your wall of fame and draw happening at midday and then monica's awesome um awesome master class we'll be back after this Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. I generally don't know where time goes when we're in this studio, you know. Yeah. It goes so quickly. I mean, we're at half past 11, so we've only got an hour and a half on show and I've got loads to bring you. Yeah. So your masterclass coming up at 12 o'clock alongside your wall, uh, wall of fame. But also, you know that pearl tassel that I've been reaching for with sterling silver? We're bringing that in this, this, this sort of sterling oh, silver nice. showcase. Loads of silver deals. I do. 
So the sterling silver jade slider. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, very nice. How lovely is that? Do I get this too? All as one amazing, oh my goodness. And it is drilled by the way, so you can very easily attach to it. So this is one. I've got the tassel. I can see some sterling silver pegs. There's gonna be loads of sterling silver essentials coming up. I noticed our Carol was wearing this necklace the other day. She went on an outing that she went to see Elton John um, with oh, her husband. Oh, yeah. And she was wearing a necklace. It was, I think it was the gold version. I'm not sure, but I remember seeing the necklace. Should we start here? How beautiful is that amazing necklace? You've got your paper clip, which is all the rage right now. You've got genuine cultured pearls. Three grams of wow. solid 925 sterling silver. Yeah, I'm still standing. <laughs> Love Elton. Um, 39 pounds and 99 pence only. Should we go again? Yes. I would wear it like so, a little bit like the mulberry design that we showed a few yeah. days ago, having the toggle right at the front. £29.99 only. They are genuine culture pearls, and like I said, you've got over three grams of sterling silver. How designer oh, is this? Beautiful. Yeah, present to Carol. I'm sure it was this or something very, very similar that she wore when she went off to see Elton. And they're both, uh, there's her and her husband with their cheesy grins wearing the biggest Elton yeah, John glasses. <laughs> Obligatory, of course. You go to Elton John, you've got to wear glasses, haven't you? The big glasses. Okay. <laughs> 20 quid. Hmm. It's, look, it's luxury jewellery, this is. You go into it's Monica Veneda and try and find something like this for 20 pounds. Uh, you don't need to add anything to it, do you? It's no. beautiful. You go into Monica Veneda, you'd be adding a zero to the end of that, if not more. Yeah. If not more. Um, I, I don't have the time to do it now, I don't believe, anyway. Do I, Ross? Don't I? Do I have the quantity? How many have we got? We've got 50. Mm -hmm. So you know all those toggle necklaces that we've shown in the past? You know, you know, I don't think any of them were £20, were they? You know, there was Ralph Lauren, there was Mulberry, there was Tiffany's & Co. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm trying to remember all the different designs. Have we got those? Oh, he's on it, look. <laughs> Here we go, Tiffany's and Co. Mulberry. Yeah, honestly. Oh, nice. Love that. Ralph Lauren, eighty-nine the pounds. Amazing. Dior, three hundred eighty pounds. Uh, don't know, but it's one hundred sixty-eight pounds. Don't know, but it's a hundred pounds. Last. Oh, Sounds of Pearls, London. Lovely. Look at that, sixty-nine pounds. Oh. That's not bad, is it? Yeah. Not bad at all. Nineteen ninety-nine with us today. Um, amazing, amazing, amazing. Make sure you are checking out those uh, those baskets, everybody. We've got lots of sterling silver deals, and if we work fast and pricey together, I can bring you all the more. Um, yeah, you can wear that either way, can't you? We had fifty of those, so well done. Make sure you're checking out. And I've also got fifty of this next bundle too, um, which is. Oh, we did that close-out deal on that beautiful metallic pearl, didn't we? Yeah. I bought these. They were put, launched on our birthday, I think. They're the itty-bitty little pegs, which means they can also be connectors. It means they can yeah. also be earrings. That, that's a brilliant idea, though, to turn pearl into connectors, isn't it? Yeah. So if you had a round, not necessarily a half round, and instead, because they're smaller size, put it at either side of the drill of the pearl. There you go. It's a nice little connector. Yes. So some of your black jade arts could have been connectors. Yes. So that's a pound each. Sterling silver as well. Minute clock, fast and pacey deal, says Ross. I mean, We've got 50. 20 pieces in there. Gosh, 20 that's, pieces. That'll go a long but, way. You know, they don't have to be connectors. They can also absolutely be like your pendant. Of some course, people prefer course. a little delicate bail rather than the big large bail. Well, especially bales. for earrings and things, you yeah. know, because you don't want a big massive bail to overpower whatever it is that you're... Uh, using them with. Yeah, 100%. Um, if I had a... Have you got a loose stone there for a second? I'm just going to borrow one of yeah. these. I know that I know they're not genuine uh, genuine gemstones as such, but they're coming up... They're lovely, though. So if you, for a second, wanted to... Bear with. Come on, Elle. There you go. 
Yay. Glue it into place. You take the time to make sure yours is all central. But there you go. Glue it into place. You've just made a lovely pendant. Look how perfect that is. Oh, In 16 pretty. seconds, we're taking this even lower. I got these on the first time they were launched during the birthday celebration, and they are so easy to put together because I think because there's less sterling silver. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so it actually sits really beautifully and they still have, you know, still enough space there for you to put it directly onto a jump ring or maybe onto um, a wrap loop if you wanted. And it's got a really fine um, sort of post as well. So all your pearls with the smaller holes or all that should be able to fit on there. Oh, nice. It does look like a, a, a mellow pearl. £14.99. pence. We don't get these sterling silver bales very often. And when we do, they absolutely fly out the door. Um, yeah, I, I, it, it's simple gluing, isn't it? It is, yeah, with, with the uh, hyper cement that we had earlier. Yeah, oh. which we got that mischievous deal. Yeah, William's mischievous deal. <laughs> Just link them all together. Amazing. Holland, Jan, Anne, hello to you, Stephanie, Chantal, Heath, Maker, and West Midland, Sally, Tipperary, and new customer, Julian Beveridge. Hello, everybody. Nice to be with you. I hope you're all well. Hope you're enjoying the sunshine. I tell you what, loads of sunny deals in here. Do you know what this uh. Do you know what these are also great for if you make uh, polymer clay pendants? Ah, uh, yes. yes. Um, my little one was watching on YouTube, dreaded YouTube. Um, <laughs> my little one was watching this. Uh, um, I didn't mind her watching this. Normally, it, I'm like, oh, God, turn it off, Willow. Um, but there was this lady working with polymer clay, and she was making these little pieces of toast, these little ice Aww. creams. It was really cute. And they were all on bales like that, uh, just yeah. to make a little charm. That's a good idea. Yeah, you So you see? can bake them, couldn't you? Um, Would you bake the silver? Because they don't need a too high a temperature. Polymer no, clay. polymer clay is only 110 ish degrees, 130. So, so you, could maybe you probably bake. could, yeah. So just bake them into place. Or even if you just put a little hole and glue it afterwards. Well, if you yeah, don't make that exactly. Um, amazing, amazing, amazing. Here we are. Give you that back. Yeah. Um, fabulous. Well done, everybody. Yeah, I don't think sterling silver would melt at 130. I don't degrees, think so. Do I have what? Threaders? Uh, yeah. Oh, let's do the star on the moon. Oh, very oh these nice. are beautiful. Hang on. Oh. Hang on. Oh, no. Oh, no. Did they get tangled? Here we go. Shall I show you how these go? Because here's the star on the moons. While I hold that, will you untangle that one for me? Let me just show you. So they sit like this. That's how you wear them in the ear. How, I'm obviously only holding one, but I've got the stars. We're gonna do it in one prize crash. So you pull this part through your ear. And you get what? What am I missing? Oh yeah, there's another pair in here. Oh, two pairs. You just twist it in, yeah, it's really easy. So these are another thread earring. So you get the opposite, so you get the star and the moon. So I can show you all that sterling silver all that sterling silver <laughs> oh that's very nice aren't they beautiful see and i've got more than one hole so you can wear the two pairs oh at you the same could time. you could and you could probably pull it through a little bit more as well hang on there you go look at that under oh. 10 pounds that's for two beautiful pairs of earrings oh i'm gonna have to get that oh they're <laughs> lovely aren't they solid 925 sterling silver you've got that wonderful corkscrew um of precious metal on the reverse and yeah i just look just so you know the chain is meant to sit in your ear so it's soft enough to go through yeah. the piercing that's why i'm showing you there and it gives you that really beautiful movement too five pounds for a pair of sterling silver earrings you not only get these though you also get the smaller more delicate one which has a moon and a crescent i know we haven't got many of these left roscoe have we I was going to say, 26 available. Make sure you are checking out of your baskets, everyone, to guarantee. Jan, Tipperary, Cheshire, Karen, Beryl, Jan, hello to you, Karen, Antoinette, Julie, um, Caroline, Virginia, Yorkshire, amazing. Precious 925 sterling silver. And they're really comfortable to wear. Look, yeah. they're not going to go anywhere because you've got the chain part effectively sitting within the earlobe itself. Yeah, and you can decide how far you want to pull it. You could pull it right up to have a star on your ear. Yeah. Yeah, you could. Really easy to put on and off as well. Um, amazing, amazing, amazing. Let's do the other threaders. Is that what they're called, threaders? 
shredders. I feel like they could have called them something nicer. Because <laughs> they do remind me of the frog chocolate bar that we were just talking about. <laughs> Don't they? Yeah, delicious chocolate, yes, but... Oh, nice. Oh, they're pretty. I've not seen these before. You get the butterflies. Oh, that's so sweet. Oh, look. I would wear a butterfly and a, and a flower. Yes. So you could actually wear the two together. Yeah, because you can mix and match as well. I'm doing that. Sorry, my skin's dry. Here we are. Oh. Oh, look how pretty they are. I have, yeah. Unless the sun's making my earlobes dry out. Sorry about that. Don't worry, these are studio samples, everyone. Oh, look how pretty they are. Oh. <laughs> I've only looking at two pairs of beautiful earrings. <laughs> Caroline, Antoinette, Noreen, amazing. Beryl, Elizabeth, Georgia. Um, at £10 each. So, wait a second, a fiver. Five pounds. For a pair of sterling silver For a pair of sterling wow. silver earrings. Amazing, amazing. <laughs> Cheshire, uh, Caroline Suffolk, you're there as well. Really easy to wear, really beautiful. And again, I also think really safe. You know, sometimes like my little one, when, when she, mommy, please, can I wear some dangly earrings, what she calls them? Uh -huh. I'm always really worried about her putting them on. Whereas these, if they pull, then, you know, it's yeah. unlikely that they're actually going to cause her any injury because they will just sort of slide mm. out. Um, five pounds per pair, amazing. Would you go for both butterflies or would you do a butterfly and a flower? I'd wear all of them at the same time. Oh, nice, yeah. <laughs> How many times have you got your ears about three, pierced? About so. You've got three piercings. Yeah. yeah, they'd be lovely together. That'd be gorgeous movement, wouldn't they? Susan in Bristol, Linda, Valerie, hello to you, Cheshire, Caroline, Virginia, Ray, Jackie, Sharon, hello to you, Judith in Surrey. How many do we have, Roscoe? Only 40. Um, yeah, I'll move on. Well done, everybody. I want to bring you as many of these silver deals. I do have some extended chains to bring you next. We did say fast and pochy, fast and pochy. Um, oh, look. Oh, that's pretty. We haven't done a silver hour in a long time, have we? Um, okay, now there's 30 left of these. Yes, they're extender chains, which give you that finishing touch, don't they? Um, but they're also... We say it every time, that could be the potential, the beginning of a pair of earrings. Absolutely. You or just the, attach the it to a shepherd finish hook. of a pair of earrings. True, <laughs> you just, need to True. just attach it to a shepherd hook. Yeah. Um, because you've got those larger links, they're great if you want to attach things like your, yeah. uh, do bubble style designs. Six pounds and 99 pence only for your beautiful essential sterling silver. Um, extender chains they give you a two inch length obviously that means that if you've got maybe necklaces in your jewelry box or maybe to give you that offer uh, opportunity offer it to your customers yeah. look we I make it at 18 inches but if you put the extender chain on there you can potentially wear it at 20 and and so on and so on six pounds 99 wow. you know even if you said I don't know an extra tenner yeah. Or an extra fiver because you're actually getting two for six ninety nine. Yeah. Um, the final, the final few opportunities of these though, so make sure you are checking them out. Um, amazing. Speaking of butterflies. Oh. Oh, this is beautiful. Ah. Oh. You could also wear it asymmetrically and put it up on the side, couldn't you? You could. Start with the rose. Okay, hang on. Hang on. I need to readjust this then, hang on, because it's on the screw if. Have a, little, have a little look at the yellow for the time being. Sorry, Ross, this is all pulled through, so I don't want to, it's not going to sit right otherwise. Feed that through there. I'll get there in a second. Here we are. How beautiful is this? So you have your butterfly in flight. That gives you that amazing, amazing movement. So again, let me just do this up now. Again, these do come with a sterling silver chain. Butterflies are, 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 are transition, aren't they? They're, they symbol, symbolize transition. Oh, uh, yeah. And of course, summertime. And they do tend to be one of those um, creatures that... Oh God, I've done it the other side now. I really like how the, the connection points are not symmetrical, if you know what I mean. So yeah, so it is in flight, isn't it? Wing. Yeah. Um, how many do we have of these available then, Roscoe? 39 available, sorry. Okay, let's get to the yellow, that would be helpful. Um, here is that yellow, absolutely stunning. 
Now I've got 37 available. These are gold plated 925 sterling silver. And again, if you think of places like Alex Munro, if you get your rose or your yellow gold, um, then you pay a premium basically because it's precious metal on precious metal. Not the case here though. 12 pounds and 99 pence only for that beautiful butterfly in flight. Oh, interestingly, that butterfly is flying down. <laughs> whereas this butterfly that I have in the studio is up. They're so beautiful, aren't they? They are, they really are. And just to show you the end of this as well, because they do come with the bolt ring clasp and all that, also that extender. Um, mm -hmm. I'll bring you the silver to... Oh. Did I move it away? Sorry. I'll show you on the silver. Oh, yeah. 925, you've got the tag there as well. That's so pretty. It's really nice to have that little tag on there, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it's just another indication of luxury, isn't it, there? I mean, how giftable are these? £11.99 only. But, ah, oh, Ross says, no, you know what? It's been one of those days full of amazing deals. We've got quite a decent quantity of this one. I well, you know what? It's how that person saw it flying. Yeah. A collider. Oh, you could layer them together and turn it into a kaleidoscope necklace, couldn't you? You could, or you could take all the butterflies and put them on one necklace. That's a nice idea. Mix the colours up yes. together. That's a lovely idea, because they're quite Van Cleef, actually, with that beaded detail. Who wants this under £10 today? Under £10? To get hold of a beautiful 925 sterling silver, precious metal, amazing, amazing chain. Good luck, though. We had quantity, I heard Ross say. Good luck to you all. Make sure you're checking out in four seconds. It's going to happen under £10 only. Ah, one of the species of, of summer, I think, that everybody seems to... Everybody Absolutely. seems to naturally gravitate towards. Yeah. Yeah, they're so delicate, aren't they? Yeah, moths, dusty butterflies, that's what I always call them. <laughs> they are, aren't they? The dusty butterflies. But moths, moths' wings, I think, are slightly different, aren't they? They're not quite the same as butterflies. A little bit more robust. Yeah. Yeah. I can't, bit, I can't remember how it is, whether it's more pointy or less pointy, but... There's something different about a moth's wings. They're very clumsy yeah. moths, though, aren't yeah. they? Whereas the butterfly's much and more graceful. graceful. Yeah, yeah. The butterfly's graceful. Moths are a little bit do 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 Always bumping into things. <laughs> exactly. aren't they? For goodness sake. Just like, wait till I open the window, for goodness sake. do 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 uh, 9 99 only to get hold of your beautiful butterfly. That means you can get all three, all three colours for less than, what is it? Uh, less than forty pounds, basically, yeah. with significant change. Amazing, well done. It is busy this uh, this morning, so make sure you bear with our wonderful call centre team. We are squeezing as many sterling silver deals as we possibly can. Um, pretty butterflies, beautiful. Good for the garden, apparently not. And I've learned this from Mark, not the white cabbage one. All oh, right, is that but, not good? Uh, not so good, I don't oh, think. I Mark didn't, his expression said they weren't great for your garden. Oh, right. but, um, all the other, other butterflies are, I believe. I'm no expert. Um, now, coming up, I'm going to show you this because this is absolutely beautiful. Do you get all of this, Ross? Wow. So not only mm. this lovely sterling silver tassel, which also has that at the top, which I am guessing... <gasps> Oh, you piece it together like the most perfect puzzle. Wait, wait, wait. You've got this that sits on there. Oh. And you have the bale. If you want to use them separately, you can. So you put... Can you see that there? So you... I'll try and pop it on top. So you glue all this together. Come on. In you go. It's me trying to do it with tweezers, that's why. Oh. How amazing is that? I mean, obviously, very Vivian Westwood. Come on, balance. See if my balance can show you this. One sec. Oh, there we go. How amazing is that? It's coming up, but not yet. Not yet. Whoop. Um, okay, let's... Oh, bring you some beautiful sterling silver aquamarine earrings. 
Now, over 500 of these absolutely flew out during the birthday. Uh, I'm just going to get a white piece of paper to show you the aquamarine, because otherwise you don't really see it on the black. There we go. Um, glacial blue. Oh, oh right. my goodness me, look at those. Now, let's start at what? Under £10 for beautiful aquamarine. Look at that. You've got amazing clarity. These are 925 sterling silver, right? Yeah. Everything's sterling silver, and they come with a nice long post as well. Do you know, actually, that's highlighted something, which I never thought I'd say actually on air, but I'm gonna. I'm gonna roll with it. Um, one of my neighbours, she used to wear, uh, wear buy um, a lot of pieces of jewellery, but she used to say that she had quite fleshy lobes. Oh, right. So we used to struggle with ear, um, yeah. earrings because the posts were always too short. really short, yeah. Yeah, whereas these, definitely not. Look at the length oh, yeah. of those. Um, beautiful glacial blue, aquamarine. Look at that. Oh. It's like a crystal ball of colour, isn't it? How are we going even lower for genuine aquamarine and 925 sterling silver? How are we going any lower? A carrot and a half in each round, £7.49 only. Gosh. I mean, how beautiful are those? You, you'd struggle to get um, just base metal study yeah. earrings at that price point. And, you know, if you wanted to make a different looking piece of jewellery with that, you can just take a, a bee, whatever bead, a pearl or anything, put it on a head pin, make yeah. a loop at the top, yeah. and then go through the loop with the, with the post and then through your ear and then put yeah. the butterfly in the back and then you've got a little dangle on it as well. Oh, lovely. So you actually, yeah, yeah. And you yeah. can change them. A bit like those threader earrings. Yeah. Now, if you love those, we've also got them in malachite. Oh, My favourite. Love that malachite. Um, under £10 for Malachi, even though the likes of Shopard, Gucci, Van Cleef and Arpels, Lola Rose, even though all of those designers are very much throwing their weight behind Malachi, with 925 sterling silver, £6.99 oh, wow. pence only for beautiful Malachi stud earrings. I love this. And I think there's always times for you to drop earrings. But, you know, my, my normal day-to-day -day life, you know, particularly as I've got a two-year-old, you know, yeah. who would pull easier. earrings and things like that. But yeah. whereas something like this I could wear um, with comfort and also not worry about them sort of being pulled. If you do have multiple earrings, as you've just yeah. said earlier on, um, I mean, they'd I be lovely. The, the two top ones I have, which are studs, I sleep in those. I yeah. don't take them out. Yeah, I've got one on the top middle of my mm. ear and I always sleep in that as well. Sold out, well done. Amazing. Now we have got some other gemstone studs, but I'm going to bring you the tassel right now. Um, yeah, so keep an eye if you these stud earrings, if you absolutely love them and you wanted to create maybe if you've got multiple piercings, how nice would it be to have aquamarine, malachite, labradorite, etc. Okay. up here? How lovely. They're all on the website. This tassel is amazing though, and you can use it all together, which is what it's intended, or you can break it down. Um, and use it separately. It's entirely, entirely up to you. And I'm going to show you each component firstly because you get the pendant, which, oh, hang on. I'm quite glad that came out, to be honest, because I was holding it left. Right. You have this beautiful bale, which is encrusted on the bale. Oh, very nice. Look how beautiful that is. Goodness me. Then you have that amazing pearl with the halo of 925. So glue that into place, just like so. And then you have the tassel, which if I point that towards Ethan, can you see you have the, the peg there in the center? Yeah. There is a drill hole on the underside, which is what you glue, uh, you glue into place at the bottom. You get that perfect drop pendant which i'll try my hardest to redo again take the time let the glue bond and secure <laughs> this is lovely and it is oh yeah yeah it does look like it's part of sort of crown jewels um okay so let gravity do its thing i'm going to hold it here and you get an idea look at how beautiful this is oh that's a 12 millimeter round, genuine cultured pearl, beautiful seed pearls, a huge amount of sterling silver, a huge amount of sterling silver. To actually create this, it's not 
an easy task, is it, really? Yeah, and, um, and there's probably a full strand of pearls on there. Yeah. Of seed pearls, yeah. Because no. that's, how long is that? It's about a couple of inches long and yeah. you've got seven or eight. Of them in there. Yeah. Now that's topaz as well, Monica. We've got genuine topaz haloing that cultured pearl and also within your beautiful bale. Wow. There's how many, Ross? 50 available. Can you imagine these in earrings? And I know they'd be a bit big earrings, but um, that would look gorgeous with the black jade out by Coons. Oh, Absolutely. Yes. Oh, my goodness me. That would be amazing. And you know we did that pearl strand for like something silly like a tenor earlier on well, this morning. I was going to say, like a marla style necklace yeah, with some with of the, the jade, black jade out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> monochrome this tassel at the bottom pearls black jade I, how dreamy would that piece of jewelry be straight away we've got collectors getting involved and i have got the st a sterling silver chain to bring you as well if you wanted to wear uh, use that suspend it as is how many ross ross 50 Good luck, everybody. 50 available, but I know these are gonna fly out the door. They're absolutely beautiful. I mean, that's such luxurious jewelry. Oh, it's beautiful. And it takes it? a little bit of glue. Yeah. Love it. I don't know if gorgeous Dan, you've still got some of that black jade dye anywhere, have you? Oh, yeah. yeah, he says, yeah, yeah, I got it, one minute. But also, look how lovely that would be on some, ster just a simple oh, sterling nice. silver chain. You get the general gist, don't you? I'll pick it up ever so slightly. Yes, imagine that. How amazing. Already people getting involved. The suggestion from Tipperary. Yeah, that'll do. Alongside your lovely black jadeite bicones or the bundle that we had earlier on. Absolutely beautiful. Good luck, though, because we had 50. Already flying. They come in three separate components. So you do need to glue them into place. But if you wanted to do something different you don't have to use them all together so if you wanted to use and i'll show you you can use them individually if you wanted to use the tassel just like this yeah you can if you wanted to there's a pendant there as well look if you wanted to wear it very vivian westwood-esque awesome. just like so you might be thinking no well i'm going to use that bale because it is so beautifully decorative i'm going to use that with i don't know say a keshi pearl or something like that and i'm going to use that as a feature bead in a necklace oh you you know the the silver connectors we had earlier the yeah, pack oh, the of little 20. ones yeah you put one in each end and then you can nice. put that in the center of a of a sterling silver chain so mm. how about just a simple tassel well it's not even tassel is it it's like a mesh mesh tassel yeah okay that's nice 430 pounds with one single pearl. Here's another 18 karat white gold pearl and tass onyx tassel pendant. Okay, I'm not a fan of that personally. Um, 3,750 oh Mickey God. Moto. Okay. Okay, let's take this amazing tassel with all those pearls, which you said there's a good strand in I'll this. I'll say there's a strand on there, yeah. Yeah. And then you'd have to buy the big pearl uh, separately as well. All that sterling silver, ninety-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence, or you can use your not percent interest split payment. Um, okay, we've got fifty. If you love it, yeah, that's a, that's amazing. I was hoping you'd say something like this, Ross. Now, oh yes, don't forget pearl ten. I've got such a terrible memory. I really do. I can talk. How many times have I said pearl ten this morning? And I still forget. <laughs> yeah. um, Okay, I'm gonna, the next sentence that comes out of my mouth, I think it's gonna prompt a reaction. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> we are gonna get this amazing potential tassel pendant, potential multiple pendants, under 50, under 50 pounds, and you can still use your Pearl 10 code. I think the call screens and the website are going to absolutely light up by that because there's a huge amount of 925 sterling silver. You've got that big statement pearl, which is probably about 12 millimetres. And you've got your strand of seed pearls, which are quite literally like gold dust, aren't they? In a minute, we're going to take it there. Under £50, use this time wisely. If you love it, if you love it, it's simple gluing. I could do it on air. 
obviously, I w we haven't got the time to sit and wait for it to glue, but I could show you how you put that together on air. It's just a touch of your hypo cement yep. glue that we had earlier on. Leave it to? overnight. Job done, away you go. I think these sold out, didn't they? They did sell out. But use your little yeah. precision nozzle on top of the tassel yeah. um, <laughs> within the pearl and then set likewise with your bail. Away you go, you've just made luxury jewellery. In twenty, Not enough people on the phone lines, are there? No way near. The reason why we're including as many of these pearl deals is because it's the month of June and you can make the most of the pearl 10. Uh, code so you'll get an amazing show price but then you get a further discount because it's this month's birthstone i also love that um the band around the pole it makes it look even bigger doesn't it yeah it's very uh vivian west with yeah. that the halo quite because she has quite like an orbital d design doesn't she 49 pounds and 99 pence or 16 pounds wow. and 66 pence on your split payment but the reality is we've got a fiver off that price tag haven't you so we're talking about 44 really um and then obviously divide that for your split payments how amazing wow. what well, just shy of a gram and a half of sterling silver in this piece so there's a big investment of precious metal you've got a strand effectively of your seed pearls and you've got that big statement um i'm going to say about 12 millimeter round maker yeah. in tipperary vanessa angus hello to cheshire karen isle of man you're all there i only had 50 opportunities make sure you are checking out hello to you on the phone lines my call screen is on a go slow right now so um, but we do know that you are there check out use your pearl 10 code bring you as many sterling silver deals as we possibly can before your masterclass opportunity amazing 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 let's give you oh, that yeah. back because it's like gold dust yes. isn't it um okay let's do that beautiful slider bracelet that we had a few moments ago firstly i don't know what ross is going to take this to as of yet is it liam you wish you did, we didn't bring it? Why? Prices. <laughs> Hang on. Okay. Well, do you know, this jade, look at that. It's type A Burmese green jade. Eye. Look, you've got what looks beautiful. Big carrot weight. Really simplistic. But if I look, it cur it's curved to fit your wrist. Yeah. And if I turn it this way, you've got the drill holes there for you to attach to. So how does it, the drill hole comes out? That way. The end and the bottom. Yeah. Oh, that's clever. So, so can you so see? the front stays nice and smooth without any holes. So you could put a jump ring or wire through yeah. there, couldn't you? Yeah. Whichever you wish. Um, and it's going to sit and make something like that, basically. Eight millimeter type A jadeite rounds. And then that big, beautiful statement. Oh, it's beautiful. It is lovely, isn't it? Oh my gosh, you've got lavender colours in this. Yeah. That's lavender um, and floating flower in this. Look at that translucency as well. Now, $49.99 is our should be price. No way. That's floating flower, lavender. With that level of translucency. Look, if this was if this was if this was jadeite that was more opaque lacking in that glow and i was watching mason and Kay the other day they were talking about a lavender jade and they were like look at it jemmy look how it glows look how beautifully translucent that is and i can tell you honestly in my opinion it's no different to what you see here at jewelry maker 49.99 apparently is our should be price but then we have every so often well you shouldn't go on holiday ross to be honest can't go on holiday <laughs> It's, that is 925 sterling silver. Look, we're not going to mess around on this. No pantomime. We're not dilly-dallying. How, how many have we got? 50 available. If we sold that jade eye on its own, you know the bar, on its own, at that price tag, I'd be more than happy. You've got a big carrot weight here. Plus... You also have the sterling silver slider bracelet with those two eight millimeter jemmy beads. Look at that translucency. We're in the world of jadeite, stop the clock, stop the clock, stop the clock. Hang on a minute. Look, I need to emphasize this. The only reason we're going to the price point is, <laughs> hang on a minute. Sorry, because Liam took it to this price point and it is way lower than we should have gone. Ross was on holiday. So we had people fill his, fill his, fill your shoes, didn't we? 
<laughs> and Ross is saying, look, this is ridiculous at 49.99. So you can thank our lovely Liam for this. I agree. That bar of, of translucent, floating flower, natural type AJ dye. We're not talking about the four C's like diamonds here. We are talking about colour, translucency. Those are an artistry, really. Those are the main criteria of grading your jadeite. If you've got gemmy translucency, which they are, if you've got a beautiful natural colour, not B and C, which these are type A, should it be anywhere near double figures? No, categorically no. Restart the clock. Let's rewind. Take, take a few steps, moments back in time. Say, thank you very much, Liam. For this, <laughs> I'm talking about me now. Liam, thank you very much. But we shouldn't have done this. But we will make the most of the, off the price point that you took this to. And we will offer that same amazing deal to our viewers who are shopping this morning in 60 seconds. But, but it shouldn't have happened. Just we've made. We, yeah, that, that was me, by the way, throwing Liam under the bus with that. <laughs> yeah, that's what that was. I wasn't just practicing my rugby pass. That was me basically <laughs> saying, Liam, this shouldn't have happened. It's type age aid. The clock is ticking. We've got 50 available. We will match that price point purely because you, well, launched it far too low. The slice of, I say slice, it's a carved piece of it jade. Is, it is, it's that if I use my wrist, look, look how it fits on the skin. Look, if I oh, point that. Perfect. Look how beautifully that kind of caresses the curve of the wrist. Oh. Look how lovely that is. And just using some sterling silver wire or... Yeah, I would definitely make sort of like a rosary link um, at the end of it and then you can link it to the, um, to the jump rings on the chain. How beautiful. Should have been 49.99. Not where we are stopping though. You get the slider bracelet with your jadeite eight millimeters. You get that beautiful carved jadeite. I don't know how to describe it. Curved bar, that makes sense. Should have been 49.99. Thank you, Liam. Ooh, just had a thought. For the slider bracelet, that's a great price. Because that is so gemmy, that, trans that, that jadeite. I had a thought. You know the black jadeite bike cones we had earlier? Yes. If you made two rosary links on either side of that using the black jadeite yeah. bi cones and then use that to join the pendant onto the chain. Oh, beautiful. Mm. Look at the phone lines. They've gone completely nuts. 29.99. Crazy. If that was, let, let's, let's be honest, if that was a more abundant gemstone, let's name a few, amethyst. If everything here, $29.99, in a more abundant gemstone. Yeah. You know, jaspers. Really, I don't know. Ross is saying in my ear, he thinks that when we did the Grand Digirite slider bracelet, it was more, without the bar, it was just the round, so that it was more than what's on your screen. I don't, I don't know. But here we are doing jemmy jadeite, yeah. eight millimetre rounds, and also the type A jadeite bar. The South Sea Pearls were more. Okay, well, we're not running out of South Sea Pearls. We're not running out of South Sea Pearls. They're still expensive, but we're not running out of them. You know, we have run out of Burmese jadeite. Yeah. 29.99. Sally, Alan, Denise, Angela, mm. Pat, Susan, Lancashire, Tipperary, Karen, Jamati, Lynn, hello to you, Jane, Cambridgeshire, Anne, Sandra, hello to you, um, Diane, West Midlands, Wendy, Nancy, Kathy, congratulations as well. Uh, Camaria, what a pretty name. Make sure you are checking out. We had, what, 50? Camaria. It's um, also great if you don't want to wear a full jade eye bangle. Yes, um, which not everyone can. Yeah, but it still has the same sort of effect, doesn't of it? It's, it's almost like a section of a bangle. Exactly. Mm. You could break these components in two, effectively. You could use the bar elsewhere. You could use the slider bracelet elsewhere, whichever it is. How or, amazing. Or if you can get three of them okay. and join the three bars together. Oh, yeah. And have like a, like a sectional bracelet. That would be lovely. Make a full oh, bracelet yeah. out of it. And it's still less than £100, you know. Yeah. 
Amazing, amazing, amazing. Now, speaking of bangles, we have got the Brancaronics bangle coming your way. Um, also, Monica's amazing masterclass kits are available on pre-order. And we've got your Wall of Fame and the draw happening just after the break too. Make sure you are checking out your baskets on all of those sterling silver deals. That's a ridiculous price point. Thanks, Liam. Thank you, Liam. Should have been 49.99. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Um, but don't go anywhere. Yes, your masterclass is coming up and you're going to absolutely adore these kits. So beautiful. You've got beautiful little trays yes. full of colour. Lots of goodies. Lots of goodies <laughs> with Monica. Um, yeah, make sure you check out and we're back after this. <laughs> Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one P&P charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker.
Welcome back, everybody. And time for your incredible creations in the Wall of Fame. This is where we get, make a few of you a little bit jewelry maker richer by crediting, go, go, gadget arms, um, by crediting some money to your account. Now, um, starting us off this morning, this afternoon, sorry, I forget because we moved it back to the, to the later part of the day. Number 667 is Karen. Beautiful, beautiful Karen. You've done some amazing Mobius rings there. And Karen says, hi all. These fresh water culture pearls um, were all from Jewelry Maker in a pearl scoop. All very different, but the luster was so amazing. I had to try uh, to put them together. Here's the result. Using rose gold to make a Mobius link chain. Another one I don't want to to part with good luck to everyone i get that i get that karen i'm the same um with a lot of my pieces number 668 is from he melanie lovely melanie um and she says hi everybody at jewelry maker this is my entry for this week's wall of fame a chakra tree of life using all jewelry maker components chips and nuggets and silver plated wire hope you like them we certainly do absolutely beautiful love a tree of life number 669 is from molly hello to you molly oh hang on molly we'll see if we uh, tell you what shall i come back to come back to it yeah, um, we'll jump ahead and then come back, Molly. Uh, 670 is from Heather. Wow. Beautiful. Is that a bit of reticulation? That's amazing. It's an octopus. Wow. Heather, that's incredible. Um, and Heather says, hi, all at Jewelry Maker. Please find my entry to this week's Wall of Fame. Um, as it's so hot, I decided to raid the cooling Larimar stash and found this little beauty of a cabochon that I have had some time. Um, I paired it with silver clay octopus that I made a while ago and created a textured band to represent the sea. All jewellery maker products. Have a fab show and good luck to all the whoppers this week. Heather, that's amazing. Oh, I love the octopus. Gorgeous. Very, very cool. Um, number 671 is from Jade. Good morning to you, Jade. Um, Jade says, hi, jewellery maker. This week's entry to the Wall of Fame was a pair of earrings with white agate rounds and red onyx coins um, and also a red onyx faceted round. Good luck to everyone. They're beautiful. Loving those, Jade. Good luck to you. 672 is from Katura. Hello to you, Katura. Oh, love this. Um, you made that, didn't you? I did, And we yeah. were all like, oh, my goodness, that's the most amazing technique ever. Um, hello, all at jewelry maker and all the jewelry designers creators please find my entry um a be dependent inspired by monica Aww. pleased with the result all items are from jm hoping for a win and good luck to all number 673 is from sharon morning sharon ah it's a little french bulldog there as well <laughs> good morning my entry to the wall of fame is my carved french bulldog um who arrived this week from jewelry maker he is now ready for walkies with his collar on a leash the collar is made up of labradorite sources uh, best wishes everyone amazing love that oh. idea number 674 is from deborah hello to you deborah Oh, nice. love it absolutely love it your chakra colors um please find my offering to this week's wall of fame chakra extendable bracelet made with colored agate uh, bought from jewelry maker good luck all waffers 675 is from angela again very beautiful hello everybody this week's entry to the wall of fame is a necklace using size 11 sea beads crystals rondelles and bicones and dark gold shell pills good luck to all fellow waffers good luck to you as well number 676 is from gail hello gail again some lovely silver work there please find attached my entry to the wall of fame my first attempt at making a spinner ring i was a little nervous to start but happy with the results products are from jewelry maker and some guidance from youtube um good luck to all who enter in the wall of fame Do, have we managed to sort molly's okay Okay, but I assume Molly's number is in there, isn't it? Yeah, so Molly, I, we will try and show it in a few moments, but your number at 669 if you are watching right now. Okay, amazing. Right, Monica. Mm -mm. You do one and I do one. You do the winner. Okay. Go on. The winner of this week's Wall of Fame, making you £100 richer, credited to your jewellery maker account, is... Is... Oh, Ooh. there we go. Say... Six six five. Did we do that today? Not today. Isabel Morgan, congratulations. Oh, congratulations. You are our winner this week. Amazing. 
a hundred pounds being credited to your jewelry maker account how fabulous is that right then give it a good old whiz right let's have a look i think i've got one hang on Ooh. 648. Carol Vickers, oh, congratulations, you. you're our runner-up this week. Amazing! Yay. So get those entries sent in, everybody. You never know, you could be our next winner. Um, all you need to, the only stipulation of the Wall of Fame is that um, they are jewellery maker products. Amazing. Now, lots of you have already been shopping ahead on the uh, Masterclass, and I just want to do... a what? A second chance on the early bird, because it would go beautifully, actually, with Monica's kit. Yes, um, this is your rhodonite, which is totally natural. And if you weren't able to tune in bright and early, we were talking about um, the fact that this is like, oh, just like delicious strawberry ice cream all mixed together. <laughs> it's the wonderful <laughs> creaminess. Um, we started at 9.99, though, didn't we? And hundreds yeah. of these flew. Now, we don't often repeat our early bird. Because um, technically speaking, it should disappear off the website. Now, there's how many did you say? Less than 100 left. If you weren't watching, then you wouldn't know that we took it to under. Oh, yeah. yeah. Under five pounds. Oh, yeah. Sorry, Adam's just said it's a bit rhubarb and custard. I was just going to say, that's exactly the colour, isn't it? Rhubarb. Yeah, perfect. How delicious is rhubarb and custard? Oh, very nice. It's that top. With ice cream. Absolutely. I don't want to choose between the two. I need them both. Absolutely. Like stewed rhubarb, sugar, sprinkle of brown sugar, custard, custard ice cream. And ice cream. Oh, mm. my goodness me. <laughs> if you weren't able to tune in this morning, yes, we were like, oh, yeah, you know, talk, talk about like the Trevi fountains and places like that. And there's be like, no, it just reminds me of strawberry ice cream. <laughs> but even down to the little pips that you get within it. It's true, though. Monica's talking, trying to be all cultural, weren't you? What were you, what were you saying it's like? I was talking about the pink marble in, in the museums in France. <laughs> Stewed rhubarb. <laughs> Me too. It's, it's rhubarb picking season, isn't it? The problem is, every time I go rhubarb picking season, I end up with so much rhubarb, I end up doing crumbles for the entire street. <laughs> Um, the crumb, uh, yeah, Nick, I need more butter, I need more sugar, I keep sending the husband out, end up dishing out rhubarb crumbles up and down the street. But well, look at how beautiful it has, it has those wonderful colours. We were also saying, or joking aside, that we rarely ever get rhodonite. And when we do, it's so popular. It is a natural, beautiful, genuine gemstones. We don't have many of these available. Um, now, anyway, we started with over 200. There's a lot of multi-buyers and it's just delicious. You know, uh, uh, Monica, you said, look, there's a there's a baby pink and there's like a candy floss pink, isn't yeah. there? And then there's this, which is much more... Sophisticated, I think. Yes. Yeah. It, it's, 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 I don't know, much more of a natural pink colour. Does that yeah. make sense? It does, yeah. Yeah. Um, and I think it is the presence of that kind of apricot colour within four pounds and ninety nine pence only. We had uh, entering into the recap, if you like. Um, there's a big queue on the phone lines, but when we say big, how long's big? OK, it's about a minute and a half, not too bad. So our call centre will be there. Um, there's less than 50 remaining. Please do stay where they are. Our call centre will be with you as soon as they possibly can. Also, you know that sterling silver chain that I referenced earlier on that would go perfectly with the tassel? Is it this, Ross? We're doing this when? We're going to do it now quickly before your masterclass. Um, so stay where you are on the phone lines for this when you are getting answered, I can promise you that. So Maya, Maker, Barbara, Colleen, Elizabeth, uh, there's loads of you there. Please stay where you are, our call centre will get to you there, just literally a matter of seconds away. Right now for your 925 Sterling Silver Essential um, cable chain, um, spring lock is basically a bolt ring. Yep. by the way, not to confuse matters. Um, if you liked the idea of this on, on um, that tassel, or maybe if you're thinking about some of lovely Monica's beautiful jewellery as individual components, which we'll get to in a second, then now's the time. How many have I got? 50 available, 5 99 for a classic, a wow. solid 925 sterling silver chain. That's brilliant. It brilliant. really is, isn't it? That's like, when we say beyond wholesale, it really is. Yeah. Because normally to benefit from your wholesale prices, you have to buy a, a, you know, a, a percentage of them or yeah. a quantity of them. 
Um, and I've got experience of that because re actually recently um, I approached a, um, a company because I wanted to buy some gold class for some of the pills that I've been buying from Jewel yeah. Maker. I approached a company recently and I was like, oh, how much is this one, this one, this one? Because they didn't have the prices on the website. And they were like, oh, are you a jeweler? I was like, no. They said, well, unfortunately, these are for the trade only. So I couldn't even mm. buy them. They, oh, didn't, no. they <laughs> didn't want my money. Make sure you're checking out. I had 50 of these available. Um, an essential for sure. Well done, everybody. Okay, okay, okay. Your masterclass. Let me move that out of the way so we're not blocked it. Here we go. Now, your masterclass. These have all been available on pre order, but Monica, talk us through your jewelry. These are wow. These are fun kits. These are really, really fun kits. So, um, so hang on. Sorry, just because I wanted to interrupt. These are man made pearls, right? Glass pearls. Um, are they? Is that right? These ones, I don't think these ones are glass, the mermaid ones. Yeah. Are they? Flower shaped box, glass round, blue shade, glass round. I think they that's, are. No, that's those ones there. Those oh, okay. are glass. Ross, what are these pearls made of? They are glass. The mermaid ones. Yes. They're a lot lighter, though. But they're ombre. Oh. Mm. Oh, my goodness. Again, now let's show, because we can see on your amazing yeah. jewellery that they're actually jewel colours. They are, they are. Um, the mermaid ones are, are amazing colours. I mean, you can see why they're called mermaid kits, to be honest with you, because of the colours in the beads. Yeah. Um, and again, unfortunately, I had to add in some seed beads because I couldn't resist. Why not? <laughs> why not? So that's the one I'm going to show you how to do in the masterclass. And you've got that amazing mermaid clasp in the middle of the front. But also this pink one's mermaid? The pink, uh, the, yeah, the pink one is the other mermaid kit. It's the blue, blue mermaid kit. And then we've got the, uh, the sweetie bead kits which is that one there. Oh, I can't choose a favourite. And These then the one with amazing. the flowers in the front. These are all absolutely amazing. Now, they come with findings pack, but I think... Yes. Again, I know... Are they going to that price, Ross? Wow. Right, can I just show you something? Because from a distance... The world is... Sorry. No. Um, from a distance, I thought they were just one you know, one particular colour. But actually, I wonder if Ethan can pick this up. Yeah. If I tilt them towards you... It's like an ombre effect. Oh, my goodness. These are stunning. They, they really are. I now, these them. are all separate kits. Let me see if I can show you all of them. And you get... Hang on. I can't hold them all. Hang on. Let me put those down. And I've got... There's the blue, the blue as well. One. How amazing are these? They're so you've got four colourways. Yeah, and then and then you get the finding, a full findings pack with them and you get an extra mermaid clasp and you get a shell charm. Have you got... Can you show us the mermaid clasp? Yeah, you can see it in the centre here. Excuse you. Yeah, can you see? It's a, oh. there's, there's, her, there, uh, there's her head, and then that's her body going around, and then the tail is at the back there. She's amazing. Oh, then, yes. And then in the earrings, I've used the shells that come in those kits as well. So I've used the shells. Oh, she's two, doing a very, a very beauf, beautiful one of these, isn't she? Yeah. <laughs> she's diving backwards. Does that make sense? <laughs> she's doing one of those. Um, Teal first. These are stunning. Absolutely stunning. Now, they're all available on pre-order and they're all flying out as well. So, look, you also get these. You get a findings pack, which I'll tip that out, actually. Well, I think these came from the box because you get those in the box as well. Oh, OK. Four, so you get four millimetre, you get oh, is six that, millimetre. Is that you getting a few out to show us what they look like? OK, I get that. Um, right, so there's your toggle. There's your yeah, shepherd. Um, toggles. Because the findings pack are across, uh, the same across all of them. Yeah. So, um, you know you're getting those. But here it is. I wonder if I can open, uh, open it up. In the different sizes. So you get three different sizes and also yeah. that beautiful mermaid. Look at how lovely these are. I think it's 100 in each size. So you've got 300 beads in there. We get them, ah, oh, look at her. Can you see her there? She's diving backwards. Can you see? Oh, this way she's forward, isn't she, of course? Look at how beautiful she is. 
with your toggle and then there's that lovely clamshell. How cool are these kids? Oh, I love them. They're so much fun. The colours are the colours are fabulous, aren't they? It's like a, this one's like a little like it's like a um, watermelon tourmaline. Yeah, so, so that's, you the that's the white and the green. Yeah, that's your six millimetre, and then you get the eight millimetres as well. These are Which is great if you have the graduation, because there's so many different things you can do with the graduation of sizes. Amazing. Yeah, you get a mermaid in each of them. Yep. In each of shell. the colourways, and also a shell. And you get the three different sizes. So if I put the three sizes there, you get the idea. So there you go. Obviously, to this quantity. And the storage. Let's not forget, you also yep. get that storage. Um, how many do we have of the, each of these? Less than 100. I'm not surprised that you see Mayuki with these because they are of crying course. out for Mayuki, absolutely, I think. Absolutely, absolutely, yes. And well, I tried not to because it doesn't come in the kit. So this one, I didn't use any seed beads. Um, I used it in the blue. I only had the pink and the blue in this. Uh, 19 99 that's where we're starting, Monica. Wow. <laughs> I don't think people are just going to get one of these kits. I think they're going to choose to get maybe a mixture of the colours. They are all very different as well, which I really like. You've got this kind of green, green and pink, which is on your screens right now, described as teal. You've got a blue and pink. Then you've got a sort of a pink and bronze. And then you've got the darker blue. I'm not going to believe what. What? They've sold out. Wow. Look at our call screens. They've gone. Oh. Yeah. I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. So we just pack these back while you do no, the no, next one. No, <laughs> no, no. Do you know what I'm going to do? All, I'm, all of them have nearly sold out oh. on pre-order. Let's do the purples next to so guarantee your place. Oh, my goodness. You need to be quick on these. Oh, that's beautiful. It is. It is, isn't it? Absolutely beautiful. You need to be super quick on these. You get the filings pack. Just less than 100 and they've already almost sold out. Wow. Guarantee I'm not your place. I'm not surprised really. I mean, they, they really are fun. And there's so many beads in there. Look how lovely that is. I can't believe this for the toggle alone. For the beautiful mermaid and that lovely oh. ch clam charm, 40, sold out. Phone lines have gone nuts. I can't keep up with you. I really can't. <laughs> okay. Pinks. All I need to do is just move this around because you oh, get... Yeah. <laughs> and obviously, hang on, hang on. I need to... Sorry, Dan. Perhaps move those because that's confusing. Okay. For the dark, oh, that's pretty, isn't it? Oh, that's like rubellite and ruby, really. Well, that's the, this necklace here is made Oh, that, yeah. first price crash, 39 pounds and 99 pence. We've got a triple figure quantity of each of these and look how quickly, that's gonna be one of the fastest sellouts. Are we, are we ready? Half the stock's already gone. We're matching the price. We've seen how quickly the first two kits sold out. This isn't gonna be any different. Remember, we've got just, just, sorry, just under 100 of each of these. £14.99. Amazing. We've never done, to my knowledge anyway, this kind of ombre effect in a bead. It's yeah. so pretty. It, it is. It's, it's just, oh, it's, it's lush. So did you say they're, <laughs> they're quite lightweight? So they these are. are. Yeah, so these are lighter weight than the, uh, the, the sweetie ones that are coming up later. Yeah. Um, so that's why, which is great because you can use them really abundantly and still not have something heavy around yeah. your neck. Yeah. Um, Fourteen ninety nine. Goodness me! Again, you get that lovely mermaid and the clamshell. You get the findings pack, and this one's about that. I don't know how to describe these colours. It's more of a pink and a bronzy like yes. colour, isn't it? Um, beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Make sure you're checking out. I've still got another kit to bring you. There's less than 20 of this one. And then we're going to be diving into the blue. If you haven't already done so, I would encourage actually shopping ahead and um, pre-ordering because you've seen how quickly each and every single one of these kits have flo flown out the door today. There is, um, Monica, just in case you're wondering, our call screens is a little bit of a delay on them. So it's All not right. strictly speaking accurate right <laughs> now. Um, yeah. We've only got a handful of them left within the vault. Once they're gone, they're gone. I should already imagine. Again, this is this is how our, our, our the powers that be sort of gauge um, 
the desirability of component and the fact that these have sold out pretty much in seconds i'm not surprised um that they'll be re reordering i don't know what kind of colorways they can get this mm. one's all i think this is going to fly that would be interesting if they had lots more colorways yeah mm. how beautiful yeah, is the this blue, blue is Oh, I don't know which one's my favourite, actually. <laughs> I really can't. I do like that minty one. That's really nice. The green that we started with. Yeah. Oh, that was really pretty. I'd probably mix that, actually. Let's put the lid on with this one. I think they'd be oh, nice mixed yeah. together. And at 14 99 Very, very ocean-y, isn't it? Yeah. Those two together. I think at 14 99 that's doable, isn't it? £14.99. This one certainly is mo the most distinctive of that kind of uh, yes. bicolour or tricolour, yes. really, more accurately. Um, you get the mermaid toggle. You get also the beautiful clam. You get the findings pack within this. And let's not forget, you also get that lovely uh, sort of clamshell storage i'll keep you updated um on the quantity of those and then let me just give you a little sneaky peek of these that are coming on pre-order oh look at those they're beautiful yeah coming up on pre-order you can shop ahead on those as well so um and i would encourage shopping ahead on those monica talk us through your jewelry first because i feel like we need to see it all okay well um i started with this one actually because um you see a lot of these around at the moment and actually one of the ladies who came to my workshop also asked if, if i could do one of these at some point which is it's like a collar because i thought well this clasp has to be in the front uh, so yeah, actually that, like a blouse almost exactly so if i turn it around you'll see that there isn't a clasp at the back Oh, it just okay. carries on. You could put a clasp at the back if you wanted to make it adjustable, but uh, I just made it to fit around my neck, and then you just clasp it at the front, which is also great, again, because you don't have to fiddle around with a clasp at the back. Uh, and because you've got the graduated sizes in the beads, uh, this method works really well with it. And then I still have enough, had enough left over to make a bracelet and a pair of earrings as well. Mm -hmm. okay. Oh, look at those. They look so lovely. And when then, you put them individually, you can really see that patterning, can't you? Yeah, exactly. And then I took the shells from the two kits that I had and I, I made a pair of earrings with that. <laughs> Very nice. So which are you going to demo? Well, I'm going to show you the, the collar necklace. Perfect. And then the other one I did from these kits, uh, this one is just, that's just rosary linking, really. Yeah, um, what a statement piece that is. It is. But again, it's quite lightweight, so it, it doesn't feel as heavy as it looks no and i guess you could do the same across each of these whichever color way you wanted to be whether you want to use the yeah. sweetie colors as well yeah. you could do you could just pick your favorite color i'm gonna need to use the blue oh sorry yes i did ask used up every single one of the there blue beads <laughs> there you are right so uh in in the uh, finished necklace i used silver seed beads but i've got some blue ones here so because you might be able to see those better than the silver lined crystal ones and then you're going to need some of all three sizes of your beads. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. So I'll take some of those out. Right. So this is basically, um, actually, I'm going to bring it over so I can explain it a little bit. Right, so if I put it flat, that's what it looks like. It's basically a variation on the right angle weave. Okay, but you're graduating the sizes. The only difference is, so I made it in two sections really, that section and that section. So this is what happens on the side if you just carry on normally, but on this side you don't want it to come out like that because then the two points will touch in the middle. So you want to sort of cut away the, the center front a little bit. So uh, that's what I'm gonna show you how to do this section and how to do the, the sort of the fabric of this piece. Um, and then the back section here, I just played around with, uh, as I said, uh, to fit around my neck, just so that to make them the right lengths. And then in the front, I've just got a jump ring and I've got a little um, sort of tassel thing happening in the front here as a focal, okay? So to do the right angle weave section, you're gonna start with the four millimeter beads. Uh, use as much thread as you can uh, um, work with because you're gonna need quite a lot, so you'll need to join in anyway, okay? And then what you're going to do, to start off, you're going to pick up a seed bead, a four millimetre, a seed bead, a four millimetre, a seed bead, a four millimetre. Basically four of each of those. A seed bead and then another four millimetre. So you've got four seed beads and you've got four four millimetre, millimetre beads on there. And then you're going to bring those together, go through all of them again so you can tie them together into a circle. So go through all of them and bring them together into a knot. 
So I say it's a variation of the right angle weave because you're adding the seed beads in between. And the reason I, you need the seed beads in there, so I'm just trying a double knot here. The reason you need the seed beads in there is because I initially did it without the seed beads, but then the curve becomes too tight so it doesn't fit around your neck because it curves too much. That just depends on the size of the beads that you're using. So, um, and if there's a very slight variation in your beads, uh, so these are four, six, and eight, but if, if the middle one is, let's say, uh, six and a half, and the, and the bigger one is eight and a half, so even if there's a half a millimeter variation, um, which, especially with gemstones, uh, but other beads as well, you sometimes get a little bit of variation, so it's not exactly necessarily eight millimeter, that varies the curve that you get uh, when you're doing this technique. So it's a bit of trial and error to see um, if you need to put seed beads in there or if you can do it without the seed beads. So this one I needed to put the seed beads in. So now my knot is between a seed bead and a four millimeter. So I'm just gonna go through the four millimeter. So now my thread is coming out of the four millimeter. Okay, now I'm gonna carry on this right angle weave method. So I'm gonna pick up another seed bead, a four millimeter, a seed bead, a four millimeter, a seed bead. Now we're gonna pick up three of each, okay? So I've got three seed beads and three four millimeters. And then I'm gonna go through that same four millimeter in the same direction again as I did before, right? So I've got my second little loop there. Now I want to carry on with this um, kind of chain that I'm building, but I need to attach to this last four millimeter. So I'm gonna come all the way around these beads until I'm coming out of the four millimeter at the end. So if you're well practiced in um, right angle weave, then it's just the same thing except you're adding in your seed beads. Uh, but if you've never done it before, then you just need to follow what I'm doing. So I'm picking up the same thing again. Pick up three of each. One, one, one. So how many is that? That's three. And then three, so again, three four millimeters and three seed beads. And then again, the same bead I'm coming out of and I'm going through it in the same direction again. Okay. And then again, for the next one, I need to carry on from this bead at the end. So again, I'm gonna go around. Now notice that before my thread was going around clockwise. This time it's going around anti-clockwise. So my thread is coming out of the bottom of this bead. So I'm following that around through my beads. until I'm coming out of the four millimeter at the end of the row, okay? I'm just gonna do a couple more because I need to have a certain amount so I can show you the, the variation on the end. So I'll just do two more rounds and then I can do the next row. So again, you want three of each. Uh, yeah, uh, three. Have I done, did I miss one out? I did miss one out. You should have a seed bead at the beginning and the end. Sorry, when you pick up your three four millimeters, you need to start and finish with a seed bead. So you need to have four seed beads and you need to have uh, your four millimeters on there. So I'm missing a few seed beads here, but never mind. you get the idea now that I finally worked it out. <laughs> then I'm carrying on around again until I get to the last four millimeter again. So this is it's fairly simple, the first row. It's basically the same as your beady bead. Okay, so again, start with a seed bead and then pick up three of your four millimeters with a seed bead in between them. And finish, you want to finish with a seed bead as well. <coughs> so three and then the fourth one. And then again, through that last four millimeter. Okay, so for the next row, what you want to be doing Actually, I'm gonna do one, just one more round, if that's okay, quickly. So the same thing again, follow it around until you're coming out of the last one. I'm gonna need one more bead here. So again, start with a seed bead, three of your four millimeters, one, two, three, and then finish with a seed bead and again through that four millimeter that you're coming out of, okay? So now for my second row, I want to carry on underneath. So I want to come around 
until I'm coming out of, if I'm coming around, now I'm coming out of the last four millimeter at the end of the row, but I want to come out of this bottom one now. So I'm going to carry on around until I'm exiting that four millimeter bead there at the bottom. Okay. So now for my next row, I'm going to use my six millimeter beads. Okay. And I want to do exactly the same with a six millimeter. So first I need to grow it downwards so that I can carry on this way. So I'm going to pick up the same again. So start with a seed bead, then a six millimeter a seed bead, a six millimeter, a seed bead, and another six millimeter, and then another seed bead. So don't forget to finish with a seed bead as well. Okay. And then again, this four millimeter that I'm coming out of, I'm coming out of the left. So I'm going to come around in a circle and go through it in the same direction again. Okay. Now this is where we're going to, we're going to want to start to join it to this previous row. So my thread is coming out towards the left. So I'm going to follow this circle around until I'm coming out of this six millimeter, which is on the side that I want to continue in the direction of. So I'm just going through the next seed bead and the six millimeter. Okay. And now to do my next round of six millimeters, I'm going to start again with picking up a seed bead and a six millimeter. Now this time I only need two of my six millimeter beads and you'll see why but also start and finish with a seed bead. Okay. So now if you see the next round that I'm making, I've already got one of the six millimeters here and I've got the four millimeters here. Okay. So, so when you're going through them here, you just ignore the seed beads. You're only going through the larger beads here. So now I've picked up two six millimeters and I'm going to go through this four millimeter in the previous row. Okay. But now, if you see, I'm also missing my seed bead that goes between this four millimeter and this six millimeter. So now I'm going to pick up another seed bead and then I'm going to go down through this six millimeter. So that creates a little square of four seed beads in between your square of four larger beads. Okay. Now I'm going to carry on with my thread again through to this six millimeter, which is the last one in this bottom row. Okay, so through all my beads until I'm coming out of that six millimeter. Okay, now the next round we're doing in the opposite direction. So you see I've already, already got this, the four millimeter there in my next round and the six millimeter, but I'm missing the seed bead between those two. So I pick up a seed bead and then I go through the four millimeter. Okay, and then I'm going to pick up a seed bead and two of my six millimeters. Don't forget the seed beads in between. And the last seed bead. Oh. So seed bead, six millimeter, seed bead, six millimeter, seed bead. Okay, and then I'm carrying on around into this six millimeter bead here. Okay, now I need to carry on again to get to the six millimeter. Now I've already added in that seed bead when I started the circle. So now I don't need to add in another one. I just want to go through that seed bead through the four millimeter, through the next seed bead, and through the six millimeter. So now I'm coming out of the last six millimeter again. Okay. Then I want to do the same again. So start with a seed bead, and now I need my two six millimeters, which is going to be this size. Seed bead. I've got another six millimeter here. Okay. So again, I've got my two six millimeters with my three seed beads. And then this circle, I need to go this way around because my thread is coming down from that six millimeter. So I'm going through the four millimeter here, around in a circle. And then again, I haven't got my seed bead yet between those two. So pick up a seed bead, go down the six millimeter. Okay, so that's my circle finished again. And then I'm just gonna carry on again around to this six millimeter here. Now, the way that you achieve, uh, let me just come around here so that you can see. Right, so um, this you can see the curve starting to happen. So what you want on this end, if you carry on like this with your next row as well, uh, this side is going to grow outwards. Now this is going to be the center of my necklace and I don't want it to grow outwards like this because I need to leave a gap. So I need it to grow backwards. So all I'm going to do here is I'm going to finish one before the end. So I will do one more 
of those rounds, but then that will be the last one. And then I'm going to turn back to do the next round. And then I will just explain the rest of it quickly because it's quite um, straightforward. It's the same pattern continued all the way. So pick up a six and a C bead and a six and a C bead again, just as we did before. And then go through that six millimeter and a seed bead so that I can finish this up. No, I've already added this, that seed bead when I came around the first time. So now just follow it around, okay? And I'm going to ignore this last one. Can you see I've got one more round there? So I'm not gonna put one there because I want it to be cut away on this side. So I'm just gonna go around and I'm gonna move down to the next round. We're just gonna put the graphics on your screens for these other colors, if that's okay. Yes, sure. Um, so, um, so they're bringing the blues. Just gonna do one, yeah. Um, and then obviously you can chop ahead on the pinks as well. Ah, oh, those are fabulous. Well. That necklace that you've done, I love that, Monica. The big the bubble sort of style. bubble style, yeah. yeah, it's beautiful. 14 pounds and 99 pence. So you could mix these with the other colors as absolutely, well, couldn't absolutely. you? Absolutely, absolutely. Hey? So for example, this colorway, I'm oh, happily mixed with, with those. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah, because you've got shell pearls in the centre, but look how lovely they go together. Perfect. Oh. Should we do these under £10? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> yeah, they go perfectly alongside those. Have a little look, see if there's any of those available. I don't know, they did fly out. So, under £10. And then you can shop ahead on the pink as well. £9.99. Goodness oh me. Shop ahead on the pink too. So, how many do we have of each of these, Ross? 150, so I would, I'll keep you updated on the quantity. Ah, oh, perfect. Okay. So this is what I'm working on here now, you can see. So I've done the small section here, okay? So this is where I'm cutting away this bit in the front here. Yeah. So for my next row, what I want to do again, on this side, I want to skip the last one. So I want to start my next row under the second six millimeter here. Yeah. So I've come around, now I need to follow it around that way because I can't, there's no path going across this way. Um, straight across. So I need to follow it all the way around up to the top. Just follow. No, I can't see the hole in my seed bead. Oh, there it is. No, no, that's because I'm not supposed to go through that seed bead. It's only the first one and then through that, that one. Ross says we've got a big quantity on these. Ooh. Um, we're going to take it even lower. I don't know why. Lower than 9.99. No. Oh, I says, look, time's running out. We want them to sell out. We've got big quantity. Um, we need them to sell a little bit faster. This is how we encourage faster sales, effectively. Shop ahead on the pink too. We will match the price. So, okay, we're already talking about twenty pounds for the two of them, but we're getting giving you sort of money back into your pockets, effectively, with this. A big, big, big saving. See, the, this was interesting because when I looked at the purple flower, I wasn't sure about all the colours, especially because I'm not keen on green. But then I went and put them together and I love how it oh, looks I love together. that. That's my favourite. It's beautiful, yeah. I love that colourway. I think that's beautiful. This, that green is my favourite one. And then, of course, the pink one, I had to do something with flowers and tie something. Yes. <laughs> just all the flower colours. Beautiful. Shop ahead on the pink ones. They're coming up as well. They're available right now. Speak to our call centre. We'll match the price on the two of them. Uh, six ninety nine. Six ninety nine. Fourteen pounds <gasps> for the two of them. Wow. The phone lines have gone nuts. Yeah, <laughs> wow. absolutely. We've got quantity on both of them, so do grab the pinks as well because we'll match that price point. Okay. Okay, so I've come around, so now I'm coming out of this eight millimetre, the second one from the left. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to do the same again, but now for the next row, what I want to do is I want to pick up a six millimetre with your seed beads in between, then an eight millimetre, then your seed bead, and then a six millimetre again, and then your last seed bead. So for your third row, this is the combination that you need to pick up. Okay, and I'll show you in the necklace why in a minute. And then again, the same eight millimetre, oh, six millimetre you're coming out of, go through it again in the same direction. So this is gonna be the start of your third row. And then just as before, you wanna work your way around through all those beads until you get to the next bead where you want to carry on from. Okay, so just keep going around and around here. 
Okay, and then you're going to carry on as I did in the same way. And then if I switch to this quickly, I can just show you. So can you see my third row is this one here where I've got the sixes and the one eight at the bottom. Okay, so I'm going to carry on with that. So that's going to create this top row of eight millimeter beads here. Okay, and then for my last round coming back this way again, I'm just going to add three eight millimeters at the bottom. And that's how you get the graduation of the size. Um, and then I just, on this, uh, this side, I just did a little loop of seed beads to add a jump ring to add the clasp. Mm -hmm. And then on the other side, I had, um, I finished, well, I left my threads on the end. Uh, and then I just worked out how many beads to put in there to fit nicely around my neck. And, and that's it, really. It's just right angle weave. Wow, it's so beautiful, it's just though. It's because of the graduation of the size of the beads. That people yeah, that, uh, yeah. Uh, and it's actually working color. out how you create that perfect sort of fan effect. Now, the exactly. graphics on your screens are for the pink. So if you've been wanting this little set, then now is the time to call it £6.99. You can still get hold of the lovely purple, greens as well, blues. Um, that's working out. Set £14 for the two. I mean, that, gosh. Yeah, make sure you're amazing. checking out on those, though. Uh, they are glass round, six millimetre in their size. I'm going to leave that with you just because... I was racing by this afternoon um, and something I've had my eye on is this. Now, this is natural Bronca Onyx, Brazilian on Onyx. Um, what I love so much about, and I'm a big fan of your, your, your carved bangles, whether that be in Jadeite, Nephrite or Onyx or your uh, Sakura Agates, whichever it might be. But what I really like about this is it's slightly more slender. Oh, Does that yes. make sense? Um, so narrower, it's also one of the larger bangles as well. So if you've struggled with certain sizes of, um, of the jadeite ones, look at that beautiful translucency. We always talk about this location in the fact that, look, onyx isn't a new thing. Um, we can bring you onyx and we have brought you onyx and we will continue to bring you onyx. But um, this location, what was making it so, what was making it so exciting was the fact that it was opaque. Um, normally, whereas this, sorry, let me say that again, sorry, what, what's so exciting <laughs> is the fact that this is translucent, which ordinarily we see opaque bronchronics. Now, across the board on all of your bangles, £299 is our generic price. Yep. You're about to see why we were so desperate to squeeze it in this show. Didn't want to move, we didn't want to leave, say goodbye without bringing you your Bronca Onyx bangle. It's certified completely natural not opaque that's what was making this location this this the initial deposit so exciting was it has translucency and here we are bringing you the best quality i agree with you ross i can see why we wanted to make sure that we absolutely squeezed it in the show there are only 19 available let me just show you as well um so so beautiful i really like this one i'm tempted by this too and i like the fact that it is that little bit smaller um not smaller in size i mean in carrot weight um so it gives you a much dainty look i yes, really love yes. that 70 carats nicolette well done hello to lockerbie hello to mary in cambridge nice to see you there london's getting involved yeah our generic sort of i don't want to say blanket price because it does sometimes change but for bangles is normally about 299 pounds because yeah. whether it's sakura agate whether it's onyx whether it's jadeite you're still going to carve it and place it to the hands of the cut master carvers amazing let's do a few more slider bracelets as our as our finale deal um, so these actually work that way. You get a pack of four. They are silver. Going to go straight down to it. Yeah, they are 925 sterling silver. You get the four different colours. There they are. Straight down to it. It's our finale deal of the, of the day. £19.99. Oh, nice. But belong to Monica Veneda, who does call it bracelets like this. Oh, you could stamp on those as well, couldn't you? Yeah, you can absolutely. actually um, um, sort of put messages on there. Um, but yeah, Monica Veneda, they do a corded bracelet. You're still talking best part of three figures. Um, amazing, amazing, amazing. That's for all four of them as well. Now, everything that we have seen today, you can still get hold of the web um, on the web. So it's been absolutely fabulous. These, um, yes, diff are these the same or different? These are the bicones, right? That if you wanted to go alongside Monica's uh, masterclass, thank you, lovely. Oh, it's, it's been amazing pleasure. today. Yeah, it's been good fun. It's been really good <laughs> fun. I've loved your masterclass and also your nine oh. o'clock kit. Um, you can still just about get hold of Monica's masterclass, is that right? But they are getting very, very, very limited. The mermaid ones, we are talking single figure quantities. These ones just about still there. 
Two of them have actually sold out already. Um, I'm back with you tomorrow morning now. I'm going to be joined by Mark. We've got an absolutely amazing um, Thursday show. And Mark, oh, he did tell me, didn't he? He's got some really exciting kits. I can't remember which ones they are. My memory's gone blank. They're really bright colours. Yeah, well. beautiful, Pictures. bright. Yeah. Hematite, that's hematite, it. Ombre hematite. It, yeah. um, see you soon. Take care, yeah. lovely, and have a nice Bye. afternoon. <laughs>